Very important. Oh, that's lovely, isn't it? Oh, right, okay, so that's Easter Gonk there. That's all of that, all of that. How much was he? 39.99. You get your free um, knitting needles with that one. Right, then I'm going on to uh, Little Gonks next then. Hang on a second. I've got an awful lot going on around the back here. Gonk in yellow. These have been so popular already. Wow, 1999. Hang on, they go. Oh, 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 oh. So you get your free knitting. These are knitting, obviously. You get your free knitting needle. You get your white merino. You get your yellow merino. You get your stuffing. You get your instructions. You also get your wide eyed needle. Then, stuffing for his nose. Green and orange embroidery thread. And some orange felt. I'm those are for the um, carrots. Where? It's on, they're on the blue one. Oh. <laughs> I'll have to reach around to get that one. Right. Uh, there it is. There it is. Oh, look on the blue one. Right. So this, the, but that's the yellow one we're doing here. This is the yellow one. I've also got him in blue. No wonder these are popular. They're gorgeous. Hang on. Yet yeah, more and more people, aren't they, are doing decorations for their home to, to celebrate the different seasons. Also, Easter's a nice one because it's the start of spring and everything, yeah. isn't it? You see Mandy Shaw's house at, at Easter time. She goes crazy. So, in here, you get your free knitting needles. You get your instructions. You get your wide-eyed needle. You get your blue yarn. Or wool, this is. Your white. You get your felt, your embroidery thread for your carrot. You get your... What is that stuff for the nose? Morning, morning. Oh, I didn't think I was coming on then. Good morning. How are we? Uh, welcome to, what day is it? Thursday. Th oh, it's International Book Day today, isn't it? Uh, good morning, Claire. How are you, my love? Right, uh, let's start straight away. With it. This is Hobby Maker, second birthday, by the way. Um, let's start with the early bird. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm a bit uh, froggy this morning. Right, now these, I know I say every day, early birds, are we, we do something we shouldn't reduce. Uh, these shouldn't be being reduced. Comic boards, comic concept, co uh, it's the best way to keep your fabrics nice and neat and tidy in your stash and everything like that. Fold your fabrics around them, put them in your cupboard, put them on your stash, put them on your shelves. Crashing, big packet, little packet, this is the big packet. 11 99 you get 100 in there, you get 100 in there, that's how they arrive, all packaged up like that. 100 comic boards, I know. 
Uh, no, uh, Cousin Susan says good morning. Donna says good morning. How are you all, ladies and gentlemen? Uh, now, they're brilliant, these. They were obviously developed to, for keeping comics, right? But now, uh, uh, if you think of... Uh, we all show a picture of... I'm not going to show it today, but we show a picture of Anna's workroom with all of her fabrics all beautifully folded up with it. Oh, there you go. Anna in Coventry. It's an old picture. She put a new picture on Facebook, but she still hasn't tidied up yet. Uh, who else is there? Sue says good morning. Uh, Anna says good, Anne says good morning. Claire says we're up. Were you up late watching fun? No, I'm not watching it. Uh, morning, Jonathan. Oh no, I, it was. I thought the uh, I thought the opening um, show was rubbish. Absolute rubbish. Talk about Big Brother. This is my personal opinion, not the opinions of Sewing Street. Uh, I can't bother them, so I'm not, I can't stay up and watch. I stayed up and watched. Um, Great British Menu yesterday. Morning, gorgeous. Morning, Josephine, my love. How are you? Eleven ninety nine. Eleven ninety nine for a hundred. Get a hundred in there. Look, it's paid now. Once you bought this and checked out, that's your P and P paid for for the whole day. Beautiful. Keep going through. Keep going through. Keep going through. Laurie says good morning, John and team. Have a fantastic day. You too. Jill says good morning. I think I've done Violetta's, haven't I? Now, Hannah's got a bit of a cold today. And I'm, I have to say, last night I was a bit sneezy. And I thought it was because of my itchy nose during the day. But I'm feeling a little bit <laughs> this morning as well. Maybe it's this building. What's the matter, Charlie? 11 99 Keep going through, keep going through. 100 you get in here for £11.99. Yeah, lem sips all round in the gallery. I oh, I've got limbs. Hello, John from Australia, says April. Catherine says, good morning. I don't think I've got the black current ones. They've got the black current ones in the gallery. No, no, I'm not. I don't expect to have yours. I'm sure I've got a box of them somewhere. 11 99 Either I like the black current ones better than the lemon ones, I have to say. But they do make me a bit sleepy, so I don't think I should be taking one before a five-hour shift, should I, really? June says, good morning. You two are sleepy all the time. Well, no, uh, sleepy, grumpy, dozy. Yeah, what are the other ones? Happy? No, there's no happy in there. Doc? Don't know who that is. Don't, why, why was he different to all the others? Anyway, 11 99. Sally says, Good morning, John and team. Looking forward to spending the morning with you. Thank you, Sally. Denise says, Good morning, lovely. Wendy says, Good morning. Oh, lots of you there, say. I only watched the opening of the Big Brother house. Need different presenters. Oh, don't, don't, don't tell me about that. Love Fern, hope she does well, but I can't bother watching it. No, apparently, I can say this, because apparently last night she said, somebody said, oh, I hear Philip Schofield's coming in as a late entry. Well, if he comes in, I'm going, or something like that. Anyway, 11 99 I got so many messages on my WhatsApp this morning because obviously people were watching it. I was fast asleep in bed going, oh, what fancy saying that? Oh, what she say that for? I don't know what he's talking about. 11 99 Keep going through. It feels a bit big, this shirt now. Look. Need to move the room in here. But Angie, you see, if you don't do it for a couple of days, it, they kind of disappear, don't they? Anyway. Uh, keep going through. Well done. Now, if you don't want 100, just want to try it out, we've got a pack of 25. We have a pack of 25. Now, uh, price-wise, it's going to be same, same, isn't it? Goes to 2 99 this one. 2 99 for 25 of these. So if you just want to try it out, but you'll be so surprised at how many fabrics you've actually got. Um, 25 won't go anywhere. I'll bet you any money. Bet you any money. Morning, says Julie Vaughan. Loads going into baskets. Get this right and just try it out. Then, good morning, John, from an overcast Peterborough from Joy. <gasps> Joy, we were just talking about going to Peterborough for the day. Me and James. Uh, no, Jermaine James, not you, Hannah. You can come if you want. Uh, Loads says morning from Windsor as she's staying at the castle for the weekend. Catherine says morning, John, and the team. Jan says morning, gorgeous. Not a good start this morning. A full bottle of balsamic for you out of the cupboard and then a kick the dog bowl over trying to get the dog out while I cleared it up. Oh, Jan, I hate it when that happens. Oh, what would yours say there? Sorry, was, was, I'd, I'd done yours. Yeah. Oh, it's a joy one, yeah. Joy to the world. Da, da, da. Oh, that's a Christmas song. Shouldn't be singing that, should I? 2 99 Keep going through. <laughs> and the sniffs are getting worse. 
<laughs> they're very wet. Just so you know what I've got to mean. They're very, very wet sniffs. Morning, says Carol. Caroline, sorry. Lovely, £2.99. Beautiful. Right, we're going to move on. Do you want to look at today's menu? Here we go. Oh, now look at... Oh. Why is there a ball of wool at the bottom? This is our new rebranding, everybody. How much? Well, exactly. It's not the same, though. That's different to the one that's on the screen. Oh, OK, because the one on the screen looks got a sewing machine and a button, a heart-shaped button. Oh, OK, this is our new rebranding, just so you know. I wonder how much that cost. Anyway, quilting fabric bundles at 8 o'clock. Book deals with James Wheeler. It's still not there. From Search Press. From Search Press at 9 a.m. 10 o'clock, bag making essentials. Oh, got some lovely canvas in that hour. Uh, 11 o'clock, Shirley and Bruce are here with three brand new free motion rulers and the teddy bear one, which we had last uh, month, but uh, Shirley was rubbish at it last month. And then we've got Wadding and X-Ray back in. That's, they're on for an hour and a half. And then we've got a half an hour at the end with um, Waddings and XY backings. There are three ways you can get in touch. The first way is uh, email. Oh, let's up. Oh, oh. Studio at sayingstreet.com. Studio at sayingstreet.com. The second one is Facebook Live. Uh, that's, uh, yeah. And then the third one, go to the website, www.sayingstreet.com. Uh, go to the top right-hand corner, watch live. Uh, you'll see a little box with me on the left-hand side. And the right-hand side, there's a white box there. You can write your message. They're the ones that come on the bottom later. Um, Julie Vaughan does love a sewing book. J Julie Vaughan, I'll just tell you very quickly, we've not just got sewing books. We've got metal work books. We've got art books. We've got pebble, pebble painting. Pebble painting. We've got all sorts of things coming up. Uh, there was something else in that one there. It was pebble painting and pebble... Anyway, there's loads. There's loads. Lo oh, Debbie Shaw's brand new book. We're already starting to show this. And you're not even there. Right, here we go. So, there are two columns. Left-hand column will be uh, what you're seeing already. This is the right-hand column. Yeah, uh, Carolyn says, Morning, everyone. Have a great show. First free day off work, so I'll be watching all day. Susie Duncan says, Grey Sky's here. Oh, it's not here. It's lovely here. Carolyn says, and no, I've done that one. Uh, Hilary says, morning, John. Annie O says, morning, bright but cold, heading down to the beach. Uh, oh, Julie Vaughan loves pebble painting. Well, we've got two pebble painting books. We've got Rock. What was it called? Rock something. Oh, we'll see it in a minute. Here you go. Look, hang on. Keep going. So these books, right? Oh, I'm confused. Those, oh. No, I'm not confused. We've got deals. Two for 10, two for 12, two for 15, 30% off individuals. There's the metalworking one with the man off um, Rescue Parade. What's it called, that shop? What's that programme called he's off? Repair Shop, Repair Shop. I've never watched it. I saw the um, French and Saunders Mickey take of it. Anyway, I didn't, yeah, we missed the rock book. Sorry, it went too fast. Oh, I see, I see. Well, when we, that's why I was confused. So there's loads of books, but only one picture. Yeah. Anyway, lovely, lovely, lovely. Bag making, here's all the lovely canvases. Oh, one canvas. <laughs> Don't talk to me like that, Hannah. I'm not one of your children that you look after in Amsterdam. Oh, that was very patronising. Morning, John. Hope you're well, says Hina. Thank you, Hina. I'm very well, thank you. Carol says good morning. Uh, anyway, this is everything coming up today. Well, there you go. Here's Rutter's Pars Rulers. There's the Dew Drop. There's the Teddy Bear standing and sitting. There's three brand new ones today, and plus all your old favourites. Plus, if you've never joined in before, there's uh, Sissy's Stash Buster. Oh, we've got some horror films. Didn't see that. And this is the last hour. Yeah, what was it? Why was the horror fill in then? No. Oh, okay, they're all muddled up. Oh, oh, I don't know. We haven't got a tools out today. Anyway, there's everything from today. So, first hour bundles of gorgeous fabric. Where am I starting? Yeah, this one here is like daybreak or something like that. It's called, isn't it? 
Summer days makes you feel fine. So we like the jasmine. There's not three yellows. There you go. Yeah. 22.74. Uh, we'll have to watch Pa's Rulers as I might overcome my free motion fear. Oh, yeah, do it, Susie. Do it. 22.74. You get one, two, three, four, five, six. They're all half metres, so you get three metres in total. And they're already cut, so if you multi-buy... Oh, look at this. This is my shirt, look. It's my shirt. Um, uh, if you multi-buy, they're already cut into your half metre pieces. Beautiful. I need to keep my mug well hidden from um, Dan today, don't I? It's here. Oh, it's, well, no, we're not meant to take money off bundles this small. Half a metre for free. Half a metre for free. 18.95. Looks like you're hosting some weird bingo game with all the twos. But I mean, that's second birthday, isn't it? Did we take that down? Oh, no, we had quilts up yesterday. That's why you couldn't see them yesterday. Beautiful. Keep going through. Half a metre. Now they're all 44 inches wide. Machine washable. Quilting weight. Mind those balloons, Dan. Oh, have you just broken that archway? I'll have to tell Chloe on you. Oh, you're not supposed to be looking at me. Dad's just broken the archway of balloons. You look at him shaking his head. There he is, look. He's got a hat on, it's boiling in here. Right, 1895, keep going through, keep going through. Yeah, because how's Shirley going to fit in behind there with all those balloons? Oh, listen to him. Oh. Jackie Lewis. Oh, hello, Jackie. Were your ears burning yesterday? I was at a WI meeting and we ended up talking about Sewing Street and you. Now, um, I'm doing a talk at the WI tomorrow in Shottery. How's the cold water plunging? Uh, Debbie, it's still in its box. Because the first one arrived with holes in it. Uh, so they sent me a new one. I haven't, opened, I haven't had a chance to open the box yet, so I've not done it yet. 18.95. Keep going through. Don't you come near that cup. Three blues, two yellows and a white. Right, be careful, be careful, be careful. No, I've got, I've, uh, uh, what am I trying to say? In the teens, in the teens in this one. Beautiful. Lovely, keep going through for that one. I've got some one metre bundles. I have, uh, sadly, Magenta didn't arrive. Will do naturally see the cotton. This is a one metre piece. So they call it a bundle because it's two units. It's a one metre piece. What? Yeah, it's all joined up. But if you buy two, they don't come joined up. They're already cut into metre pieces, look. £7.58 for a metre of naturally seeded cotton. I need a hook just here. Oh. Anyway, £7.58 for one metre. That's two units, remember. Uh, Julie Vaughan loves blue and mustard together. Beautiful. Keep going through. £7.58. Lovely. 44 inches wide. Machine washable. Send someone for a sky hook. What does that mean? What's a sky hook? Oh, are you sure? We're going to 6 99 That was a bit of a late delay there. I was about to fold it up and put it away. Yeah. Are we doing what? Oh, yeah, yeah. Keep going through, remember, six ninety nine for half a metre. Oh, I forgot to send you the pictures. Never mind. Doesn't matter. Beautiful. Margaret, John, where do you get your energy from? Your workload must be enormous, Margaret. I don't know. <laughs> I've, I've put it down to my HRT and my collagen. That's what I'm putting it down to. Oh, yeah, tang my fabric off. But lo, the, 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 the ceiling is so high in here. It'd have to be a great big piece of rope to get down to me. In fact, there's still balloons up against the top, up against the ceiling. Somebody let them go earlier. 
Oh, I'm quite thirsty this morning. Beautiful. That's that one. I have got various light grey now. That's this one here. It's a metre piece, remember? There it is. I'll just pass that one to Dan. Well, well caught, Dan. Right, we're going to do exactly what we did to the last one. Taking it to 6 99 44 inches wide, machine washable, quilting weight, Rose and Hubble. It's, is it called silver? No, light grey. Light grey, light grey. Six ninety nine for a meter, brilliant price. You talk to yourself. Okay, that's fine. Just so we know. Beautiful. Keep going through for that one. Six ninety nine for a meter of your light grey fabric. Use it for a back of a quilt. Or little quilt. One of those quilts yesterday, they were popular, weren't they? Ah, well, they flew out. Gorgeous. You know the overhead over that, the other side of the studio? It's got a red light flashing on it. Is it meant to have? Okay. Oh, this one? I can't see this one. Oh, yes, yeah, there. Six ninety nine. My dad used to send his apprentice for sky hooks and left-handed screwdrivers. Oh, it was a joke. I thought a sky hook was a real thing. Sky hook goes with the glass hammer and the tartan paint. Usually send a new employee to look for them. I had no idea. I thought a sky hook was one that just came from the sky. There you go. There's me explaining how high the ceiling was. I bought a new hammer yesterday. No, not yesterday. Yeah, uh, no, not yesterday. Day before. Well, I think Danny the gardener stole mine. So I had to buy a new one. This is a great... A huge, I thought I'd just go to B&Q or DI, whatever the DIY shop is in Stratford, thinking they'd have, have a whole wall of hammers. How are you supposed to decide which one you want? Well, yeah, just hammering. At 6 99 They'll be in now, won't they? Oh, of course... Oh, of course. I, I, I think we've, I, I, I've sent James up there to talk to them. Oh, OK, that's fine. Right, that's fine. I forgot they weren't in today, Thursday. Beautiful, moving on. Colour next. Jade, red, cardinal, black and a peacock. And now I'm hoping this is the peacock one. There you go. You know where it's going. You know where it's going. Yeah, I'm just reading the um, auto-generated things. When did I say, if you multiply the cuttings? When did I say that? And it hasn't moved. I've said it for the last, like, five minutes. Yes. It must be my, my um, uh, what do they call Subtitles must be um, stuck. I'm going to just refresh them. More people in baskets than I've got of this one. Margaret says, good morning, John and team. Thank you, Margaret. Beautiful. Check out, check out, check out. Otherwise, you're going to miss out on that one. Cardinal. Metre bundle again, remember. The other Jan says, good morning, John and all. Morning, the other Jan. £7.58, no. Are you allowed to do that? No, because it's our core project. You're not supposed to mess with the core project. Yeah, £6.99 for a whole metre. Oh, it's, joined, it's come up to, it's come up to um, scratch now. It just says, are you meant to do that, Hannah? Oh, yeah, no. Lowe's just realised that lots of aeroplanes go over Windsor. Oh, it's constant. It's every two minutes in Windsor. When I used to live in Twickenham, my first flat in Twickenham, Concord used to go over twice a day. And it was so low, you could read the writing on the bottom of it, and it made all the windows rattle in the flat. But I loved it. Next one. Jade or black? Yeah, jade. Oh, OK. 
There you go, there's your jade. Six ninety nine. Uh, it shouldn't be six ninety nine. No, seven pound fifty eight. Thank you, because it says it there, scr scratched out. Yeah, beautiful. You get a whole meter. It's forty four inches wide, machine washable, quilting weight, Rose and Hubble. Six ninety nine. Brilliant price. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Gorgeous. Now the black one. There's an issue with the black one. A good issue, but an issue, right? Uh, so this is the black. You get a metre, look. I'll show you a metre. Beautiful. Metre of black fabric. You're going, yeah, 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 £7.58. No. I have no idea why. We started this. Well, we're not going to crash it then, are we? OK. So the others were £7.58. Mm -hmm. £5.99. Don't ask me. Don't ask me. Oh, that's a good picture. <laughs> Let me move it. I'll move it. I'll move it. Yeah, it's definitely black. Beautiful. They're, you're saving all that money off that. I don't know what, because they're 758, aren't they? They're meant to be 758. So I don't know why that's come up. Yeah. Oh, I see you. They're already taking a pound off. And we're taking another 99p off. I wonder why there's a pound off that one then. That'll be Haley. Beautiful. How often do you need black? Ever? Always. Always. Meter, a whole meter, remember, look. Whole meter, they go, look. Quarter of the stock's gone. Beautiful. I don't know why. I don't know why. Five ninety nine. Oh, what was that? What was that? Over half the stock's gone. Be careful. Be careful. Of, of today's stock's gone. When it sells out, we have to wait for Barry to replen it, and Barry's on his holidays. I wonder where he's gone. Uh, Layla says, morning, gorgeous John. Love your shirt. Thank you. It's a bit big for me, this one. I should take it in, really, shouldn't I? Trouble is, I did that years ago, not this morning. I lost a lot of weight, so I put low... Uh, not that I've lost weight now, put weight on, but um, I took all my shirts in and then put all the weight back on, so I had to sit and unpick them all. 5 99 Eh... Keep going through, keep going through. Thanks, Dan. Well caught. Right. OK, right, OK. So now, you know that um, I've now launched my John Scott Threads of Life. If you've never seen it before, then I've got a little film here. Have you got an introduction, Charlie? We'll just... And this has got sound, doesn't it, this one? This has got sound. We'll put some graphics. It needs graphics in because it's graphic-friendly, the film. Yeah. There you go. Right, have a look at this introduction film. Welcome to John Scott's Threads of Life, my exciting video platform and online community that is already being enjoyed by thousands of happy members. When you sign up, you'll be able to enjoy hours and hours of exclusive TV shows covering everything from sew masterclasses and designer interviews to my fascinating life story and candid celebrity chats. Over the course of your 12-month membership, you'll be able to indulge in over 100 hours of fabulous video content that you can watch on demand when and where you want, either on your PC or via a free members app for mobile and tablet devices. Not only that, but you'll have access to a safe and inviting community forum where you can chat with myself and other like-minded members about anything that's on your mind. There's so much on offer when you become a member, so don't wait. Sign up today and join me on this exciting journey of John Scott's Threads of Life. So what it is, it's like, it's like a little mini Netflix, right? It's not a live show, so they're all pre-recorded. Uh, for your 99.99, you get 100, at least 120 shows, right? At least 120 shows. That works out at less than £2 a week, remember? Less than two, how much would you pay on coffee? Pay for coffee and thing. Now, you can, I, I'll be, I'm totally upfront with you. You can buy it directly from me, but you have to pay your 99 99 in one go, right? Here, 
you can have it on split pay. Now, it's only available here till tomorrow. At the end of the show tomorrow, it won't be available here anymore. So if you're thinking of buying it and getting on the split pay at Sussing Street, you've got till the end of tomorrow to do that, right? So what happens is, is if you buy that today, Daniel, who's my, like, my business partner, who's the producer and director of all the shows and everything, he gets an email from the call centre up there saying, these people have bought it. You will then get an email. So it's really, really important that we have your email address when you order it. If you're buying on the phone, make sure you give them the email address, right? He then sends you your login details for you to get onto the site, right? So what you then do, I'm just going to pick this up because I can show you the site on my, on my, uh, on my iPad in a minute. Um, what you can do is uh, he will also send you the link for an app, both on Apple and on Android. We had a few issues with the Android one to begin with, but it's all up and running now. So you can watch it on the go. You can download the episodes. Of, uh, you can download all the episodes and take them with you. So if you've got to go on an aeroplane, got to go somewhere where there's no Wi-Fi, you can download and watch them. There's a community that you can... Well, let me show you, right? So this is what... Oh, look, I've got them at Donald's. I'll just press on this. There's the, this is the app, right? So this is what it looks like on your iPad. Let me just get it. There you go. This is what it looks like on your iPad. This is you browsing the shows and everything. So every Monday, Wednesday and Friday at 2 o'clock, a new show is downloaded. But all of these are already there. So you can see this. So we, what we've got here is we've got uh, John Scott's Life Story. That's once a month. We've got Meet the Designer, that's once a week. We've got Behind the Scenes, which is where a camera crew follows me for the day. We've got uh, Loose Threads, which is our take on Loose Women. And I'm going to give you an exclusive. Vix is coming to film some next week. So Vix is going to be on that. We've got Rebecca Harrison doing... So Look, we've got Rebecca Harrison doing... Um, this is this week's Commercial Patterns and Period Clothing with Rebecca Harrison. You can watch them as many times... That's just the opening there. You can watch it as many times as you like. Oh! Don't know what that is. Uh, you can watch as many times as you like, where you like. We've got Meet the Designers here. We've got Wendy Orlando, Lara Sparks, Mandy Shaw, Sewing Surgery, which is all the... the uh, Joe Carter does a, a foundation paper piece. We do Fitting a Twirl, Rebecca Harrison. We've done Felt Animals with Alison Reed. There's all your loose threads ones there. You're behind the scenes. The A-list is where... There's Cheryl. Look, Cheryl Baker from Bucks Fizz. Julie Peasgood. We'll be me mentioning her in the next show, actually. Uh, we've got a sew-along. Sandy Chocolate Chip Cookies come to a live sew-along on March the 21st. My brother, Dr. Mike Surgery, you can send in your medical questions and he answers your medical questions. This is like the bloopers. This is things that I've done in the past and everything like that. So what happens is you pay your subscription and then you get a whole year's worth of shows and everything like that. Right, let me... What's the next thing you've got, Charlie, though? Show montage next. Look at this show montage next. <laughs> Every week, you'll be able to enjoy brand new shows released every Monday, Wednesday and Friday that you can watch on demand at a time that suits you. And here's just a small flavour of what you can expect. The Sewing Surgery is your weekly destination for in-depth tutorials and masterclasses as I'm joined by some of the most talented guest experts to cover everything from dressmaking and patchwork to quilting and toy making. John Scott's Life Story is an intimate one-on-one -on -one interview series where every month we chronologically delve into my six-decade journey with never-before-seen photos and stories. Meet the Designer is a show where I travel the length and breadth of the country to sit down with some of your favourite faces. Loose Threads is our weekly topical talk show where I'm joined on the sofa by a panel of fabulous guests as we let our hair down and tackle some of the lighter stories making the headlines with a few laughs along the way. Behind the Scenes offers you a monthly front row seat as you get the chance to follow me for the day to see what happens in front of and behind the cameras. Join me on the red carpet in the A-list where I serve up big-name celebrity interviews for candid chats with stars of stage and screen. Dr. Max Surgery is your go-to show for any medical questions and dilemmas as we take your calls and tackle your emails to offer free and independent advice. We'll be hosting live sew-alongs where you'll be able to join in from home, share your makes and ask any questions as we get crafty together. Plus, you'll receive an exclusive invite to a members-only live chat where every month we'll get together for a good old catch-up and put the world to rights. So don't miss out. There's so many amazing shows available when you become a member of John Scott's Threads of Life.
Derek's just popped in before he goes to his first class. Derek, I've got this. Have a look. Have a look. Who, uh, Alex. Good morning, Alex. How are you? Shouldn't you have a Zoom class going or whatever? It's keep fit Zoom class. It's my personal trainer. Right. What you get for your 12 months is this. Look, you get your exclusive new video content every week. You get exclusive live streams, uh, which is where I do a live chat to you all. Exclusive online community, which is completely safe. You can chat to all the others, do pictures and everything. Exclusive competitions, right? We just had one competition where one person... Uh, won over a thousand pounds worth of goodies and you can do it on a mobile and app app and on you you can even cast it on i do this but that's not casting Ow. you can cast it onto your telly and everything have a look at this very quickly right so these are some of the designers that you're likely to see on meet the designer uh there's no audio on this one so i can talk you through it's delphine we're at delphine's last week then lisa lamb's lovely house there gorgeous staircase she's got then mark francis Oh, no, uh, there you go. Uh, Wendy Orlando. Hers has been very, very popular. She's been on already. Adam. We were at Adam's last week. Uh, Mandy Shaw. She does swear in hers, just to warn you. Uh, then we've got Hayley Westlock in her kitchen with a big bottle of gin behind her head. We show that. Fiona Hesford. That whole cupboard was gin, by the way, not just one. Uh, Liz. Liz Holpin from um, uh, uh, Quilters, Long Arm Quilters. Jenny Jackson in her new thing. Now, you won't know her. Claire Sharrett. She used to be a prima ballerina. Uh, Jules, uh, Jules Fallon there. Uh, uh, oh, no, Sarah Brangwin. We love Sarah Brangwin. And then Lara Sparks, you won't know her. She's brilliant. She's absolutely brilliant. Sussex seamstress, look, Jane. That's a Sussex seamstress. Yeah, Clive. Clive in his colourful clothes. Uh, that's, that, that's all of that. Right, I'm going to show you one more thing before we go. Uh, I've got four of these, but I'm not going to show all four. Just things that people, what people have said about this. This is just one of them, right? Kate says, I'm so glad I signed up for John Scott's Threads of Life. I love all the different elements, especially the sewing surgery, and lovely to just hear the chat in Meet the Designer. A brilliant start. Thanks, John and Daniel, for making this happen. Morag says, all content is well worth watching. Wonderful variety of guests and plenty to learn from instructional shows. Absolutely brilliant. Well done. All I can ask is keep it going. I am hooked. And Susan says, I absolutely love it. Had to stop myself from watching everything in one day. Looking forward to the exciting things still to come. So, new shows. The, what, what day is it? It's Thursday. Oh, there must be a new one. Must have gone on yesterday at two o'clock. There'll be a new one tomorrow at two o'clock and everything. So, basically, what you need to do is once you've bought it here, you'll get an email from Daniel with your login, uh, and that will also give you the app, the link to the app, and everything like that. And then you just, and now everything's on there all the time. See, if you can't sleep in the middle of the night, you can open up then. It's not a live show, it, and they're all there. So, if you join today, even though it's been going for three weeks now or a month now, now, you get to see everything that's already on there. It's not like, oh, you've started today, you can only start watching today. You get to watch everything and you can watch them as many times as you like. It's a real, I, I know I can't say this, well, I can. It's brilliant. It's absolutely, it's exhausting. It's absolutely exhausting for us to make. But every day we're developing new things. My friend Francesca is going to do Francesca's Italian kitchen. But that's, we've got to wait for the kitchen to be built. Um, and then we're going to do a baking section. We're still looking for a baker. I've, I've got a few phone calls to make uh, 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 over the weekend. Uh, and there's all sorts of going to, new things are going to be happening all the time. So it's well, well worth joining, up, joining in. And it's like a community. Everyone chats to each other as well. Right, that's John Scott's Threads of Life. Thank you very much indeed. Oh, and after tomorrow, at midnight tomorrow, it won't be available here anymore. So after tomorrow night, that's Friday night at midnight, it'll disappear. I love John Scott's Threads of Life worth every penny from Leslie. Thank you, Leslie, my love. Thank you. Right, shall we get on? Yeah, where are we moving to now, though? Lots of people coming through. Keep coming through. Keep checking out. I'll remind you about it again later on in the day. And I'll definitely remind you about it tomorrow, because tomorrow will be the last day it's on. Two half-metre bundles, yes. 59, 58. These should be £7.58. Right, OK, so where are we going? Two yellows first. Lemon and buttercup. They're already, they're already cut. £6.58. There you go. That's your price. Congratulations, John, says that uh, crazy rain. Thank you. Uh, Fran says, I love uh, Threads of Life. Download something to watch on my journey today. Anne says, morning, John. Nice to see you this morning. You are amazing. Oh, thank you, Anne. You're very kind. Uh, beautiful. Keep going through with this one. See, Alex, my personal trainer, is watching. Shouldn't he be doing a class? Shouldn't he be teaching someone to be fit? At £6.58, half a metre of buttercup, half a metre of your lemon. Le lemon. Beautiful. 
Beautiful now. Lemon and buttercup fabric. Well done. I think there might be a row erupting in a minute. Beautiful. Keep going through for your lemon and buttercup. Moving on. Two. Okay, I've got cloud and chambray, I think that one is. Now, they look very close together. They're, they're, they're very tonal. Uh, 6 58 that's your price. It's already been reduced for you because we know it should be 7 58 don't we? Cloud and chambray. 100% cotton. I'll do that at uh, 10 o'clock. Yeah, yeah. Pam Minihani, good morning. £6.58. Okay. Beautiful. Moving on. I've now got marine and royal, I'd say they were. Very close again in colour. Royal, royal. Da -ba -da 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 -ba -dum -bum. What's that song? Royal, royal. It's what? Lord? Who's that? I've never heard of her. Have I? I've heard the song. I know the song. I would have thought it was Rihanna or somebody like that. Oh, Pam Millie Harley, good morning, lovely. Sorry I'm late on parade. That's all right, Pam. You've just missed loads, that's all. Uh, loads of these going in baskets. Message on my bottom. Love the plain colour. Oh, it's Liz. Did you get my message this morning, Liz? This is the one that came in. I've left my pebble at home. I've got pebble painting coming up in the next hour and I've left my pebble at home. Hello. What am I like? Got my pen, though. Beautiful, such good value these are. Pound off. £6.58. Loads of you there, moving on. Then we've got the neutrals. I'd say it was nude and beige or something like that. Nude and beige, there you go. Beautiful, moving on. Okay, where are we going next then? Three metre bundles, Liberty, Emily Bell. This is gorgeous, this colour. Three metres. Of your caterpillar. Oh, it's not the good, the best name, is it? Oh, that's lovely what you're wearing. Caterpillar. Are caterpillars that colour? Are they? Jenny Jackson's watching. Nikki's watching. Frankie's watching. Loads of coming in suddenly. You just all waking up. £50 and 94 pence. You've got three metres here. Six units. Six units of fabric there. Dual tones caterpillar. I oh, need a new Nespresso machine. Good morning, handsome. Jenny Jackson's obviously watching Good Morning Britain. Is it still Ben Shepherd or is he left now? He's left now, isn't he? Are they Liberty Patterns on the outside then? Oh, can you show me on my preview? I won't show the viewers. Oh, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. I know there's lots going on. Don't, 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 don't. No, don't worry, it's fine. Apparently, no, no, this charge is saying Liberty have done a collaboration with Nespresso and you get Liberty patterned uh, Nespresso f milk frothers and coffee and I need a new coffee machine. Anyway, moving on. I've also got the Liberty, uh, that one in the blue. Oh, and I've got, to, oh, it's a different fabric, yeah. Oh, that's nice. Very traditional, isn't it, that one? Blue's always very popular, already popular on pre-order this one. 
sky, sky. That one is Dan Sky, that one. Where's your mug? I'll break your mug. <laughs> it's over this side of my desk today. That one's done as well. Thank you. I like to help. Oh, and that one there that you caught earlier. 50.94, keep going through. Keep going through. That's gorgeous, that one, isn't it? Now I've got another Liberty here. Very, it's a different pattern. No, it's not. Isn't that weird? Isn't it weird? Because it looks completely different in the neutral, doesn't it? It's Emily Bell in the neutral, in ivory. Oh, that's lovely, isn't it? 50 pounds and 94 pence. Oh, that's gorgeous. Check out, check out, check out. You don't want to be missing out on that one. 50, 94. Now... I've Oh, that. oh, that's nice. Yeah, the machine's the same one I've got, actually. How much is it? Yeah. Oh, the milk froth is out of stock already. Never mind. Uh, like this, uh, we've moved on from Liberty. Sorry, 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 sorry. That's my bad. Oh. Has oh, it got mugs as well? Anyway, this is, um, I want to call it olive or khaki. Oh, moss. Two pounds off that one, look. Two pounds off that one. Oh, Alice and Marion couldn't sleep last night. She was on, what? Alice and Marion, why are you awake already? She was on nighttime duty looking after Ollie last night because she messaged me in the middle of the night. I didn't know, I didn't hear it. Till, I didn't hear it till, I, I didn't see it. Till I got up, I'm not digging, I'm not having a dig. I saw it and I haven't had a chance to reply yet, but it, was, it came through during the night, yeah. £20 and 74 pence, you've already got money off that one. Then I've got a lovely lemon. I think it's lemon anyway. Three metres. Ooh, that's a lovely colour, isn't it? Is it lemon or is it buttercup, this one? Lemon. 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 Le lemon. Beautiful. Saving £2 on that one, look. Three metres, 44 inches wide, machine washable, quilting weight, rose and hubble, core fabric, lemon. Message on my bottom. Morning, John. Loving the Liberty Blue fabric. Would it be okay for a dress, please? Thank you. Trisha, yes, it would. Be gorgeous, because it's not lawn. It won't be floaty like that. It'll be a nice... But, yeah, we, we make lots of dresses out there. And all the Sussex Seamstress dresses and everything would be look lovely in that. Trisha, how are you? I thought you weren't getting anything new, Trisha. You were sitting on, weren't you sitting on your hands yesterday? They've been released. Les mains en France et... What's free? Libre. Right, and then I've got silver, light grey. This one's got... Uh, six... OK, this one's got three pounds off it for some reason. Oh, Alison Marion's off to the hairdressers now. First time in years. Well, I didn't like to say, Alison Marion. I've got some, um, oh, I'm all right, I can keep going until the end of the hour. I've got fingerprints all over my glasses, don't know how they've got there. 1974, good year, that. Three pounds off. Oh, Trisha's back. Liberty too much to resist. Yeah, Trisha in France. Um, at 19 pounds 74, so three pounds off would make that 22.74, divided by six, six, three, seven, six, six. Yeah. Just seems even cheaper, doesn't it, for some reason? Anyway, move. That's the last of my three meter bundles. Batiks. I've got Batiks big bundle. Bruce. Was Bruce making all that noise? I wonder what that noise was. And Dan was just rummaging through my glasses cases then. Anyway. You're very early. It's Bruce and Shirley. Oh, watch, don't fall. Bruce and Shirley are here. 
Batiks. 63.92. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Saving four pounds on that. Four pound saving on that one. Half a meter of each one, remember. Colour me banyan. Colour me banyans. Doesn't sound quite right, that, does it? Colour me banyans. They're ri rich, gorgeous colours, aren't they? Rich, beautiful colours. 63.92. Saving four pounds on that bundle. They're lovely, aren't they? I love the rich colours in there. Also, aren't these the ones? Yeah, look. Beautiful. Look at these. Look, 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 look. I've got these available by the half metre, but this is the bundle I'm showing you now. Look, Ooh. if you do EPP, EPP, gorgeous. All right, Shirley. I think Shirley's drunk already, you know. She's happy. She's drunk on life. Is that what they say? That's it. That's it. Oh, can't open that one. There you go, look. Aren't they glorious, all of these? Oh, this one's quite dramatic. Hang on. Look. Delphine would love these for a confetti quilting, wouldn't she? Oh, is that all? I'll, I'll go a bit faster then. Beautiful. And then the blue one here. Now, that's the bundle I have. So, in the bundle, you get half a metre of each one. So it's already cut, but I'm going to offer them to you in a minute by the half metre, which means if you want to three metres or two metres of them, you can buy three metres or two metres. But this one here is, oh, oh look at the colours. Beautiful. Too many people in baskets now. Too many of you in baskets. Check out, check out, check out if you want that one. Oof. Oh, do you know what that'd be good for? You know the, the pattern Delphine did yesterday? The centre square in those colours would be gorgeous, wouldn't it? The Bargello effect in the middle. The shallow falls or swallow falls, depending on which graphics you read. Shallow, that's us. Anyway, shall I do them by the half metre then? Right, shall I tell you or will you tell me? OK, I'm doing the blue one, uh, PZ49. There you go. So this is Colour Me Banyans in ice. Ice, ice, baby, ice, ice. £8.49 for half a metre. Beautiful batik. Same on both sides, look. So if you are doing confetti quilting, it's fantastic. Make a lovely so wrong out of it. It would be so wrong, it would be so right. That's not right, is it? That's not the saying, is it? Anyway, that's your ice. Then we could go to La Magenta, which is uh, ZT53. Ooh, look at the colours. I'm calling it... Oh, there's only three... They've called it pink. There's only three metres of the pink left. That's it. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Then we've got uh, ooh, shot shoes, maybe. Uh, VF20. Oh, citrus, they've called that one. Citrus. Citrus. Beautiful. Look at the way it ombres from that colour to that colour. Citrus. Then we've got purple. So this one is uh, SA08. What's the matter, Han? 
<laughs> this one's purple. James. Lovely. That's gorgeous. That's like imperial, that one, isn't it? So then have they called this one magenta then? Uh, RQ39. Oh, there you go. Yeah, it's more magenta, isn't it? It's more Shimoya Ruba like that one. Beautiful. Two, oh, three more colours, three more colours. Oh, I didn't know. Oh, no. Are there three or two? I think. Oh, OK, that is part of that one, then. They got cut, 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 muddled up. Jade. Oh, peacock. OK, let me just get rid of those two there. There you go. Oh, that's lovely, that one, isn't it? Look. I can hear me talking. Lovely. Peacock. Then we've got another purple one which was VP36. <sighs> nice, look. Plum. It would have to be a Victoria plum if it was that colour, wouldn't it? It's gorgeous, though. Really, really rich and beautiful, that one. And then, last but not least, what colour is this one then, Han? Peach. Peach Melba. Beautiful. That is stunning, isn't it? Anything else, Han? That mega bundle's about to sell out. The one that Dan's just taken. It's about to sell out. Right, we're going for a break now. After break, James is here from Search Press. And you love it when James is on. He hasn't changed his top, mind you. You're not brought a nice flowery shirt. Do you want to borrow one of mine? No, I'm going for... I'll see you in four minutes. <laughs> Hello, I'm Catherine Wright from Leicestershire Craft Centre based in Market Harborough. I'm delighted to be part of the Sewing Street family. I've been sewing since the age of seven when my mum taught me to sew. I particularly enjoy dressmaking and all through my childhood I made my own clothes uh, including dancing costumes and my prom dresses. But I also enjoy patchwork and bag making and hand stitching and embroidery and really anything textile based. The thing I particularly love about fabric and textiles and stitching is that there is always something new to try, there's always a new technique or a new skill to learn uh, and I really enjoy doing that. My top tip for new sewers is to uh, be friends with your iron. Your sewing also always looks better when it's been pressed and it's not like ironing your own clothes, it's much more, much better than that. And also to uh, build your skills up step by step. Don't launch in with the, with the wedding dress first off. You know, start with a simple dress and build your skills up and then you'll see good results right from the start and feel enthusiastic and carry on sewing. So really, just have a go, have fun. It's all about having fun and enjoying it. Um, so happy sewing. Did you know at Sewing Street that on various products we offer split pay? That means on certain items you can spread the cost over two, three, four or sometimes even five interest-free monthly payments. Just pay the first instalment when you purchase and you're away. So shop your way with split pay. 
Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Sewing Street gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email, then decide the value that you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion or just a way to say thank you, the Sewing Street gift card is the perfect answer. Shopping with Sewing Street couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.sewingstreet.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your sewing room essentials to fabrics, sewing machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Sewing Street app. Simply head over to your app store and search Sewing Street. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And we'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. Bye. Did you know that you can continue shopping 24 hours a day, seven days a week, even after we've finished broadcasting live? Just head over to www.sewingstreet.com for thousands of sewing supplies available from top brands. You still pay only one P&P with split pay available on certain items and an easy checkout service too. Plus you can get expert advice and tips from our Sewing Street hub and UK customer support is available 24 seven. So head over to sewingstreet.com and continue your sewing journey. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Sewing Street app. Head over to your app store now and search Sewing Street and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's bestsellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching on the go with Sewing Street. We look like Tweedledum and Tweedledee, don't we? <laughs> this is my friend James, he works at Search Press. Good morning. Uh, for those of you who don't know who you are, what do you do there? So I am the UK sales manager and I look after all the key accounts basically. I work with the authors, putting them on TV, launches, that kind of thing. And, it. and I bring cheap books to you, John. <gasps> affordable. 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 Sorry. When he does come on with us, he brings us theme. Now, first of all, Search Press's ethos is bring, not, not just here, but everywhere, you bring good quality crafting books but for at a price where everybody can afford them you're not you basically you don't do high price no we have the highest quality product yeah. at the most affordable prices it, that's what i was trying to say yeah exactly so, so they're already they're already good prices and if you ever go to any of the um are you doing any of the events this year? Are you doing? Um... Yeah, we've done a few. We did. Um, we did one last week, but it was mainly book trade. So we did the spring fair. Oh, okay. We did stitches. Yeah. So. so well, that's trade, though. Isn't that's it? trade. Stitches. Yeah. Are you doing so for pleasure next week? We're not. We have authors representing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have authors there. Um, we have authors at shows, but as a company, we tend to do our stuff from the office base now. Oh, oh okay. Because you did before COVID. We did. Because yeah, that's where did. I first met you, wasn't we, it? Yeah, on yeah. The stand. Years ago, now, yeah, we like used that. to do a lot of them, yeah. but you know, it's just there's a lot of outgoings with these kind of things. Well, so. there are, there are, and there's <laughs> only you. You can't, you can only exactly. spread so thinly, even though there's quite a lot of you. <laughs> we can only spread you quite thinly. <laughs> so now, but now, now, some of the books you bring us today, like right, okay, let me explain. Let me say on the website, it might be a bit confusing, but stay with us because we'll explain it all here. Some books which 
Some books over here are brand new and we're taking 30% off. Some books over here are best, best, best sellers. We're taking 30% off. Over here, I've got two for 15, two for 12 and two for 10. So I've got brilliant deals for the whole hour. The first book is so popular, we haven't even got a copy of it here. <laughs> but you know it, we've seen it, because you know it's Helen Riannon. Helen Riannon's dressmaking book. Now, this is one of your best, best, best-selling books, isn't it? It is, yeah, and it's World Book Day, so yeah. this is why we're here doing it. It is, we've sold 14,000 copies of this book right. since the end of June last year, so it's our fastest ever selling book. Yeah, now, I like to say a little bit of pride, because uh, Helen Rhiannon, when she first started saying she was doing it, I gave her a little bit of advice on what to put in it and what to do. I'm not saying I had anything to do with the writing or anything like that, but I was like a mentor at the beginning. I didn't write it, nothing to do with it, but I was like a mentor. She's worked so hard on this book, hasn't she? She's been yeah. all during lockdown, having a baby, everything. Yep. She's worked and worked and worked on this. But everybody that I know who's bought it, I've even bought it for a few friends for their birthdays. Haven't I, Michelle? Um, everybody loves this book. Everybody loves this book. I can't flick through it and show you, but it's everything you want to know about dressmaking, about fitting, about altering, all sorts of things like that. Right. We are going to take 30... Right, we don't need to do this, because every time we have it on air, on air... Well, you can tell us. You deliver hundreds here, and then they go, and we have to ring you the next day, and yeah. say we need another 200, another 300. You, um, you guys have sold 1,700 copies of this book. There you go. Not quite as many as my book, just so you know. <laughs> First of all... Which one. Search Press didn't want. <laughs> right, it has never, ever... I'm not going to let him forget that one. Never, ever, ever has it been to the price that we're going to now. 30% off, right? Now... This is ridiculous, right? Because it, it's already selling at full price, at our full price, but how many did you say? 1,700. 1,700 we've sold here. That's it, at Sewing Street, 1,700, right? Have a look at a couple of price comparisons. You can go today and buy it at John Lewis's for £20. Now, I thought, this is my own personal thing, I thought their saying was never knowingly undersold. It is, but I didn't... Yeah. Te you know what I mean? Technically, yeah, I know. Um, um, we can't say what their, <coughs> what their thing is up. I think as well what's really important about this book is it's just been announced that it's just won the best sewing book in the Creative Book Awards as well. That's so, it indeed. Yeah, so. Did she get a prize? Did she win she any won, money? She a, I don't know if she gets a prize. I'm not oh, sure what she gets. Message on the bottom. This is an amazing book, a must-have, says Lisa. Recognition. Did she mention you in her, in her speech? She should uh, do, really. It's an amazing book, a must-have. So, oh, I've done that one. Another prize comparison. So, you go. Where's this one, then? Uh... W.H. Smith, 1999. 1999 at W.H. Smith. How much stuff? 13 dollars 13 dollars 99 And also, we'll deliver it to your door, won't you? You won't have to get on a bus and go to Smith's or anything like that. 13 99 our prices. Yeah, it's, it is Lisa telling us again it's a must-have book. It is a brilliant print book. And it goes up to something like a size, as it say on the front cover. It goes up to like a size 34 or something like that. Or 30. It goes up to a good size, you know what I mean? This, uh, so um, it covers everybody. The reason it's been successful, and I, you know, I've picked Helen's brains about this a lot, oh, yes. because it's the only book out there that does that. Just every shape and size, yeah, yeah. you can create something for it. Yeah. Whereas before, there was absolutely nothing like that. Yeah. So that's why it's been such a huge success. And, and there's patterns in there as well. And what, what's brilliant about it is you can take a basic pattern and turn it into what you want to turn it into. So it's not... Here's a pattern to make the Pollyanna dress or whatever. It's here's a pattern. You can add this collar. You can add this sleeve. You can add this skirt. You can make it do this. You can make it do that. So it's, it helps you creating. Well, I've got some fifus for you here. These are people who've bought it already from us, remember. Lovely hard butt book, Helen, such a way of teaching that uh, lets even those of us who find dressmaking hard easy. Great value from Kim. That was five days ago she sent that one. That was a full price. Yep. Great book, explains everything you need to do. The larger sizes are a bonus, as most books only do standard sizes from C in Somerset. There you go. Another one, thirteen ninety nine. Remember now, uh, very detailed information, instructions for developing your dressmaking skills from Anne Stacey in Warwickshire. Remember at midnight, the price goes back up. When we crash your price, the price goes back up. Absolutely fantastic book, says Susan. You see? Now, these are people who've bought it and have got it. This isn't me and James standing here going, oh, I need to, you know, go make some money to pay my kids, you know, feed my kids next month or anything like that. Him, not me. Um, do you know what I mean? It's kind of, these are people who've bought the book and you don't have to write. It's easier to write a bad thing. Oh, 
Do you know what? Hot off the press. Well done, Daniel. Here it magic. is. Here it is. Uh, it is a br You can see how big it is now as well. Brilliant, brilliant book with everything that we just said. You've got your pattern sheets in there. You've got every single thing that she writes about and talks about is illustrated and photographed. I mean, it's just fantastic. It's a dressmaking course, like a diploma in dressmaking in one book. Message on my bottom. Uh, morning, guys. I have this book. It's a brilliant book from Christine in North Yorkshire. Let's go to page 40 and then I can just show you the sizing. Loads of you coming. Well, remember, it's 30% off today. Just looking. Hang on. What page did I just say sizing was on? 40. I'm well, not got there yet. Oh. Hang on a second. I'm sure there was a, ch a chart. Oh, no. Uh, there you go. So what, she, what also she's done is rather than using like commercial dress pattern sizes, so people have to go, oh, I'm an 18, I'm a 20, I'm a 34. She's done her own sizing guide, 1 to 9 and 10 to 19. So you can take your, your sizing from her measurements there. 13, 99, that's 30% off. It's brilliant. I've got to move on, though. I've got to move on because we've got so much to get through. Hmm? Half Yard Heaven next now. This... Debbie Shaw, you know and love Debbie Shaw. Brand new, this, isn't it? Brand new. It's only been out about a week. A week it's been out. And already we put, we're putting it in 30% off. I know, I know, I know. So, you know Debbie's uh, range of books. Mm -hmm. What she does, she takes half a yard of fabric and makes projects out of it. Revised and updated from Search Press. Brand new book. Should be £12.99. £9 and nine pence with 30% off. That's ridiculous. So the story of this book is yeah. Half Yard Heaven was the first book in Debbie's Half Yard series. Yeah. And it was 10 years, ten years ago. ago. And we've sold 100,000 copies of Blimey. this book. So she's now, what we've done is, you know, to celebrate that, celebrate Debbie, you know, because she sold, last time I checked, 800,000 books, yeah. which is A lot. pretty phenomenal. So we did an anniversary edition and there's some extra products in there as well. So some people, just to make people aware, you know, they may have this, but this is a brand new anniversary edition with new Of course, projects. the stock's gone. People just collect her books, though, don't they? Even yeah. if they've got... Because uh, one she brought out a, a couple of years ago had all old patterns but five new ones. People are like, I don't care. I still want, the, yeah, I still yeah. want my Debbie Shaw book. Price comparison at Waterstones, uh, 12 99 which is how much it's meant to be. Which is how much it's meant to be, 12 99 And we've got Long River... <laughs> now, normally you go to Long River, don't you, to get really, really... Oh, Ooh. £12.83. It's number three in most gifted in patchwork and quilting. Of course, I was number one bestseller on Long River, Long River. Long River when my book came out. Just so you know, I've got a picture of it. Uh, nine pounds and nine pence. Right, shall we have a look at it? Quarter of the stock has gone. Quarter of the stock's gone. What it is about Debbie's patterns is she makes them all incredibly easy and all... <laughs> Uh, very achievable, that's the word I was looking for. And also she uses up a lot of uh, your stash. She doesn't have to say, go out and buy all this fabric. You've got, we've all got half metre piece, half pieces of fabric in the cupboard. Oh. Pardon? Debbie's daughter. Oh, is it? Yeah, Kim. Blimey, she's grown. Is that not, who's this then? Is that a granddaughter? Are they granddaughters? I don't know now, don't we? She'll be watching. Go, no, John. Anyway, beautiful. All the photographs are normally taken by a husband who's a photographer. Look at all that. Over half the stock's gone. It's brand new, this book. Only launched on the 1st of March. Well, what, what, hang on. No. Yeah, what day yeah. it takes? It's the 7th, right? Yeah, it's not even a week old. So a week old. That's all. A week old. And we're taking 30% off just for the day. Because it's International Book Day today. So is today the day that all the kids turn up at school? Yeah. In, in, yeah. What have you sent yours as? I think they were with their mum, but I think they've gone as frozen. Elsa and Arnold. Oh. Nine pounds and nine pence, this one. It's a re ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Under, t under ten pounds for a brand new book. How many projects are in it? Hang on. She normally writes how many projects. Yes. Oh, that's an old photo. It's from the original. It's from the original ten years ago, that one. Look at all those projects. I always used to say, when we, because I've known Debbie for, for, well, since I used to do Ideal 23 years ago, whatever, I used to go, oh, airbrushed. And I keep, kept seeing her at the events going, I've got a bone to pick with you. I've got a bone to pick with you. Airbrushed. 
at nine pounds and nine pence. Loads of you there. We're going to move on. We're going to move on. We can always come back to it. Now, this one here has just won an award or highly commended. Isn't highly it? commended, yeah. Because my friend Julie Peasgood wrote. She must have been one of the. Was she one of the judges? Julie yes, Peasgood. she was. Yes, she's on the panel. Yeah. And she wrote a, a whole thing about this. Um, Julie Peasgood's on a cruise at the moment, but well, is she though? Because I saw a picture of her this week with another lady outside a shop, but she went on a... Last time I saw it, because we interviewed her for um, John Scott's Threads of Life, and um, she said she was on this really... And she teaches craft courses on, on the cruise and everything. He's going on... You're going on one with her, aren't you? Hopefully next year, yeah. 30% uh, off, please. What's this... But What is this book, then? So this is basically Debbie's life preference. You know, it's a reference guide to sewing and everything, and it's basically... It's a journal. The first time... Debbie's ever done anything like this. Right. Um, and it has just sold phenomenal. You know, it's got all of her tips and techniques. And the idea of it is basically you go along, you make your notes, you know, if you, you make adjustments and things, it's basically a complete reference guide to sewing. So it's got something for everybody in here, different projects, different uh, projects to finish, uh, notes where you've got your tools from, fabrics where you bought them from, fabrics that you want to remember where you've bought them from, Sewing Street, obviously, uh, and then very uh, basic things, things that we think are basic, but we don't always know them, fabric care and laundry, there's all sorts in there, and how to take your body measurements. It's just absolutely bursting with loads and loads of tips. And it's an award-winning one. £11.19, 30% off. Brilliant. Debbie Shaw's Sewing Journal. It's nice one because it's a hardback one. Most yeah, of her books idea, are paperback. You, know, you can lay it out, take it with you, make your notes with you, take your kits with you. Yeah. Um, and like I say, we've never done anything like it before and it's done extremely well. So. £11.19, 30% off just for the day, remember? Just for today. Loads of you coming to get this one. Uh, oh, hang on. Who's... Do you know this person? Uh, morning, John. Just put my television on to watch you. Wow. Who's the other handsome man at the side of you? Did you, do you mean Dan? Where's that? Did you mean Dan? He does look wow. quite handsome on telly. He's not in real life, believe you me. That's a sign of comfort, that, isn't it? Like, oh, it's toned. It's what? Toned? Toned, yeah. They muscles. You punch change it. your muscles to be yeah. that. Oh, so well. You can punch it as hard as you want. <laughs> anyway, eleven pounds and nineteen pence, thirty percent off. Hang on, what was going to, there was another message there. Hi, Jenny. Oh, uh, Julie wants. I've got this book. It's fantastic. Kath says it's a fabulous book. When I want to know how to alter. Oh, that uh, Kath's talking about um, Helen Hrianon's book. There, eleven pounds and nineteen pence, thirty percent off. That one. Right, moving on. Now this is another bestseller, isn't it? This it one is award winning. Award winning knitting Peter Rabbit 12 toy knitting patterns from the tales of Beatrix Potter by Claire Garland. Yeah, who's I'm, Claire Garland? So she's an author, she's not this isn't a search press book, this is one that we do through David and Charles. Oh, okay, who are you know a publisher we work yes, really yes, close yes, yes. with. I actually think it's the only one I've got from them yeah. today. Um, and she's won the best crochet knitting book award in the same group of awards that Helen Rhiannon's won. So oh. We have award-winning books at 30% off. I know. And it's a lovely, lovely hardback book, this one. Uh, does that, have you crashed? Uh, oh, OK. I was about to say, this shouldn't be 19.99 anyway, but... Anyway, that's a... Even, right, so, OK, let's start. 19.99 is a brilliant pet price anyway for it. 30% off day, an award-winning book. But look, it's full of knitting patterns to make all of. Look at them all. Tommy Brock, 13 uh, How brilliant is this book? The it's beautiful detail. quality as well. Attention to detail. Yeah. <laughs> look. I don't know who any of these people are. Samuel Whiskers. Oh, you don't know who these are? No. If I did, I'll have forgotten it all by now. It? We, we, we didn't have luxury like Beatrice Potter when I was a boy. Mr. Todd. Oh, he looks sad, Mr. Todd. He's a foxy whiskered gentleman. Oh. I don't know. I don't know Beatrice Potter. Oh, that's Jemima Podluck. I know that one. I know that one because that's on, she's on mugs and Easter eggs and things like that, isn't she? Yeah, she sells herself out, that one. Jeremy Fisher. Oh, these are gorgeous. Keep going through for everything. Keep going through for everything. I'll keep you updated. That, first of all, is a quality book. Uh, I think it's incredible at 
But then today, with your 30% off at 13 99 that's brilliant. That's a must-have, isn't it? It is. I mean, it's a fantastic gift, yeah. isn't it? Especially some Easter present or something like that. You know? Price comparison? John Lewis, £20. £20. See, they've... They... Oh, Amazon, a bit more affordable. Let's have a look. 15 16 Still, Still more expensive than ours. Still more expensive than ours. And you always go to the Long River to look for, um, for cheaper things. <laughs> Beautiful. My book's available on Amazon, as much as I've seen it. In uh, Kindle and in uh, Audible. Bestseller, isn't it? Hmm? Bestseller, isn't it? Bestseller, thank you. 13 99 Hannah hadn't heard it was bestseller till today. <laughs> right, the Half Yard 10th Anniversary book. Right, you've got to be careful on this one. We're just going to check the... the check, are we going to put the graphics back in? Do you want to check it? We'll just check it quickly because that's going to sell out at nine pounds, and obviously that's the new price, nine pounds and nine pence. Shouldn't be nine. Twelve ninety nine. It's meant to be. Two. Right. Now, if you want that, you've got to check out now. There's over sixty people are going to miss out on that one. Over sixty people. It's brand new. Only been what is it? The eighth today or the yeah. ninth? Something like that. Seventh. It's not even days. been out a week. It came out on the first of March. That one, and we're knocking thirty percent off. I can get more. What? What? I could get more. Oh, oh, he can get more. He can get more. He winked at me then. He went, I can get more. You know, a man with a van, do you? I do. OK, well, we, well, what we'll do is we'll have to talk to Hayley about it and then you can come back on later and tell me. Right, OK. Now, we're going here now, aren't we? Right, now, I have got need to explain this one, right? So what I'm going to show you now is a whole collection of books. You can buy them individually or you can buy three for 15. And what you need to do is when you go to the website... You ch or t tell the call centre which three you want. Now this, uh, uh, two for 15, sorry, two for 15, not three for 15, two for 15, right? Uh, 12, nine, the, the, the RRP is 12 99 for each book, but some of them are way more than that. So I'll tell you as we go through. What you do is you choose two of these books for £15, right? Ready? So I'm going to show you them all and then make your decision, right? So Beginner's Guide to Knitting, right? By Lynn Rowe, what's this one then? So these two, I mean, it's good, probably best to do these two together. So these are brand new. That one's January. fatter than that one. Yeah, is, there is a bit more in it. Yeah. So twelve ninety nine. Yeah. So usually twelve ninety nine. They're normally twelve ninety nine each, right? But you're getting if you bought those two, you get them for fifteen pounds. So that's not right. It is right because I'm generous like that, John. These are our fastest selling books of two thousand and twenty four. Already. Year. Yeah. So they're brand new this year, 2024, best-selling books, 2024. And so, in theory, you should be paying £26. Is that right? Mm -hmm. I'll bet two for 15. Doesn't make any sense, does it? You can buy, you can buy one if you want for 12 99 You can buy that one if you want for 12 99 But if you buy them both, you pay £15. One for yourself, one for your friend. Exactly. Have you got any friends? Right, but then all that's not all you can choose from. Yeah, then there's this one here, which should be fourteen ninety nine, felted animal kit. So you can choose that one and that one if you want, or that one and that one. Uh, twenty. Oh, you go. You just said you've got no friends. This twenty keep forever friends. <laughs> See, that one's fourteen ninety nine. So you basically you buy that. Yes, I said that. Something else. Oh, did you? Yeah. You buy that, you get that one, you get one free. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, I didn't say that bit. So if you buy this one for 50, if you buy two, right, £15, pounds, that's meant to be 14 99 So basically, you're getting that one for free. We'll show you in a minute, we'll show you in a minute how you can check out. A few people saying they don't understand how to check out. I'll do that in a minute. Right, Pulled Thread Embroidery by Marie-Hélène Genoux. I'm looking at you now. <laughs> this one's, now, this is supposed to be 17 99 this should, it says here, 17 90, Oh, sorry, it's changing on that. It should be 17 99 So if you buy that one and that one, you're getting that one for free and you're getting £2 off that one, £3 off that one. So now this one's incredible. If, look at the patterns in here. Look at the work that's gone on in here. So I think it's what to emphasise on this. Yeah, go I've on. got, so I've picked just a variety of different books in a variety of different areas. Yeah. As, I mean, we've never done prices like this before no. we've, never, we've done offers yeah 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 yeah. we've never done offers no. like this before with it being well booked day i thought you know what we're gonna do a one-off show 
three different real good offers, a few bits from everywhere, different subjects. I know obviously it's sewing street, but other people do other crafts. So, you know, potentially you could buy one for yourself and then you know someone who might do wire jewelry making. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You or, you know. or you've ne I've, ne I've never ever tried pull thread embroidery before, but I love, <clears throat> I want a beginner's guide for knitting. Or this one, you buy that one, that should be £15. So you're getting this book completely free, it should be £18. Oh, now, Beginner's Guide to Crochet is the, is the most popular, what, Han? Out of all the books so far, that's the most popular for this one, so two for £15. Oh, message on the bottom. Uh, OK, bought two books already, so much for me, not buying anything else, too tempting. Oh, go on, Susan, you'll be tempted. I'll, I'll get James to look down the camera, smoulder down the camera at you, and that'll make you buy it. <laughs> yeah, well, it, I, that'll frighten the life out of you. Uh, so this one here, this is twelve ninety nine. This is the Encyclopedia of Wire Jewellery. So that's another of your choices there. Lots of people watch uh, Jewellery Maker and watch ours and everything, so they swap over. Uh, you know, kind of, uh, Jules Mayouf, she does both, doesn't she? See, sewing and wire. Then you also know Jennifer Taylor, girl with the sewing machine, no fuss guide to making and adapting your clothes. See, that one's supposed to be fourteen ninety nine. So buy that one, and then any of the others are free. If you think about it, because you're paying £15. Then we've got this one, refashion, restyle and restitch. Debbie and Dawson. It's Debbie Shaw. It's, and that's the daughter, isn't it, Kimberly? Yeah. We can look through that one. Hannah wants to see through this one. So this one should be 12 99 no? So let's have a quick look. There they are. Oh, there she is. Yep. So projects in here. Now, yeah, refashion, restyle and restitch. 20 stylish sewing projects from pre-loved clothes and homewares. There's a huge sustainable movement, isn't there? At the yeah. Moment. And you know, the whole idea of this basically is using materials that you've got, doing projects with stuff you've already got, and basically just not spending any money, just using yeah. your materials over and over. Well, otherwise they're just going to landfill or, or you know, waste it, aren't they? Or just sit in a cupboard. Yeah. Um, so we've got uh, pillows, lampshades, uh, sweatshirt bags. A what? Rear, rear posture, one step ahead of me, rear posture in a footstool, rope baskets. Uh, she's made uh, curtains out of tablecloths here. We've got, oh, hang on, sorry, there you go. Uh, Tie-dye bean bag, armchair covering, denim look, uh, two-tone pipe pillow, a denim tote, storage bags, pinafore dresses, children's, tea towel tote bag, felt mittens. It's endless, 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 endless. Look, again, with loads of photos. Oh, there it is. Have you got one then? You need re uh, upholstering, Han. Look, see, it's made from that dress look. She's worn that on telly, hasn't she? This is a great bit, but it tells you exactly what you know, what it does from it, and you can you get the ideas from it. It's just yeah. A minute, but... Oh, Hannah wants to see the armchair cover. Okay, 84. She's just getting ideas for what she's going to do. 84. There you go. Denim. I think there's more than one pair of jeans in there. Well, it depends whose jeans they were, I suppose. Yeah, Hannah says she's going to do a whole sofa with hers. Hannah's words, not mine. Oh, sorry, I, re I read that wrong. Right, yo. And then last but not least, Sarah Payne's Quilt School. Now, this book sells well all on its own, doesn't it? Um, this is £12.99. 15,000 of that. 15,000 of those. 15,000 of those. No, not available to say that something she sold. But what I love about this book is I'm not going to show it to you. She does a chart in here. I'm sure this is the book with the half square triangle chart in it. Am I right or am I wrong? I might be right, right or I might be wrong. Right, no, Hang on. Right. Half square triangles, let's have a look. <clears throat> Half square triangles, here you go, 59. I think, because it's, it's always difficult to know. Oh, now I might be wrong. I'm sure it was in this book. Anyway, it's she basically tells you, because when you're cutting out half square triangles, you cut a square and cut it in half, you need to get the dimensions exactly right. And I'm sure it's in there, the chart's in there. Twelve ninety nine. Now, so the, the, what you do now is you choose out of those, you can have any two of those books for £15. Let me show you how you do it. You go to the website. So the picture of the crochet book is up there. That's all. If you go to more details, there's loads of images there, right? But what you need to do is, so you go there, then you click on book, and it's listed all of the books that are available. So, so, girl with the sewing machine, the image does not change. You just click on it, and then that one there, add to basket, add to basket. Go to your basket.
Oh, uh, we haven't got the... We're not logged in, so we've got... It, wait, there you go. It will do it for you. So you choose from the books there. You put two of them in. Oh, you only put one in at that time. Uh, OK. Put two of them in, and it will come up at £15. There you go. Just, it is working. There it is. So you choose now. But the thing is, we've put the RRP in at 12 99 Some of those were 17 99 Some of those were 14 99 You're saving so much money... And it's all thanks to James. But it's only till midnight tonight. Do you know what? I shouldn't say this, but I'm talking um, Christmas presents, Mothering Sunday presents. When is Mothering Sunday? This Sunday. Oh, no, that's, it's the 10th, isn't it? Is it this weekend? You won't get them in time for that. Ignore that one. Easter present, Christmas present, birthday present. I've just had a thought as well. Oh, no. I what? don't know if we're allowed to do this. No, no. Give some of these away? Now he tells us. That's why you come in early to do prep. <laughs> I know, but I was just thinking, you know what, why not, you know? All right, so because well, they come from you, what are you going to do? I've got to chuck ten of these books in. So one person randomly... One person randomly. ...who buys something from your show today... I will make sure they don't get the books that they've already bought. So you'll, they'll get the books they paid for and, and you'll chuck in ten others. I'm going to chuck in ten free books. It could be anything. Anything. Blimey. I feel generous today, You John. certainly do. Have you just woken up? <laughs> yeah, the coffee's just kicked in. Well, there's not many people I'd get up for half three in the morning, you know, so... Oh, is that, is that, is that a compliment? That's a compliment, John, yeah. He loves me, really. Even though he's really rude to me. <laughs> so, uh, which two are you going to go for? These, the two, are the most popular at the moment. Those two are the most popular at the moment. Crochet is huge, really huge. And Sarah Payne, there you go, that's in third place. We can have a little flick through, right? I'll go through them all again in a second. Right, 116 people in baskets need to check out. Right, so here we go. I know, so which two are you going to go for? The thing is, you can do it twice. You can do it twice, can't you? So you could, you could have bought this and this, and then you go, oh, I really want Sarah Payne's book. I'll get that one as well. You can do it twice. It's not once. You know, you have to, you'll just have to do two. I wonder what happens if you put four in, in your basket. Yeah, we'll do it as two separate things, just safe things. Complicate them. Will it definitely? Oh, OK. Yeah, apparently if you put four in, it'll come up as your, as your right man. OK, so we want to look at Sarah Payne's quilt school. Here we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look, there's your quick strip quilt. Scraps. Is this the one with the elephant in the back? Yes, it is. It is the one with the elephant in the back. There you go. So beautiful. And hasn't she done well? Because I, 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 she, I, she won't mind me saying, because she's told everyone. She had a stroke not she long did, ago, yeah, didn't not she? Long ago, yeah. She had a really, really bad stroke recently. Wait, at Festival Quilt, she'd fallen over and she had a bone sticking That's through right, her leg. Broke didn't she? Her leg and then, yeah. she had a, then she had a stroke. She was back on telly. No, she was back on telly this week. She was brilliant. And I just thought, what a. She's had det real determination. She's got a lot of determination, Sarah. But back on telly after having a stroke, most people have just gone, oh, I've yeah. had a stroke. I see Brilliant. Her day. See yeah. her stitches the other day. She's doing well. Oh, she has stitches as well. Yeah, she's yeah. getting about then. <clears throat> anyway, look, here's her book. So now, if you buy the buy on the web or ring the call centre, they'll help you put your two in your basket for you. Okay, so this is now limited, and this is now limited. Not everyone who's got it in their baskets, right? That's why look, 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 they've gone pink on the square. When they go pink like that, it means they're limited. Hang on, where's the other one? There you go. So please be careful. Not everyone who's got it in their basket will necessarily get it. Right, we'll come back and recap that in a second. We've got loads more to show you. So that's your two for 15. Two for 12. Oh, two for 12 now. Now there's a real melange of books in here. So we have got 20 tiny sea creatures to knit. Right, now, again, we've put the RPP at 7 99 Some of them will be... That one is 7 99 I'll go through them all in a second. And we've got mini amigurumi. That's right. Yeah, you try saying that. Amigurumi. Yeah. Th these are gorgeous, right? Then you knit a mini safari. Look. Aren't you always asking Joe Carter to make an anteater? Oh, isn't it? No, I said this last time. Do you know what Didn't I? Mean? Yeah. It is an anteater. That is an anteater. What did you think it is <laughs> we, then? We were trying to figure out what it was last time. Uh, hang on, what is it then? It's not a meerkat, is it? No. Not a pelican. Not a hippopotamus. Is it a tapir? Tapir? That's, that's, that's tapir, yeah. 
Or was it Gazelle? No, he did it. Definitely that. It's a that one, Tapioca 36. It's a tapioca anymore. Oh, sure there it is. <laughs> so then, I bet they eat ants, though, don't they? <laughs> anyway, we'll move on, move on. Now, look, Pebble Pets. It's meant to be £9.99. £9.99. This one, uh, it's a two for 12 member, so you get them for £6 each, basically. That one there is supposed to be £9.99. I'll go through them. I'll show you the minimum. I just want you to see the whole lot. £9.99. Making felt hats. We had that on Sewing Street. Yeah, we launched it, yeah. We did that. We launched that one on Sewing Street. Not Sewing Street, Sewing Quarter. Sewing Quarter. £9.99. It's £9.99, that one. Right, then we've got mandalas to embroider, £9.99. We've got more Debbie Shaw, £9.99. Then we've also got this one here, which is Debbie Shaw. So useful, £9.99. Then this one, £12.99. So if you buy that one, you're getting your other book for free, remember, because that's supposed to be £12.99. Then look at, look at these, right? These are fabulous. A bit Just tell me what they are. Paint pad posters. Pa 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 paint pad posters. Oh, yeah. Oh, so it's all your watercolour and you get your paper with it as well. You get instructional work. I think oh, so really... they're already painted? No, no. You get your instructions and teach you how to do them and it shows you the finished one as well. Yeah. And then you can do your painting, take them out, frame them, give them to people. No, hang on, look. And you get your tracing with it. So basically, you get the iris one already done for mm -hmm. you. And then in here, this is like, is this called vellum? So what's this called? The whole point of this space is if you're, if you want an entry level into watercolour, yeah, uh, yeah. this has already got the drawing for you, so you can either trace it or you can actually use that. Because a lot of people that do watercolour are quite scared to because of the actual sketching. Yeah, 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 yeah. But this basically does everything for so you. So it's drawn for you, look, there's the sunflowers, and you colour it in, basically, or paint it in watercolour. Oh, that's a brilliant, but even if you don't, right? You could frame that one and say you did that one. That's what I'd do. Uh, so we've got that one there, which normally sells for $15.99. And we've also got this one, which is... Um, city Scenes. It's what? City Scenes. Oh, scene. City Scenes, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Look, Brook is that Brooklyn Bridge? No, actually. I don't know what the Brooklyn Bridge is. Arc de Triomphe. Going there next week. Are you? What are you going... Are you going what are you going there for? Uh, the first day with the missus. With the missus? Yep. Which one? Joe. <laughs> Hi, Joe. Right, hang on. So you could buy this one and this one. If you bought these normally, that's £32. You're getting them for £12. Brilliant present. Easter present. That, I, I think they're gorgeous. Because I know, I know you're saying we're sewing street, but everybody does more than one craft, don't they? Yeah, yeah. Or I wants to try more than one craft. If you've ever wanted a bit of watercolour, that's brilliant. And we're making it totally affordable today, aren't we? Helen of the Anon is watching. Hi, Helen. She says, morning, John and James. Love to see you both on together. Happy World Book Day. Did you see, uh, did you see we did your book, Helen of the Anon? We did your book. Anyway. Uh, right, so do you want me to go through these? So you buy any two of these for £12, right? The image on the web is just amigurumi animals, but so you can buy this one, which should be fifteen ninety nine. You can buy this one, which sale price is fifteen ninety nine. Now, obviously, you need a digital die cutter yeah. to go with this one, but it's a huge book that one. Twelve ninety nine normally. Then we've got Debbie Shaw, so useful. We've got Debbie Shaw sewing room secrets. It's all about quilting. It's not. There's no secret secrets in there. It's not you know sleazy or anything like that then we've got mandalas to embroider which i think is gorgeous that one oh are they iron on transfers i feel like it looks like it yeah i don't mind. looks like it <laughs> i think you know, what i you know what i was just thinking was john there's people oh no what now people might think you know because they're so cheap a lot affordable. of people say affordable. 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 affordable there's nothing wrong with them it's just pure good deals I, because i've Tell had them people, that i've had people say to me in the past, how can you sell them that cheap? Yeah, you know, affordable. We don't, affordable. We don't do it very often, um, and any reason we're doing it is well book day. Absolutely nothing wrong. And it's Street. Absolutely nothing wrong with these books. They're best-selling books. Well, no, 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 we, we've proved that. We, it's not like, what they could have done was they could have gone through the warehouse and gone, oh, we've got this book by John Scott years ago, didn't sell. We've got this book, didn't sell. Bung those on the telly, nobody will know, two for £12. 
they're all best-selling books, mm -hmm. aren't they? Yeah. They're all, and, they're, and they're current books. Yeah. These are all currently they're all, they're in all in your stock. stock. Yeah, they're they're, they're award-winners, some of them. Do you know what I mean? So it's kind of like, it's a really, really big deal. Yeah. Can, really. It is a bit. And if you're buying, there's a queue on the phone lines, just so you know. Um, a really, really, really good one to get involved in, even if you not don't do the, the skill or the craft or whatever. Uh, let's carry on. So we've got the felt making hat one there. We've got rock art, which is all about painting pebbles, I imagine. Yep. That and the next two. So these are huge. It's a huge area at the moment. People. What, which, sorry, which one's flowers? Oh, paint pad flowers obviously is limited. I'm surprised the cityscapes isn't as well. And then pebbles. Oh, sorry, what were you saying about so this? So just a really, really cheap entry into a craft. You know, you find affordable. The stones affordable. <laughs> I'll get it right by the end. Yeah. Of by next time he's on. Very affordable. Yes, thank entry you. Levels, you know, and it literally you need just a few paints. You've got your stones and what people do is they paint them and they leave them around for other people. Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, so quite... yeah you're not supposed to steal pebbles off beaches, just remember. Oh, yeah. or if you paint gardens. it, put it back. Oh, well. Or people's gardens. Oh, other people's gardens, yeah. Yeah, but they, they have that thing, don't they, on Facebook where uh, there's a Facebook page where people have found painted pebbles and everything. Mm. It's cute, isn't it? Yeah, a message on the bottom. Uh, morning, John. Jason. Oh, yeah. That's right. I'll be Jason for a day. He looks like a Jason, doesn't he? Uh, I've bought a few books last time, and this time they make great presents from Rosemary in Buckinghamshire. Thank you, Rosemary. Thank you. He will answer to Jason. Uh, then these are really, really popular. Knit, knit a mini safari. So these are knitting. Right? This is amigurumi. Which is a form of, just a form of crochet, basically. Yes. It's our I biggest... I thought you were going to bring us up, do something for us on, on air today. Me? Yeah. No, next time. Yeah, OK. Uh, the biggest subject air for us at the moment is amigurumi. Yeah. Amigurumi. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. It's absolutely huge at the moment. It's yeah. a real entry level into crochet. A lot of people, beginners, are taking it up and really trendy as well. There you go. Because he's really trendy, see? He lives by the seaside. And knit a mini ocean. This is back to knitting, this one. Seven, nine. Now, we, we've said they're seven, nine, nine. These ones are seven, nine, nine, but you're getting two for 12 pounds. But if we go through the list, so they're all seven, nine, nine. These aren't. That one's a nine, ninety nine one. That's a nine, ninety nine one. That's a nine, ninety nine one. That's also nine, ninety nine. That one is as well. Yep, and then we go to digital what sits there. That's twelve ninety nine, and then these are fifteen ninety nine normally. Very popular. If you buy, two, imagine if you buy that one and that one, should be thirty two pounds. You're getting it for twelve pounds. No, they are the most popular options. Have they gone pink? Yep, there they are. They've gone pink. Look, we're not controlling that. We have to go with it. There you go. Two pink ones. Uh, sorry, John and James from Rosemary. Oh, he, Rosemary, he doesn't mind. Rosemary, he'll answer to anything. <laughs> Jay, uh, Jason's one of the nicest things he's been called recently. Don't worry, cheap is good from a Yorkshire lass. Well done, Susan, it's true. Yeah. Thanks, Susan. Yes, we, when we had our training for sewing quarter, we were always told, you don't call it material, you call it fabric, and you don't say cheap, you say affordable. They were the two things we learnt on day one. Message on the bottom. Morning, John and Jason. Oh, yeah. You know, maybe that's your new name. <laughs> uh, just letting you know that I've started my Christmas shopping. Karen. Oh, Karen from the Badge Group. No badges. There's no badges. on. Do you do a book, How to Make Badges? Maybe you need to do that next. Buttons. No badges. They collect badges. Yeah. Uh, anyway, um, well done. Maybe, though. Hmm? Maybe. Maybe. Who knows? Watch this space. Right, OK. So they're two for 12, right? I've got two for tens now. Now, these are huge <coughs> popular books, these ones. These are two for ten pounds. So they should be six ninety nine each, right? And you're getting two of them for ten pounds. So you can want uh, Animal Granny, Flowers to Knit, Amigurumi, if you just said, is very, very popular. And this is a bit niche, this one. Knitted Baby Hats. You choose any two of those for £10. What's the matter, Han? Beautiful. £6.99 they're supposed to be. You get two for £10. Anything to say? Yes. Lots on these. Go on, then. So they originated from our best-selling series, 20 to Makes. Really? We've sold over 3 million copies of... 
originally. They were in paperbacks for four ninety nine. Yeah. So what we're doing now is we are bringing these back in hardback formats with different subject areas. These two are brand new. They've only been out a couple of weeks. There you go. These two are best selling in the series. So mm -hmm. I bought four, two new, two best sellers. So brand new, brand new. How can they do that? Do you know what I mean? Uh, you get two for £10. Just use the code, and then when you go onto the website, you just click on the two that you want to put in your basket, and then your basket will automatically take it to £10, or ring the call centre and say which two you want, and they'll do it for you. And remember, one person who buys from this show today, as well as the books you've bought, you will get a free extra 10 books thrown in that Jason will pick for you. <laughs> and I'll make sure that they don't, obviously not the ones that they've Yeah, paid, yeah, so. of course, yeah. And so, it's supposed to be 6 99 you're getting two for £10. Oh, Vix is watching. Hello, Vix. Oh, is it Kieran's birthday today? How do you know that? Okay, 6 99 What now, this morning, while you've been doing this? Beautiful, keep going through. Any two for £10. Doesn't matter which two. These are best sellers. These are brand new. You will not find these cheaper anywhere either. You won't find them cheaper. More affordable anywhere else. Yeah. Than on this they can show be cheap from other places because. They <laughs> right. Now we've got some more books that are 30% off on their own. Do you, before we go there, do you want to just check on any of these, Hannah? Right. Okay. I'll just, the ones I've already shown you, I'm going to check now. Which one first? Right, Half Yard Heaven, brand new Debbie Shaw book. 30% off, should be 12 99 you get it for £9.09. And £9. Okay, uh, I've got to do this quietly. How many more could we potentially get? Another 100. Another 100. Okay, we have to just put that to upstairs. For, oh, they're not. Day offs. We have to tell them because they're. Done. I told you to go upstairs and talk to them. No, I forget it's Thursday. It's the no day off. Knows. Don't work Thursdays. No, no. Tuesdays and Thursdays. Good, ex good exercise going up and down the stairs. <laughs> right. OK, at the moment, there are over 60 people. Too many got it in their baskets, right? So we'll keep an eye on, we'll keep an eye on it and find out if we can get some more. So that's that one, right? Then, next, Helen Rhiannon's book here. Another bestseller, 30% off. Graphics are coming in. They're just a bit slow today. There you go. 13 99 Should be... 19 percent off. That's not right, is it? It's only because it's International Book Day today. World Book Day. Uh, so World Book Day. International, same thing. International World Book Day. International World Book Day. There you go, Jason. Thirteen ninety-nine. And how many shapes sold? Seventeen hundred of these. You here. sold seventeen hundred here. here. We've sold fourteen thousand. And fourteen thousand in real life. We should be able to afford that she shed now, won't she? Thirteen ninety nine. Check out, check out, check out. Then we also had the Debbie Shaw Sewing Journal with its thirty percent off. Eleven pounds and nineteen. Should be fifteen ninety nine. Loads of these in baskets. So you've got lots and lots of tips in here, and then oh, you see dressmaking patterns, common pre cuts, all that sort of thing. Sewing references. Then you've got spaces for like projects that you're working on, jobs that you need to do for that month. That's your monthly planner. These are your project planners here. We do that when you do costumes. We do one of these for every single costume that we made. Then your old price comparison here at Waterstones, uh, fifteen ninety nine. Fifteen ninety nine. It's the RRP. There you go. And then, uh, and then all more tips at the front there. It's beautiful where you want to stash your fabric and things like that. Eleven pounds and nineteen pence. It won best, highly recommended, highly commended this week at what? Which awards are they? So. Which awards did she get? Uh, right? Best journal. In. Back. Julie P's good was one of the judges. Lovely. And then we also we'll bring some new ones in a minute because uh, you've seen these. But here you go. Knitting Peter Rabbit, really gorgeous book. Loads of these have gone. 30% off, should be 19 99 that one. Over half the stock of those has gone. Won an award as well. Oh, what, what? Won an award as well. Yeah, won an award as well. Knitting and crochet. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Right. Now, what other things have we got in the 30% off? Is there anywhere you'd like to go next, Hannah? Which one? 
occasions. That's this one. This is the occasion bags build a bag book plus templates from Debbie Shaw. Now, this one must be relatively new because I don't yep. recognize this one. Yeah, this is new as well. So these ones we're going through here are basically all out this year, bar, bar one that we'll come across in a minute. But these are all brand new as well. Right. Now, in here, oh, it's a bit of sellotape. Sorry, I won't come up. You get those templates, you know, the reusable templates that Debbie, uh, uh, she designs these so that you can cut every single thing in this book using these templates. So you don't have pattern pieces, you just draw around the templates or around the dotted lines. 30% off, £10.49. pence. Uh, let's have a look how many bags are in here. Oh, loads. There you go. This is how to use the templates, obviously because not everyone will have seen them before. Then what tools you need, what materials you need. Then techniques that you'll be using during it. So you're making your straps and putting your zips in, magnetic fastenings, glossary of words that she might use. And then here's all the projects. And now she hasn't got a page of them. Um, normally she has a page with them all on, doesn't she? Curved flap handbag. Again, 30% off this. 30% off this. And look, every single stage... You've got words and you've got pictures. I think the thing is with Debbie is she's so inspirational with that. The way she does, she teaches people. Yeah. Like in no one else, you know. And I think that's why she sold over 800,000 books because the way she lays it all mm -hmm. out, you know, it's just such an easy way to follow. And as you can see, we've got quite a few Debbie books here today because they just, they yeah. sell so well. Yeah. Also, what you do is when you, let me, I won't do it on that one. I'll do it on this one. When you think, oh, I'm going to make this bag, right? What it then does is it shows on template one, you need to cut that one and that one out. And on template two, you need to cut that, that and that out. That's all you're cutting out for the whole bag. You see, that's you put it on the fold and everything. And so every single bag, let's just take this one. Oh, that's too easy, that one. Look, just need, you just need those off template one to make it. It's just so easy, the system of how you work this. And these, they feel flimsy, but they really, really last. They're quite enough, they're, they're very durable. Uh, how much of the stock's gone, you say? Quarter of the stock of that one's gone already. 30% off, £10.49. Brilliant. Next. What time is it? Oh, yeah. Got another Debbie Shaw, eco friendly. 30% off this one. So this is reusable projects for sustainable sewing. Uh, so hang on, all right, okay, now this is, no, no, but the price is 10 99 not 9 99 so someone's got the start price wrong on that one. Maybe we've sold it at 9 99 in the past. I so. think that's what it was, yeah. We're, we're taking 30% off 9 99 which you can work that one out, can't you? 6 99 If you've never had a, a Debbie Shaw book before, maybe this is the one to start with, but you've got all these reusable, sustainable um, projects in here. Again, you've got tips for complete beginners. You've got all the things you need, your fabrics, your tools, all the techniques that you're going to need for things in the book. And then all the different projects here. £6.99, £6.99. Can't get a glass of wine for that, can you? I don't know, I don't drink. Do you not? No, not anymore. I only came home from a party on New Year's Eve one night, so drunk. And then I opened another bottle of champagne to watch the Ab Fab movie on the film. And then the next morning I woke up going, I have to do dry January. And I just never went back. It's good five, for you, mate. Just over five years. Good for you. Well, I've got a whole champagne fridge at home full of champagne. And people buy me champagne as presents all the time. Send it my way. It's in the garage, yeah. In the gym. What? Send it my way. You have to pop round. Jason. <laughs> at 6 99 Can I do it now? Right. You know the Debbie Shaw book earlier that sold out with six now. I've only got, right, I've only got 100 extra, but the 60 people got it in their baskets. We've got more of these now. So please, if you had this in your basket and said sold out, you can now get it. Should be 12 99 30% off. Brand new. It was only launched a week ago. Brand new book. Only launched a week ago. Nine pounds and nine pence this one goes to. 30% off. Beautiful. Nine pounds and nine pennies. 
There you go. Beautiful. Should be £12.99. Brand new book. Only launched a week ago. Actually, launched launch worldwide a week ago. Yeah, Not just here. Like, we haven't had it yet on this one. Publication date was the 1st of March. Publication so. date. That's the official date. Official. Affordable. Do you have a party every time you publish a book? No. Oh. Mm. Yeah, well, we have a summer. Nice we have a party. summer party we, where we. Oh, do uh, you? Work. Yeah, which is which is good. Pay for the directors. Who gets invited to that then? Best-selling authors. Maybe if you did a book with us, we'd invite you. You didn't want it. You didn't offer it. Yeah, can we just come to the party and just mingle? <laughs> where can, is it? In Tunbridge Wells. Oh, I'm not going. Royal to Tunbridge there. Wells. Royal Tunbridge Wells. It's in. Is that where the office is based? Yeah. Down there? Uh, nine pounds and nine pence, thirty percent off. Right. If you want the sixty people with it in your basket, you need to check out because even more people are now putting it in their baskets. If you want that, if you want it, you need to check out brand new, brand spanking new book to celebrate ten years since we started. Since we, since Debbie started Half Yard, Half Yard Projects. And again, just to emphasise, it's got new projects in it from yeah. the original, the original book that yeah. she did. So you're not just getting a, a, a glossier version of the original book. Beautiful. Right, got to get back to the 30% offs. Oh, yes, now, the man from... Oh, where's he gone? Oh, there he is. There he is. Brenton West. Now, you'll know him if you watch The Repair Shop. It's not the one that Hannah fancies. <laughs> where's mine? So you sent him out for coffee? No, I didn't do that. See for you, I think. At 19.99... Beautiful. Look at this. So this now, why have we brought this then? I bought this. I mean, obviously, it's not anything sewing related, but no. it's a brand new book. Yep. Just come out last month. It's selling extremely well. Yeah. Obviously, a very popular TV series, a bit of a celebrity. Silver Smithin, not as big a celebrity as you, though, John. Obviously not. Sorry. That's Silver he's, Smith. he's got a bigger show than I have. He's so BBC, <laughs> and it's, you know, it's a really, really hot topic at the moment. Silver Smithin is a really popular subject area, so okay. I think maybe someone who does... One other craft might be interested in this, or yeah. maybe someone who does it. And we're 30% off. So what kind of projects are in here, then? Rounding items, servicing mechanical parts, ooh, soldering. Yeah, I think a lot of people gift... Oh, look, they're my nan and knives and forks like that. Reshaping metal. I actually watched an episode. Of, I've only ever seen one episode, I admit. And they took... Um, nice and thoughts, and they made them into other th other projects. And was it him that did it? It was him that did it. Yeah. Is that why you're watching that day? Because you knew you were doing one of no, his I books. I didn't know he was on. But... Okay, let's do a price comparison from Waterstones, nineteen ninety nine, which is how much it's supposed to be. Which is how much it's supposed to be? But here today, thirteen ninety nine. W H Smiths. Oh, now, yeah, now, there's, why is theirs cheaper, then? Oh, they've got a saving on, yeah, 18.39, 18.39. Theirs is an 8% saving, ours is a 30% saving. Just saying. Okay, just because we look, yeah, because you're going to look everywhere. Long River, £16.30. We're still beating them, still beating them. Only for today, though. Only for today. Silversmith Secrets. Right, got two more to get through. Every individual line at 30% off, as of an hour ago, was cheaper than Amazon, without doubt. Everything new that we did on the... Oh, OK, brilliant. Off. Right, so which one are we doing first? Crochet dolls. Lulu's crochet dolls. Lulu Copotine. Uh, 12 99 they're supposed to be, taking 30% off. Yeah, brand new. Look, cute, aren't they? C Celia. Is there a Hannah or just there's a Hannah? There's a John in there, I think. There's no John. <laughs> They're all girls, aren't they? <laughs> Leonie. Oh, she just won Craft of the Year, didn't she? Yeah. Ducks. Oh, I see. So they all have a friend, Agatha. That's a duck. It's what? Caroline likes flowers and a little budgie, a watering can. I love the fact that they've done... Are all these patterns in here, then, as well? Yeah, the yeah, doll. Everything, yeah, yeah. Everything's in there, isn't it? £9.09. Pounds and nine pence. 
It's only just hit the warehouse, this as well. Oh, is this brand new as well? Brand new, yeah. Brand new, brand new, brand new. £9 lamp, it's 30% off today. Gorgeous. And then one more. Brand new. Cricket, now you'll need a cricket machine when to do this one. Digital die cutting for any event from Laura Strutt. Should be £12.99. 30% off. You know it's going to 9 09 then. Beautiful. Now, I tell you, you'd like this. Susie Duncan would like this one. I see her the other day. Hmm? I see Susie the other day. Did you? You've seen a lot of people this week. I have, yeah. yeah. When you go elsewhere, you say, oh, I saw John Scott this week. I oh, do. Yeah, yeah. 909, £9.09, 30% 9 off. Now, remember, if you've bought anything from this show, your name will go into a hat and one of you will win 10 extra books, as well as the two that you've bought. You'll pay for those and then you'll get a bundle with 10 extra books in it. With love from Jason. <laughs> right, yeah. Beautiful, look at this. Gorgeous, nine pounds and nine pence. Right, Hannah just wants to quickly, before we go, go through the two for 15, which, which were these, weren't they? These ones, yeah, these ones. Yeah, yeah thank you. All right. I've been doing this a long time. Have you? Yeah. Got a book. Don't touch me. Have you got a book? Have I got what? A book. Have I got a book? Yeah. Yeah. Do you not know? Right. These are, these are, two, two, I'm not, some of these might have sold out. These are two for £15, right? So that one there is £12.99 normally. That one there is £12.99 normally. These are new and incredible, the fastest sellers. They come out in January and they're our two fastest selling books this year. <clears throat> Okay, 250 people, over 250 people have taken advantage of this deal. And there's still 150 people in baskets. Now it's your time to check out. Right, now, some combinations aren't going to hot. We don't know what combinations you've got, but we don't, some of them won't do. Sarah Payne now is now very limited. So there's this one. You can choose any two of these for £15. And Beginner Guides to Crochet is limited. And then the refashioned one. There, that one, limited now. So you can choose any two of these, but I can't guarantee you're going to get it with 125 people in the baskets. The best thing you can do is if you've got it in your basket, check out. If you haven't got it in your basket, put it in and check out straight away. Any two for £15. I'm covering them up now. It's not good, is it? There you go. Any two of those for £15. Brilliant. So, Jason, when are you coming back next? I'll come back in a couple of months, yeah. Will you? Yeah, I enjoyed that. Did you? Yeah. You always say that. You come in all grumpy, <laughs> and then you go home all happy. Well, it's nice to give something back, and, you know, thanks to all your customers that support us, so we do appreciate it. There you go. So, remember, check out, check out, check out. Uh, one of you will get an extra ten free books in your parcel. If a big parcel arrives, you think, oh, I only bought two books. Doesn't matter. One book. Doesn't matter. One of you will win 10 free books and it won't be a copy of the one you've already bought. You'll get the one you bought plus 10 others. That's great. And I'll personally send them out. Personally? Personally. All right. Give us a hug. Cheers, mate. Oh, it's always lovely to see you. Right. Don't go anywhere. What have I got next? Oh, a bag handles. Bag handles and some canvas and things like that. He'll see you in a few weeks' time. I'll see you in four minutes. <laughs> Hi, I'm Becky. I'm the soft craft expert for Crafters Companion. Um, I come from London and I've been sewing pretty much all my life. I particularly enjoy doing embroidery. I'm really keen on that, but I've, I've, my background is um, dressmaking and also sort of patchwork and quilting. Um, so I do an awful lot of sewing for all sorts of different things. I suppose once you start sewing, you start doing lots of other kinds of sewing. So I particularly like got into needlepoint um, during lockdown, but I suppose embroidery is probably my real passion. 
my mum was a costume designer, um, so we were always sort of surrounded by bits of fabric and material and ribbons and that kind of thing. And I was always making teddies um, and my dolls' clothes as a small child. So it was just something that was quite natural. And in fact, I've got so used to being able to sew, um, it's just become a natural sort of part of what I do. Um, I'm always fiddling around with fabric, as my husband puts it, um, making something new, um, trying something out. Always measure twice, cut once. Um, I'm a great one for not doing that and I always regret it. And making sure that you've got an iron to hand is really important. I use a tiny little, um, sort of almost like a travel iron that I have right next to my desk when I'm working so it doesn't take up too much space. Here at Sewing Street, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the combine order button. Remember, standard P&P is £3.95. Charges may differ for outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option for £5.95 on certain items. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to sewing or a seasoned pro, you're sure to learn something new. We're live every day from 8am till 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Sewing Street gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says gift cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email, then decide the value that you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion, or just a way to say thank you, the Sewing Street gift card is the perfect answer. Did you know at Sewing Street that on various products we offer split pay? That means on certain items you can spread the cost over two, three, four, or sometimes even five interest-free monthly payments. Just pay the first instalment when you purchase and you're away. So shop your way with Split Pay. Shopping with Sewing Street couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.sewingstreet.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your sewing room essentials to fabrics, sewing machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Sewing Street app. Simply head over to your app store and search Sewing Street. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Did you know that we can deliver to over 20 different countries worldwide, spanning four continents from the UK to Australia? Check out our website for the list of countries and delivery costs. Sewing Street, stitching the world together. And we'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. Bye. Did you know that you can continue shopping 24 hours a day, seven days a week, even after we've finished broadcasting live? Just head over to www.sewingstreet.com for thousands of sewing supplies available from top brands. You still pay only one PMP with split pay available on certain items and an easy checkout service too. Plus, you can get expert advice and tips from our Sewing Street hub and UK customer support is available 24-7. So head over to sewingstreet.com and continue your sewing journey. Did you know at Sewing Street that on various products we offer split pay? That means on certain items you can spread the cost over two, three, four or sometimes even five interest-free monthly payments. 
Just pay the first instalment when you purchase and you're away. So shop your way with Split Pay. Got bag making. Uh, Jason says goodbye to everyone, by the way. Uh, he had a lovely time. He said, I like coming here. Um, right, uh, bag making. Oh, we've got some gorgeous um, canvases. I, th I think they might be Panama canvases. Uh, for some reason, I've got an, a random piece of glittery PVC. I've got webbing. I've got clasps. I've got all sorts. Oh, I've not seen those before. Anyway, uh, we'll start with some faux leather bag handles, shall I? Which one am I doing first? Black first. Oh, no, Hannah's got hiccups. That's because you've been eating too fast. Lemon 99, black faux leather, so on, with a gold joiner. Oh, Charlie's got his chair out. Lemon 99, these are. They're faux but leather. They're nice quality, those. With the gold joiner there. They are 52 centimetres long. That must be from there to there. Beautiful. Keep going through. Let's see if I've missed any messages out. Eleven ninety nine, eleven pounds and ninety nine pence are nice, aren't they? I'll just show you them there. Like, like, let it go. That's how long they are. Look. If you're a wag, no. I sometimes when I get in the car in the morning, I put all my bags over my arms like that. Bless you. Hannah's got a bad cold. She'll be dreadful tomorrow. There you go. Eleven ninety nine. You won't. <laughs> oh, she's had a lemp sip. She feels better than she when she woke up. Anyway, they're the black ones with the gold joiners. <laughs> then which colourway now? The pale ones. I wonder what colour they've called this. Cream, clotted cream. Yeah, it's like clotted cream, isn't it? That lovely soft. Oh, they're really expensive looking, these. Eleven ninety nine. These will really finish your bag off. If you made a bag, these will really finish them off beautifully, won't they? Got holes there so you can stitch through. They're already punched through. Actually, what I would do, I would get my uh, tailors all and go through them again because they haven't gone completely through to the other side just for ease of stitching. So all the riveting is done for you. All you need to do is stitch that and that to the bag. They're very, they look very designer. Don't they? They look like you're going to one of those, um, well, none of us can afford the real things. You know, the outlet shops where they have the ones that they look so expensive. And it's really, really good quality faux leather as well. Eleven ninety nine. What's going on in there? You what was? Eleven ninety nine. That was your coat making that funny noise. I haven't done the tan one yet. Oh, okay, that's what the noise was. Beautiful. Go through for those. Now I've got them in the uh, tan. I'm going to call it tan. I'm not sure what colour they've called it. Uh, brown. Brown. They're all posh. Really, really posh looking ones, aren't they? They're all 52 centimetres in length. So that's your black, your cream and your brown. Lovely. Now, uh, glue, solvent glue, very, very important. Gutemann solvent glue. Lisa Lamb doesn't go anywhere without hers for bag making. 5 99 Lasts you a long time, this, because you only need tiny, tiny, tiny little dabs of it. She puts hers on, doesn't she, when she's doing her uh, saddle stitching with the end of an old uh, quick and pick. Yeah, tiny. Teeny, teeny, tiny. You can see there by the dots they put on that ribbon. 5 99 Last of ages, this will. Okay, lovely. Webbing, cut by the half metre. What colour would you like first? Black. There you go. There's your black webbing there. 
Now, you're buying this by the half metre, right? So it's like fabric. You can choose to have half metre, one metre, one and a half, two, two and a half, three, to come in one piece. It's only 69p for half a metre. And it's an inch wide, inch wide. Uh, and it's cotton, this one. Cotton, this one. Beautiful, 69. That one's lovely and soft. It's not like a... Some of them are a bit hard, aren't they, and harsh. That's not, it's because it's cotton, that one. So you're buying it, that's half a metre, right? But you're buying it by the half metre. We cut it off the roll for you at the length you want. It comes joined up, like joined up writing. Balloon, oh, now this is, comp this isn't, right. Okay, this, do not use this as a bag handle. This is a herringbone tape that you use to cover up seams and things like that. Yes, it's twill tape. So it, it's lovely. But we're not doing it now because it's not part of the bag. No, 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 no. It, on the website, it'll look exactly the same, wouldn't it? No, it isn't. No. Okay, this is not a twill tape. This is identical to the blue one. Uh, not the blue one, the black one. The black one that we had. Identical to the black one. So, no, that's not twill tape at all. Uh, but it's 99p, that one. Now, I wonder why the black one was 69p. So 99p, this one. Good quality, though. Really, really, really good quality. Yeah. Yep, yeah. and then I've got khaki. Now, khaki's not cotton. Khaki's not cotton. Okay. Oh. <laughs> that one's not cotton. It's, I have some cotton in it, but that one's definitely got polyester in it. Yeah, look, that one's the sturdy one. That one there. In the khaki, again, cut to order. 69p. They thought the black one is, cut, is the same as that, but it's not, you see. Anyway, I'm honest. I'm just being honest with you. I'm just telling you, because you wouldn't want to get that home and think it was a lovely soft... I mean, it is lovely, but it's the sturdier one with the polyester mix in it. You can always tell if you burn the end, because the polyester will, uh, will um, bobble. OK, that was that one. OK, red now. <laughs> Okay, 49p. Okay, 49p. Cut to order, just take advantage. See, that and that are identical. I think, yes, I think the webbing department needs looking into. I think what it is, is we've got them from different um, suppliers and different suppliers. Yes, yeah. Anyway, this is 49p for half a metre. Beautiful. And then, yeah, everyone's buying multiple Of course you are. Of course you are. And then I've got light grey. Let's see what it says. This is definitely polypropylene. Yeah. 49p polypropylene. Polypropylene. Isn't that what the, 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 the thingies are made of? That's what, you know, little weights that we sell. You know, the, the bag of, yeah, polypropylene. Again, cut to order. Yes, yeah, yeah. That's the other ones. Yeah. Gorgeous. Lovely. I have. Silver, rectangular loops here, 25 millimetre. So the webbing I've just shown you. There you go. They're posh, oh, would you put it through that one, wouldn't you? Because it's got, that's got the seal on it there. There you go. There you go. Three ninety eight, you get all four for three ninety eight. They're a pound each then. Pound each look. Three ninety eight. Good morning, says Gillian. Good morning, Gillian. Everyone's saying good morning, Gillian. All four of those for three ninety eight. I've got those in oh, they're nice. Matte black. Oh, I think they're lovely.
Hij kan. That's sleek, isn't it? That one. 398 for four. You obviously don't get the web, I'm just showing you the different. Beautiful, £3.98. Oh, there's your black webbing cut to order on the right-hand side, and there's your four um, rectangles there for £3.98. They're lovely. Have I seen these before? They're lovely. Oh, it's the only Vix has had these. Yeah, she kept those a secret, didn't she? I wonder if she got any for Kieran for his birthday. Oh, that's how you know. Three ninety eight. Beautiful. And I've got them also in bronze. Oh yeah. Oh, they're nice as well. They're like a kind of, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, not tarnished, but um, not tempered. Not weathered, no. So if Hannah was in Game of Thrones, she'd have armour this colour, apparently. Are you like that tall lady that looks after them all? Brienne. She's called Brienne. Kalisu is my favourite. Yeah. Three twenty-eight. Do you mean uh, not Bill Nye here? You mean um, the blonde man? Yeah. Scottish man. He's Scottish in real life. Hang on, what I've worked with him on a film. What film did I work with him on? Yeah, he's a lovely man. Come. Three ninety-eight. Oh, that's nice. Remind me never to meet Steph. Right, moving on. I haven't got them in another colour, but I've got D rings. Yeah, because they match matte black D rings. 25 mil again. 199 for two. There you go, just get two of those for your 199, 25 millimeter. Beautiful. She's not a giant. Oh, you mean the giant's in it? She's still on Game of Thrones. Right, now these are your yellow gold. Yeah. Let's see if we've got any other D-rings on here. Oh, no, I've got D-rings. Right, these are... Right, okay. Are they yellow or are they rose? Because look... Yeah, you see, those in there are bright yellow, aren't they? Where's the, that? They are yellow gold. Yeah, these are much chunkier. Nothing wrong with that. Burnished, thank you, from Jeanette. Jeanette in Merseyside. Burnished, thank you. That is the word I was looking for. Hi, John and Jason. Oh, he's gone. Sitting with a coffee, enjoying the banter. What great bargains. Love Debbie Shaw's books. Are you at AC, John, next week? What day? Janet, Thursday. Thursday. I think it's the opening day, isn't it? I'm doing this on the stage now. Yeah. Uh, but we're not in the sewing bit. We're in the crafting bit for some reason. Because we're called Gemporia Craft, I think. But I'll, I'll find out what stand we're on. And I'll let you know before Thursday. Yeah, that's what I was looking at. I mean, it's got them. I've got them in three different colours, haven't I? 25 mil. So I've got uh, silver, rose gold, and multicoloured. Oh. 
Yeah, gold D-rings in the packet. I'll do those in a minute, the ones I just mentioned. That's right. You get four in these. They're not as chunky as the other ones. One ninety-nine for four. They're still 25 millimetre, though. Because I've got those in silver as well. Fabulous. Silver, always very popular for bag making. Remember, though, all the bag handles I've had so far have had gold connectors. All these bag bits are good to stock up on because when you make a bag, I've never got the right metal work. No, Julie Vaughan, that's what I'm always saying now. These are all 25 mil. Beautiful. Right, who, who's got a guest on with them? It sounds like Toby. Yeah, it sounds like Toby. Gorgeous. Next, oh, then the triangular ones. So which one do you want to do first? Rainbow. Oh. This is the only rainbow thing I've got on the show today. Uh, new tri rainbow triangular loop. You get both of them. 25 minutes. I've only been on air once before. So if you have got other rainbowy bits that you've got from us, they look like Superman's T-shirt, don't they? Isn't that, what's the other have that hit there, like that? Above his pants. Three ninety nine for both of them. Message on my bottom. Uh, hi, John. What's you from Grenada? Ooh, as I'm abroad at the moment. Well, you would be if you're in Grenada. It's 6.20 a.m., so I thought I'd watch a little bit before getting up. Pauline, how lovely. Aw. Yeah, you're having a nice time in the Caribbean. Three ninety nine. I've been to St Lucia. Went to St Lucia once. I spent a lot more time in police custody at the end at the airport coming back than I did on my whole holiday. It was very strange. I, I was waiting for the bags going round, and I kept thinking, "Where's my bag?" And everyone else had gone, and I was standing there thinking, "I don't know what to do now because my bag hasn't come through." And then just as I was about to walk away, my bag came through. And I was like, oh, that's weird. So I stepped forward to get my bag. As I stepped forward to get my bag, I was aware of people like going, oh, like this. So I got my bag like that. And then I went through customs. Nothing to declare because I hadn't got anything to declare. Anyway, I got stopped. They emptied my suitcase. They checked my pockets. They questioned me. All sorts of things. All sorts of things. It was, I, was, uh, I had a taxi. I was very smartly dressed. Apparently, I, I said afterwards, why did you pick on me? And they went, well, because you were a single man. I was travelling first class at the time. Single man travelling first class, well dressed. So I said, so if I come through in my scruffy jeans and go economy, you won't stop me in the future. And they kind of went, well, yeah. Anyway, I had nothing. I had a bag of spices in my bag. I don't know if they thought that was something suspicious. Anyway, which colour next? Gold ones next. And I got home and my next door, my new next door neighbours were there. And I, they, she worked for customs and excise, wherever the people are. And she said, oh, just check to see if, any, she, she, did you send any postcards? And I was like, yeah, loads of, it was back in the day when you sent postcards. I said, loads of postcards. She went, just check who gets theirs and who doesn't get theirs. So I did. I rang everybody up. And all the people who lived in London, because I was living in London at the time, didn't get their postcards. But all the people up north like family and everything, all got their postcards. So I went back to her and I said, you were right. All my London postcards did... She said, now, because what happens is they'll have been looking for... They'll have been intercepted and they'll have been looking for microfilm on your full stops and your dots above your eye. Because you, to, to, that's what they do is you put a little bit of... I'm giving away trade secrets now, aren't I? You put microfilm on the dot of the eye or the full stop and they scrape it off and they can read secret messages. I hadn't. I hadn't done microfilm. I'd just done big full stops and big... So all that for nothing. I can't tell you the second part of the story, but I'll tell you that another day. Beautiful. 
Yeah, they do that sometimes. Don't they have people with those, like, toilet duck things that swab you as you go past? As if it was your suitcase, yeah. Julie Vaughan loves Granada. Uh, the, they bring you a cooler of beer on the beach. Oh, Julie Vaughan, when I was in um, St. Lucia, they gave you a flag when you're on the beach. And every time you wanted to drink, you just waved your flag like that. Anyway, these are the silver ones. Three ninety nine. Did they know you were going to Wolverhampton? In where? Is that even worse? Beautiful. Right. I've got plastic buckles. I've got the adjuster and the buckle. You want the buckle first? 25 mil again, quick release clip for bags. 199. Black strap buckle. Good for your money bag or your um, bum bag, am I allowed to say that? Can't say what it's called. Oh, I think my microphone went then. Why did it do that then? Is it because Toby's talking too loudly and he's taking all the, all the energy? Actually, stop talking. Yeah, he'll be in nicking the biscuit thing. Oh, now, we've, you know, this, we've got a new security guard and they're making him sit at reception now. Normally, you're coming through the gates and they stop you at the gate, right? Now, they're at a reception desk sitting around and he's obviously freezing cold. He's got a big woolly hat on, his big coat on. And then Lynn walked through and goes, Pooh, doesn't it smell in here? <laughs> it wasn't him, but it looked like it was. Strap adjusters for bags, luggage, straps, and camping. Oh, now, apparently, you just bleeped me out. Did you bleep me out? Was that when my microphone went down? They all, they all think I was swearing, and they thought they bleeped you out. There's no, there's no delay here, so they can't do that. One pound forty-nine. One pound forty-nine. I wouldn't swear on air, so it wouldn't need bleeping, but I might say something inappropriate. Oh, Christi Christine's holding a grudge. I'm still upset you didn't receive my Valentine's card. I'm be oh, I'm beginning to wonder why. Had bright red dots on it. They think it's microfilm, Christine. Yeah. Oh, no, we've had nothing. We haven't even had a little card saying you have to pay extra postage. Oh. Aircon going off. Yeah, very aware of noise around me today. Oh, I see what I, mean. I couldn't understand what you were saying. Bird. Oh, yeah. Bird. Bird. Is it just in three colourways, the bird? Which way I want to actually first? Silver bird. Right, this is a, a clasp for your bag. I've not seen this one before either. You get everything to go on the back of it and everything. It's just Dan didn't want to get them all out. I understand that. But look. Oh. It's laid an egg. What's the matter? Did I drop out again? Right, hang on a sec. Let me just check. No, it's just on my belt as normal. It's not stuck. The aerial's not stuck up my shirt or anything. It's loose. Four ninety nine. So the way it undoes is like that, and it pops through like that. So you put that on your flap, and that on the main of your bag, and then you put that over there like that. And you can lock it like that. My microphone's not up there, Charlie. He's, my microphone's playing up, but he's looking at the roof. What are you pointing? What are you pointing at? Oh, well, the receiver that's just held on two elastic bands to the scaffolding, that one, you mean? You think I'm joking. They're not elastic bands. Uh, you can't see me, because Charlie's uh, in here with me. But they're those um, cable tie things. 
just hold it. There's two of them around this receptor hanging from the um, scaffolding above my head. Yeah, fourth wall and all that. Is that what they call it? What colour? It's all right now, is it? What colour? Gold. Same thing. Now, have you seen they're making a musical about Buck's Fizz? Well, I don't know if it's about Buck's Fizz or if it's like Mamma Mia where they use the Buck's Fizz songs to make a... It's on telly yesterday, was it before? I didn't like the film. No. I haven't seen the second one. Four ninety nine. Beautiful. Then I've also got it in like is this copper or bronze? Bronze, yeah, brushed one, yeah. Cute, isn't it? Oh no, Toby's back. Yeah. Uh, Pauline, what's the number two? Uh, Pauline, it's uh, Hobby Maker's second birthday. Your telly must be bad if you can't read that, Pauline. Second birthday for Hobby Maker. It was their birthday on Monday, which is why we weren't on air, and they're doing a whole week of celebration like we were. So, because we share a studio, you couldn't see it yesterday because the quilts were hanging up over it yesterday. We've hidden all the balloons. And that's why when you see Shirley, she's got a whole archway of balloons sitting behind her. No, we didn't get balloons just for Shirley. Beautiful. Now, butterflies next, just in two colours, the butterflies. Silver sold out. Gold first. There you go, there's the clasp on this one. There you go, look. Four ninety nine. Don't encourage her, Daniel. Four ninety nine. Then I've got it in the bronze. I rather like the bronze one. Nice, isn't that one? No, oh, it's trying to fly away. Look, dead alive. Ooh, ooh. Wants to get back to the butterfly farm in uh, Stratford upon Avon. Avon. Lovely. Oh, she's on the phone. That's why she couldn't see it. Okay, I'll let you off. I'll let you off then, Paulie. Can't you do that on a film? You can't, can you? Two more clasps. Yeah. The stag. Now, this is a different clasp, this one. It's not in two parts, right? What you do is you attach it to your bag and then the flap comes down and that folds over the, cl the, the flap. Four ninety nine, And I've got a bow. There you go. Very shiny, the silver. It's got a lot of fingerprints on that one. That's Dan, so I can take it to the police station now. Well, I'm a bit all surprised. He broke my bug. He punched a guest. He went on the wrong motorway this morning. It's true. I'm not saying anything. It's not true, Dan. £5.79, the silver bow bag glock clasp. Beautiful. Now I'm going to do some canvases, am I? Is that what you said? Yes, right here. OK, I'm starting here. These are gorgeous. NZLJ57. Oh, look, it's got the Monstera plant on it, this one. This is beautiful. Now, this is a very, very soft canvas. You're going to make bags out of this. You will need to put interfacing on the back. They're 100% cotton. Oh, 
140 centimetres wide. I'm going to hold it up for you, before you do that, before you do that. Look. Look at that. Hang on, how wide did you say they were? 140. That feels wider than that. I'll measure it now. I'll measure it now. But I've got one there in my box, so... Have a look at that then from upstairs while I get my tape measure. It's beautiful, isn't it? Okay, it's 56 inches. Oh, it is 140. Felt wider than that. Felt wider. Right, 100% cotton, 140 wide, selling it by the half metre. Should be six, nine times. So, yeah, really, really good price. I've got to be wowed by the... Oh, what? That's brilliant. That's brilliant. Now, it feels like a linen weight fabric, this. You can make a lovely skirt out of this. Or trousers. Make a gorgeous pair of trousers, this. Um, it looks like a Panama to me, but they normally write Panama in it, don't they? Beautiful, but only three ninety nine. That is fantastic. Let's just look at the weave. Yeah, it is Panama or half Panama. I think it is half Panama. Digitally printed, beautiful. Be uh, isn't that gorgeous though? Cushions. Imagine uh, the cushion. You can make beautiful cushions out of this. Oh. <gasps> Cushions, bags, tote bag, trousers, loose fitting, like a loose jacket, casual jacket. Have a look. Looky, looky, look, look, that's half a metre. Obviously, you're buying off the bolt, so whatever you want, buy half metre increments you can have. Stunning, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. I'm just thinking, I'm thinking outside. You know, now you're, we're going to be getting our garden furniture out soon, aren't we? Okay, you've got to be careful. Loads and loads of people in for this one. I don't know how you can't, because everyone else can, Hannah. What you just said to me. Oh, okay. Right. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Beautiful, three ninety nine. Well, no, no, because I always go, we can't. And Kat goes, yeah, you can. It's this and it's that and it's the other. Well, I shouldn't say that. Three ninety nine. I'll have to come and look at that screen one day to see if so I can understand what you're talking about. Beautiful. Oh, now, I'll carry on with plantage then. Oh, yes. So, it's not amazing. This is the same fabric, but with a dark background. So, that was daytime. So, that was this morning. And that one there is the one show. Mind you, it went, as I came round the corner again, it was into Redditch. This morning, it was muck, I nearly got crushed by two lorries, but that's the thing. But the, it was actually breaking daylight as I came in. It was incredible. Me? At 3.99, I tell you what I did this morning. I woke up thinking, oh, I think I must have an hour left in bed. And I looked at my alarm clock and I had one minute before the alarm went off. And I was like, oh, I can't believe that. Anyway, look, 3.99, beautiful. Beautiful. That's gorgeous. I still prefer, I think I prefer the natural background, but it's incredible, isn't it? Oh, no, Hannah likes it. Or you can make, if you're making cushions, make that of both. Be lovely. Change with your mood. Well, blame me, they'd be on and off with Hannah, wouldn't they? Oh, this mood, that mood, this mood, that mood. <laughs> right, let's go to... 
And I'm just, uh, they're all lovely, these. Uh, so I'm going to do this one next. Oh, oh, that one's flipping gorgeous, isn't it? We match the price. Only have been on there once before. Navy, just called it navy cotton. They have undersold it. Look at the lovely pink tinges in there. Do you think they're um, peonies? I think they are peonies, aren't they? Is it going on vintage? Are you going up this weekend? Oh, lovely. Three ninety-nine. Steph going. That's beautiful, isn't it? Country to country, the radio two thing. Oh wow. No. No, I don't like it, but I know it's big. That's why it's Steph's, uh, uh, Hannah's boyfriend, Steph's working there this weekend. Oh, he'll love that. He'll be swaggering home in his cowboy boots. Yeah. And where? Oh, you didn't tell me Girls Aloud. When's he doing Girls Aloud? Oh, okay. Uh, right, have I got that one? I haven't got that one in a different colour. That one's about to sell out. I'll do this one next. I've got this one in two colours. This is like cherry blossom, this one. Look. Cream first. Beautiful look. Everybody I know is going to uh, Japan at the moment. Oh, Julie Vaughan loves C2C. She's been a couple of times. Are you going this year? You'll see Steph. He's not singing. He's just won the backing dancers. He'll be up a ladder. 3 99 What is he doing there? Oh, he's not up the ladder. Oh, he sounds very exciting, his job. Three nine nine. Don't get bitter. You want him to do well in his career. You have to charge him more rent now. Then. Three ninety nine. Isn't it lovely? Look at the size of that pattern. Now, just put my hand in. Beautiful. I've also got that with like an olive khaki background, or sage, is it? I bought one of those steam mops and was very, very disappointed. Well, it doesn't, no, 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 it's no good for slate floors, I don't think. Oh, moss, this is called moss. Yeah, but then one of my neighbours bought me one of those like great big industrial, you know these? <laughs> to clean the floors with, yeah? Three ninety nine, moss. They've called this one moss. Do you remember when little Paul used to call himself Titan Moss? Yeah, we had fabric. It wasn't a Hannah's Basic, was it? It was um, oh, it was what was that? Yeah, but it was one of those that was solids with dots on it and things like that, wasn't it? Yeah, and that uh, one was called Titan Moss, and he went, oh, I think I'll use that as my stage name. When he wanted to be a stripper. Three ninety nine. That's gorgeous, isn't it? Garden furniture, I'm thinking. Oh right, I, I, I'll cu I'll come back and recap all these uh, canvases. Right now, this is beautiful. This one. This is like honesty. Oh, I love this one. Just cream, it just called it cream. How have they just called it cream? I love, it's like, um, it, now, that, like that book that James was selling early, you know, like when you practice your watercolour. 
Just doing that. I think these are meant to be honesty, these. But honesty comes in white, not grey. So I'm not quite sure I've got that wrong. Oh, look, there's the bud. There must be poppies. But how gorgeous, that subtle, washable cream cotton. Well, no, no, I'm thinking about garden, you know, cushions in the garden in the summer. Well, no, I was thinking if, if, well, if anyone comes around like you and spills red wine all over it. <coughs> Oh, good. Three ninety. This is stunning. Let me hold it up for you. Look at that. Oh, I think that's really beautiful. Toby likes it as well. Yeah, it's good. They can do both sales at the same time, isn't it? Yep. Can't, I can't deal with the fact he wears plastic sliders with socks underneath them, though. It's on trend, is it? Well, Toby's not on trend. He won't know that. Now, I know about Crocs and socks, because um, Jacob in the, in the Barbers does that, and, and he wears it, and the track suit's track, The track suit is tucked into his sock. Oh, it's for warmth. I thought it would stop the mice climbing up your legs. Well, I live in the countryside, don't I? So, right, my... Well, they don't mind, because my, my, I've got drawstrings on the bottom of my trousers. For the mice, yeah. Next, do a special deal for the countryside trousers. And do you know what? I didn't know till this morning that I had drawstrings on the bottom of my trousers. Has anyone put my shoes on? I thought, what's that getting in the way there? It's one of those, like, little toggle things. Anyway. Okay, uh, now I've got this kind of Scandi looking one. Oh no. Oh, shopping ahead. This is very low in stock, this one already. Going to the same price. Now, if you've already checked out, don't worry. Don't worry. If you've already checked out, you'll pay the final low price. There's only five metres, this one left now. Five metres. It's lovely, isn't it? Now, where would you put that one then? Dan wants us to make a hat out of it for him. Well, it would have to be like a brimmed hat. It wouldn't be a stretchy hat like the one you're wearing. Bucket hat. Do you like Oasis? Or was it Blur that wore bucket hats? I can't remember. Well, he, he, he wants heavy metal hat. Yeah. Yeah. 3.99. That's the job when you go on holiday and you put a hat on and everyone like because it's, it's not normal, is it? Three ninety nine. He wasn't there. Three ninety nine. Beautiful. Just five metres that left, but it will go, that will go, that will go. Now I've got two with berries on, one with berries and flowers, and one with berries on their own. So I'll do the one with flowers first. It's a bigger print, this one. The other berries one I've got coming up, and it has a smaller print. They're now, they have called it white cotton canvas. The selvage is white. The background's like um, ecru or soft putty, pale putty. The leaves are green and grey and the flowers are red. If you've got any in baskets, please be careful. Got one more show and then, yeah, I've got one more to show after this and that's it. If you don't want berries, then check out now. Beautiful. Then the one with berries. A bit William Morris esque, this one. It's very nice. There you go. Winter berries, this one's called. Winter berries. Doesn't have to be winter berries, though. 3 99 
3.99 half a meter. Beautiful. So which is your favourite? Which have you bought? Which are you check it out on? Ch -ch -ch check it out. Not long till Shirley and Bruce are on. We haven't got Bruce's end table out yet. He needs a sewing machine. He's doing that again. He's setting it up, is he? At what, in the green room? <laughs> Bruce will be doing an outside broadcast from the green room. Yep. At one, sold out. I'm going to show the first one I started with, which was this one, uh, the aspid, no, not aspidistra, the um, cheese plant in the daytime. Remember, it should be 6 99 over half the stock's gone. It's lovely. It's orchids, aren't they? It must be jungly, this. What are they called? Oh, they haven't called it anything, have they? That's a banana plant. Then you've got your monstera there, cheese plant. So banana, cheese. That's banana. Cheese. They're lovely, aren't they, those? They're gorgeous, but they're quite difficult to keep, those. Anyway, 3 99 that's the daytime version. Less than 10 metres, that one, and you need to check out. Then I've got the nighttime version. Who's that? Who? Oh, okay. Sound like cat. Producer cat? Sheen today. 3 that's your de That's your nighttime version. Remember, it's meant to be six ninety nine. Third, that stock's gone. Lots in baskets. Loads of people just popping in their baskets. You do need to check out. Yeah, 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 yeah. This one. Oh, now this one. Right. Okay. We had loads of this one for some reason. I don't know if it hadn't been on air before or what. But but I've only got I've got less than ten meters now. Less than 10 metres, and we had bolts of this. Right, it's flying out, flying out, seven metres now. Good morning, John, how are you? Can't believe I forgot to tune into your live on Sunday. Yeah, I wonder where you were, Vayan. There'll be another one this Sunday. 3 it's gorgeous, isn't it? Check out, check out, should be 6 99 so elegant, isn't it? Looks like it's really, really expensive. If you make cushion covers out of that and look like you bought them in that posh garden centre and spent a fortune, I might maybe, if you can do piping, I'd do a pale blue piping as well. Or pom pom. Gorgeous. Check out, check out. That's going to sell out. That's going to sell out. Cherry blossom with the ivory background. Right, eight meters this left, but loads in baskets. Oh, hang on, it's got a direction. There you go. Three ninety nine. Gorgeous, and then I've got it with the moss background. No, moss not as popular. I love the moss one. There you go. So really, I, you see, I think maybe the moss, it's called moss is putting you off because it's not moss. Hannah loves moss in real life. That's... She just, she went like this. I said, Hannah loves moss because she's their MA on moss and mud and things like that. And then uh, she went, yeah, don't like the uh, investigator there. And we were all like, what? And she went, you know, moss. That's posh moss. Three ninety nine. Does your phone not pick it up on to, to spelling? No, you've missed an eye out. Well done, well done, well done. 
Well, it's like your sat nav, isn't it? If you go a different way, suddenly, like this morning, my sat nav, I came home a different way last night because I wanted to just do a different journey. And this morning, sat nav's trying to make me go that way. And I was like, no, I'm going this way. Bridge still isn't open. Anyway, uh, coming up after the break, we've got Shirley and Bruce Rutterpar with uh, three brand new rulers and a recap of the teddy bear. We'll see you in four. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Cara Ackerman and I'm absolutely delighted to be here at Sewing Street. Um, I actually originated from Hertfordshire, then went down to Hampshire and then it ended up in the East Midlands. I've been in the East Midlands for about 40 years now, which seems crazy. Um, but 36 of those I actually worked with DMC Creative World, um, which was wonderful. I really, really enjoyed that. And then um, I decided to go freelance, and that's how I got introduced to Sewing Street. I love doing anything to do with um, textiles, so embroidery, cross-stitch, patchwork, done a bit of quilting, bag making, toy making, oh goodness, there's loads and loads of things. Um, what I love doing is just trying something new, and I think one of the tips is don't be frightened of trying something new. Um, you always learn from it, and you know, don't be scared of making mistakes either. We all learn from the mistakes that we make. Um, little bit about me that you might not know and that's a bit of a surprise. Um, I once went to the garden party down at Buckingham Palace, the Queen's Garden Party, for some work that I did with Marie Curie. I was so, so lucky to go there and just a wonderful time. Um, so I hope to see more of you on Sewing Street and I hope to try lots of new crafts with you. So see you again soon. Bye bye. Shopping with Sewing Street couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.sewingstreet.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your sewing room essentials to fabrics, sewing machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Sewing Street app. Simply head over to your app store and search Sewing Street. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Sewing Street gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email, then decide the value that you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion, or just a way to say thank you, the Sewing Street gift card is the perfect answer. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects, and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to sewing or a seasoned pro, you're sure to learn something new. We're live every day from 8am till 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Did you know at Sewing Street that on various products we offer split pay? That means on certain items, you can spread the cost over two, three, four, or sometimes even five interest-free monthly payments. Just pay the first instalment when you purchase and you're away. So shop your way with Split Pay. And we'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. Bye. Did you know that you can continue shopping 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Even after we finish broadcasting live, just head over to www.sewingstreet.com for thousands of sewing supplies available from top brands. You still pay only one PMP with split pay available on certain items and an easy checkout service too. Plus, you can get expert advice and tips from our Sewing Street hub and UK customer support is available 24-7. So head over to SewingStreet.com and continue your sewing journey. Shopping with Sewing Street couldn't be easier. 
You can shop via our website at www.sewingstreet.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your sewing room essentials to fabrics, sewing machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Sewing Street app. Simply head over to your app store and search Sewing Street. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Here at Sewing Street, we only charge one P&P throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard P&P is £3.95. Charges may differ for outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option for £5.95 on certain items. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. We're proud to have some of the most skilled and experienced experts in the industry. They're brought to you here every day on Sewing Street. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Sewing Street gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says gift cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email, then decide the value that you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion, or just a way to say thank you, the Sewing Street gift card is the perfect answer. Shirley and Bruce are with me. This is Bruce, in case you were confused. Say hello, Bruce. Hello. hello. This is Shirley. Say hello, Shirley. Hello, Shirley. I knew she was going to do that, <laughs> just in case. Now, I think you and Rebecca Reed have been at the same dye bottle this week. She, her hair was that colour this week as well. Did you do two for one, a bob yeah, bottle? Something like that. Right, now, Shirley and Bruce, as you know, are from Pars Rulers. Not Rutter Par Rulers. I've got very confused this morning. Pars Rulers, right? Yeah. Uh, which is, they make free motion easy. It's as simple as that. But before we start, we've got three brand new rulers today and we're recapping the teddy bear one because Shirley messed up last time, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> how quickly they... Yeah, how could you say that? I'll be over there in a minute. You can slap me in a minute. <laughs> before we start on any of the rulers or anything like that, we just want to show you this table that Bruce has developed for your sewing machine or for your overlocker to make a bigger space. Because oh, we know all sewing machines come with an extension table, but when you're doing free motion, you want to work from the end of the table, not in front of the table. So Bruce developed this extension table, which means you can work more easily doing free motion on your machine. Isn't that right, Bruce? That's absolutely right. Right, yeah. so how, tell us how it works, and then we'll explain to you how you order it and everything. Right, it works by working from this end. Yeah. So you sit here. You sit in there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. End on. Right. You can We've, move if you want to. You, move. Me okay. you, you, you well, measure across. Yeah. Including the if you if you have got toolboxes on. Yeah. You measure across toolbox as well. You leave your toolbox on. If you've just got free arm, just measure the free arm. Yeah. We then make an insert. Right. So all fit. the tables are this big. The table is that big. Oh, for everybody's machine? Yes. But then depending on how big this is, you make the that infill to make sure it fits your machine. The thing that makes it across so, universal. So what do we need to know if we're ordering this from you? The width across the toolbox. Right, we've got a slide to show you this. So the width yeah. across the toolbox. Is, oh, just drop the... That's it, brilliant. The width across the toolbox. Where that big pink arrow is, you're measuring across the whole thing. If you've got a toolbox on, leave the toolbox there. If you're just working on a free arm machine, then you just measure across the free arm, right? So that's the first thing you need to do is measure. Then you need to take a photo of the table of your machine, which is the, you know, the, the, the table of your machine. So take a photo of that. And then what you need to do is you need to email Shirley at parsfreemotionrulers.com. That's Shirley at pars 
freemotionrulers.com. So you, on that email, you tell, tell us what you, what you make of your machine is, what the model is, the order number that you get because you've ordered it from our call centre, plus the photo of the table and machine, plus the measurement of your machine. Yes. So if you do all of that, then a couple of days after you play, so if you, if you go through now, I'll put it on your website now or ring now, in a couple of days' time, you will get in touch with the person who's yes. bought it just to double-check everything, and then Bruce physically makes it for your machine. Now, if you've got three machines, obviously this here, you buy the whole thing. But in the future, say you've got another machine, you think, oh, I want to now use my 680 on this. You can keep the same table, but you can contact Bruce and say, oh, I've now got an Elna 680, and he will cut you just the bit that goes in the hole yeah. for your 680. But for today, this, you, you're buying the whole thing, right? The whole thing. So in the future, you can, you can make it different for you. Talk to me about the legs on here, Bruce. Well, the legs on the standard machines, uh, we standard machine we send the same leg for overlockers because this table will also fit overlockers uh, you use it in an orthodox way on the overlocker yep. and we use a four inch leg for those and Benina machines we use a three and a half inch leg okay so when they're, they're ordering, when they're ordering now they either yep. order for an overlocker or for a yep. sewing machine one table will fit both right but your legs Will the legs be all right? Or the, the legs will be two different sizes. As right, you OK, say. so today yeah. they're buying one set of legs. Yes. But they can also... So, so say they buy what you've got here, Singer patchwork, right? Yeah. So if they order this day, this is exactly what they'll get. They'll get this table with these legs and that infill. Right. If they buy an o from an overlocker, it'll be that table with a different infill but with longer legs. Yes. So do they, on the overlocker, do they need to take the measurements exactly the same as a sofa? The length of the overlocker. Right, right, OK. Front to back. Yeah. Yeah. OK, and then in the future, if I don't want to buy another table from Overlocker, can I buy the longer legs from you? This is not ours, but I'm just asking if you... Yes, you I can. can buy the longer legs from you and Shirley, yes. can't yes, you? Yes, you can. Overlocker. So you're not limited. So don't be thinking, oh, I'm only buying it for that one machine. It's versatile. You're buying it for that one machine today, whether it's this one or your 680 or whatever, but then you can add to it in future. Yeah. So it's, yeah. it's like an investment for the future, isn't it? So if you find you're using your overlocker way more for like wedding dresses or curtains or things like that, you think, oh, I want a much, much bigger table on it. Because you don't get an extension table on an overlocker normally, no, do you? No. So if you're thinking, oh, the weight's getting a bit much and everything, order one. For, you can use the same table, just need different legs. But that's for the future. Today, you're ordering the table for either your sewing machine or your overlocker. It's 149.99, three-way split pay, 49.99. So the, the benefits of this, Bruce, are, first of all, you're sitting there, which means you're facing your needle in a different way, aren't you? You are. Uh, we, the, the reason we did it is because the handy quilters from America yep. and all the Big machines, Long arm quilters. Sit down machines yep. are all facing that way. Yes. So what we thought was we could make a table. It had to be universal yeah. to allow anybody with any machine yeah. to be able to sit and create 29 inches of support there yeah. and work the that way. Yeah. With the rulers. Yeah. So it means that, because you know with when you're doing ruler work, you drop your feed dogs, you are doing the moving around. It's not doing your traditional... If you're just going backwards and forwards on your sewing machine, then you don't need this, really. No. Because you've got your extension table that comes with it. But if you're doing free motion, it means you turn your machine head on to you like that. And then you can work like this. And how many inches, say? 27? It's 20... Uh... 26 inches 26, wide. 26 support. inches. So you've got much more room. To, then it means your, your, the, your quilt isn't falling off the edge and things like that. And you can just work away. Good for your shoulders, good for your breathing, good for your posture. 149.99, three-way split pay. Uh, so let me just show the slide again. Just to know, so you know what to do. So you, what you do is you measure across the bed of your machine, including the toolbox, if you've got a toolbox on it. You take a photo of the table of your machine, like that one there. Then you email Shirley at parsfreemotionrulers.com with, with that picture, with that measurement, and also including your machine, make and model, and the order number that you get from our call centre, or you get from our... When you order it, you get your, uh, your email to confirm it. There's an order number on it. It's just that that way Bruce can coagulate the people who've bought to the machines that you've got and everything like that. If you've got any issues whatsoever, still email that address and somebody will get in touch with you. Now, it might take a couple of days. By the time it's gone through our call centre or you've emailed, 
they're no spring chickens. They'll look at their emails. A bit. <laughs> but do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? Like, if you got, it's right. Any questions? Absolutely any right. Any questions? Yeah. Just yeah. get in touch with them, and they'll be get back to you within a couple of days. They're not going to Glasgow, and they're not going to. Um, Oh, Shelley's going to be at Sainfoot. Well, you're both going to be at Sainfoot Place on Thursday, but not on a stand. They're just going to be wandering around looking. So go up and give him a hug and everything. <laughs> uh, and he'll do his hair specially. <laughs> right, so that's us done for now. Get the tables. Quite a few gone in basket. So make sure you check out on that one. And that's you done for now, Bruce. So thank you very much indeed. It's always lovely to see you. Go on. <laughs> Get off, watch, don't trip. Oh, uh, right, now, just me and you now, Cheryl. Okay. So... If you've never got any PARS rulers before, you need to get this starter kit, right? And in the starter kit, you get your foot. Now, Bruce has made these specially, hasn't he, Cheryl? Yes, he has. Bruce has... Oh, I've, I've got, oh yes, I've got an idea. Yeah. <laughs> look, look. So, look, he's made these. The only thing you need to do when you first get it, when you fit it on your machine, is you see this bar here... Shirley will show you on her machine where it needs to go, but you might just need to lift it slightly. Might either lift it or, or lower it. Lower it, but you on only do that once. You only yes. have to do that once and then it's fixed forever. Uh, you have to decide whether you're high shank or low shank yes. machine, don't you? Yes. So let's do the high shank first. So what you get with the high shank one is you get the foot. What do you actually call that foot? A ruler foot? It's a ruler foot, yes. You get a ruler foot. Right, you get your non-slip mat. This is essential. This is absolutely essential. We'll show you in a minute why. You get this USB stick, which has got an hour and a half of Shirley wittering on about how you make how you do it, how you make it, how you do it. Really, it's a masterclass, isn't it? It is really, yeah. It is a masterclass of Shirley doing that. Right, you also get four buttons. Now, we'll explain in a minute what those buttons are for, but it means you can practice on paper to what your finished pattern is going to look like before you actually put your quilt underneath your so machine. So you don't waste your fabric. So you don't waste your fabric. Then, in this beginner kit, you also get... Uh, right, you get this ruler, which is the straight ruler. Now, don't think it only does straight lines. It, that's called 1B. Because look at this, right? These are all done... With, look at that curly one in the middle. They're all done by the straight ruler, aren't they, Cheryl? Yes, they are. You can do that on your domestic machine. Do you want to come in? Do you want me to put it here? Let me put it up here. Let me do it. That's it. That's no, 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 not you, Hannah. Look, see this? That's done by a straight ruler. Proper Zentangle pattern, that is. It's, it's what? Got, it's a proper Zentangle pattern. Zentangle pattern, that is. Yes. Zentangle pattern. Right, so I'll put that one there. So that you get that in the kit, right? But then you also get this one here, which is... Well, upside down, John. Uh... 19B, which is Circle. circles. So you get that in there as well. Awesome. You also get this one here, which is 34B, which is vines cables and, and vines. Yes. cables. Cables and vines. Cables and vines, not vines and cables, John. Right? <laughs> and you get this one, which is hearts. I can do that because it's got it written on it. <laughs> so for your 9990, you get this, 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 these, this, 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 and this. Everything you need to get going, really, but more because they'll, they'll all last you. There's a they'll USB last as you. well. There's a USB as well. Hmm? USB stick in there. I've it? got the. Did I not, actually, I said that because that's you. Yeah, I think because I said oh, you did, yes. on. See, you're wittering on again. <laughs> your memory, sure. <show. laughs> you might have a nice hairdo, but your memory's going. <laughs> right, so that's all of your high shank, right? Now, the other one we've got is exactly the same, but with your low shank foot, right? Uh, how do we know, Shirley, whether we want a high shank or a low shank? Right. I'm going to do the rule of thumb. Put the any foot you've got onto the machine and lower the, the foot. Well, hang on, they're just coming in on you now. There okay. you go. Now, right. then, I happen to know that this elega uh, the excellent 680 yeah. is a high shank, but I'll show you if you can stand your thumb upright, east to west, underneath the screw that holds the foot on, that's a high shank. The only foot that you've got on, where the screw any foot, goes. It doesn't matter. Yes, it's where the screw is. With the low shank, which the singer is. This one. Yes, with the foot down, yep. you can stand, you can put your finger underneath, flat underneath the screw. Where's the, the screw? The there. there. there oh, you won't see, you won't see this because it's right. Oh, there, there you go. go. There you there go. Will. So there. that goes just underneath, and that's a low shank. But it doesn't matter how fat your fingers are. Not at all. So low shank is flat down. Yes. And high, high shank, shank is your thumb, thumb up. upwards. 
Vula Sun. 680's high, yeah, 680's high. Yes. That's the machine Shirley's going to be using, the LD680. Yes. Same machine that I've got. Right, but you, you don't try and put a low shank foot on a high shank machine. You've got to have the right foot to do it. So you need to, if you're unsure, ring wherever you bought your, or look up, look up where you bought your um, sewing machine from, and it will tell you, it will tell you. Or you could ring Shirley, she knows them all. Oh, no. <laughs> but I'll message. Or, or message in, or message in, or message in, right. and we'll ask okay. them. Yeah, right. and, and, and if, if there is a mistake made, we will change it. It's not a problem. Right, OK. So we'll swap them over. So if you've ordered, if ordered the wrong one. Yes, yeah. we'll swap it over. Brilliant. All right, so that's £99.90. It's on split pay, look. Now, I always say this, and you're going to be sick of it, right? No interest charge whatsoever. No interest charge. It's £49.95, two-way split pay, right? We also don't charge you for the service of using split play like some places do. That's all I want to say. Right, so that's your kit. That's, that's your starter kit. That's enough to keep you going, isn't it? Right, now all these things are available. Do you want to do it now? Should we do it now? Oh, OK, we're just doing the slip mat now, then. We're just going to do the slip mat. We'll come back to that. OK, right, OK. So this is the slip mat. So, Shirley, what's this, then? This is a silicon mat, OK? It's shiny on the one side that the fabric goes to, and it's tacky on the back. It's not sticky, it's tacky. It doesn't leave any residue on your machine. When you first get it, bring the, fab ruler, the slip mat up so that you're curving around the hole in the middle. Bring it to the machine, proud of the machine, says she, and then drop it down, and you'll get a wrinkle-free Move. And what's the what's the what's the And the, the fabric glides with no pressure on your hands, your wrists, your shoulders, and you breathe. Now if you want to use the mat as I do for my ordinary sewing, I put it to the side of my needle plate, right. bring my feed teeth up, and I now have perfect feed for any weight of just fabric. For just normal shopping. Ordinary sewing. This never leaves my machine. Right. When it stops being tacky on the back, yeah. run it under the cold water tap and hang it up to dry. No rubbing, no detergent, cold water. Yeah. Hang it up to dry. My mats usually last me between five and seven years. There you go. That's a good investment, isn't it? Question underneath. They do come in the bundle. So if you buy in the yeah. bundle, but if you want it separately, or if you've got, I had one for five years, it's about time I got a new one. You can buy them on their own, twenty nine ninety five. Question on the bottom. Hi, John Shirley. Hello. I have a Janome Atelier 7. Would I need high or low? That's Many thanks. High for. shank. <coughs> high that, shank. With that foot, we will also send you in, Janome instructions for the setting on the actual machine. Oh, OK. OK. Yeah. If they are specific. OK. But, yeah, thank you. That's, that's high shank, special instructions. <laughs> She's doing a dab now. She's that run, though, isn't it? <laughs> right. We've got three brand new rulers today. Three brand new rulers. Um, do, do, do you want me to... Oh, do you want to do oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did them in Bruce's order. There we go. Graduated is this one here. Oh, dear. I've messed those up. That's all right. We love this. Now, this is what Shirley's called graduated. That's your ruler. No, no now, now, now that you've bought your high and low ruler, um, foot, it doesn't matter. You buy this for everything. Any don't you? ruler. Because there are some rulers that you have to buy yes, some specific. rulers specifically yeah. on. No, these fit everything because the foot that you're purchasing is a hopping foot. Right. The other rulers that you would might be buying, the foot that they've got is a hover foot. So right. So that it's stationary. That's why you need different rulers. Yes. Right. Yes. Okay, yes. so look at this gorgeous pattern you can create. Now, can I only do it all over like that? No, you can do it as a border. So we you love can do that one. One line of it. It's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? And you can extend it by putting a heart in the middle of it. Oh, okay. We're going to do all that. Or in a, a star there. in the middle of it, or, yeah. or whatever. You can personalise it. So that is your fifteen ninety nine nine B graduated motif, brand new to us today. Right, yo, that's that one. Then where are we going next, then? Okay. Let's move that to the other side. Then we've got the dew drop, which is this one. That's beautiful, that is. Again, an all-over pattern, but you can use it as a border. 
or f all over like that. And you do it in stripes so that you, go you don't take the ruler off of the fabric or break the thread until you've gone the top of the uh, quilt to the bottom. Of oh, the OK. OK. OK, so we'll see that, though, in a second. That's yes. you drop 40B. It also does a lovely country heart. Does the what? Lovely country heart. Oh, OK. You know. And then we've got this one here. <laughs> Which is called Rutter's Riddle. Yes, it's like a it's like a jigsaw puzzle. You like that one? Yes, and that is done. That particular piece of fabric there was done with one start and one finish. So I started up in the one corner and I finished up down in the other corner. So you're not going to have loads of cotton at the back. To, you've got to stitch in. No, it's all in one. So it's called Rutter's Riddle. We'll find out why later. Fifteen B. It's just the turn of the ruler to give you the. Lovely. I've got a question about feet. Hang on a second. Okay. Hi, Shirley. I've got Hello. a Singer Futura 550XL. Can you tell me if it's low shank or high shank? Sue in Beeston. That's a low shank, isn't it? It is. Bruce? I'm being confirmed. He, yes. Bruce says it's a low shank. Low yeah. shank, yes. Yeah, Bruce says it's a low shank. Right. <laughs> now, something we introduced to you last time they were in, uh, but there was a mix up with the rulers and everything, is uh, we have the teddy bear standing up and sitting down. Right, standing, first of all. Here you go, standing. Standing. There's three standing, rulers in each set. Standing. You get yeah. three rulers here for 44 99 I'll put them that side there. And that does your standing teddy bear. Beautiful. He's lovely. But you need all three to do the teddy bear. Yes. And but actually, if you don't put the ears on, it could be a gingerbread man. Yeah? Yep. Yeah. Don't you put ears on your gingerbread man then? Well, it's a man. But I don't have teddy bear ears. Do they? Well, some do. <laughs> you should know you've been around the block a few times. <laughs> right, then we've got the sitting down one. The sitting down one I particularly love because it's got the most beautiful belly on it. His tummy is absolutely gorgeous. The way it flops round, I think it's gorgeous. Bruce has got that absolutely perfect. What, Bruce has got that belly? No, that... <laughs> <laughs> 44 99 That's your sitting down, Teddy Bear. Now, before I go over to Shirley, I'd also have to tell you about Sissy State Stash Buster. Yes. Because every time Shirley comes on, she brings loads of these, and every time it sells out. <laughs> so what you're getting is you're getting a pattern, plus you're getting your two handles, and this... They're already going already. This is what you're making. You don't get the rulers in it. No, you don't get the rulers in it. That's just to show you. Yeah, they, just to show you how the rulers go in. It keeps the rulers absolutely beautiful without you scratching them yeah. and losing them. How brilliant is that? This is a Christmas version, obviously. <laughs> but so you get the pattern, plus you get the handles. Yes. All for 9 99 Yes, brilliant. Full instructions, pattern, two handles, 9 99 Oh, and I'll just show you this while I'm here. There's more teddy bears there, look. Yes. I'll take that over with me when we go and do That's these. Beautiful, okay. So, so now, if you want any of the bundle pieces on their own, like the USB stick, the foot, the rulers, or the slippy mat, they're all on the website. I will recap them later. We've got an hour and a half. Uh, we've done the. We. Oh, we haven't got USB stick on its own. No. Only no. on the only in the bundle. Only, only in, the, in bundle. the bundle. Right. Okay. Right. Let me come over to you with these new ones first. Okay, huh? Then. So which one are we going to do first, Han? Which one would you like? Graduated, Graduated first. Graduated, okay. You need this. Oh, you got your own. I've got, got your own mine. ruler. Yeah. Okay, brilliant. Yeah. And that's, that's... Oh, uh, that's that. Yeah. Oh, there's the graduate. No, there's graduated on the front of the page there. There you go. Oh, wow. Isn't look at she that. beautiful? Absolutely gorgeous. Those gorgeous. Those curves are gorgeous. I'll come and get the rest in and a bit. And consistent. Right, so as with all rulers, they've got the lines on them. And what do the lines do? The lines give you the pattern. So you've got your stitching area there in the channel, and then you move the ruler to sit with the lines, the row, lines on the ruler. So we're starting at the bottom. Right. I always find it's better to start at the bottom of a pattern so that when you come back, you can match everything up. It's in front of yeah. you. So let's start our first line. So stitch into and along into that straight and then accentuate that curve into the straight and then curve and stop with your needle down right i'm going to ask a question people who've not done it before 
What stitch led... You've dropped your feed dogs. I've dropped my feed dogs. Have you put your stitch on any particular so side? So, therefore, the stitch length is in my hand. Yes. Because I'm feeding the So, it fabric. doesn't matter what your stitch length no. is on the machine? Start... If you're starting with, with pars, start with the straight line and get the stitch length consistent. Once you've got that consistent, you've got the muscle memory and you can go on to the curves without wasting... Okay, and, and what speed do you put it on? I put mine into the middle. Right. Lovely. If you haven't got a machine that stops the speed on the machine itself, take a piece of wood, put your foot down and see where the speed is on the middle and put the wood underneath so that you've, oh, got, underneath your you've foot got a head permanent or... marker there. Oh, okay? Yeah. So it's not going up and yeah, down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay? Sorry, I just had to ask that for people who had done it before. That's so right. you've literally gone so from I've, the start. I've gone from the start up. Yeah. Needle down, slide it up, and match your points. Right. The line. Yeah. And that'll keep the pattern consistent and continue on up. Oh, so we don't make the whole OG shape. No, we do a line no. of the left hand That's side right. first. That's right. Slide it up. Put your line on. Now I'm going to run out of fabric. Yeah, here, you're going to run but out. But that's all right. Because if you run out of fabric on your quilt, you're going to want to repeat the pattern down. Yeah. So that you're filling the whole area. Slide her over and you can match her up. See? Yeah. By putting those lines on. So there you go, perfect. Can you see yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Absolutely upstairs, beautiful. So now we're going to start here. Right. Keep it firm. I'm not leaning on it, I'm keeping it firm. Yeah. And when I come round, the stitching that I did previously is in the centre of the channel. That's where the needle is going to join up. I call that the kiss. Right. So we bring it round, down, kiss. Needle down. Yeah. Slide it down. Right the way. Put your lines on. That's the important. Oh, you've got lines to match. You've yes. Got, yeah. Now then, don't try and match every line. Right. The important one is that one. The bottom one. The bottom one. So that you get the stitching in the centre of that channel. Bring it round and down. And yes. that's the same with all of the rulers. Don't try and match every single line. Match the important one, which is that one, and bring it down. I promise the pattern will come true. Bring it down. Now then, so we've gone all the way down our quilt. That might be your border. Yeah. OK? But if we want to continue and fill in like this... Go back to the top. Go back to the top. Well, no, I'll come back to the bottom. Are you going to the bottom? I'm so coming the to the bottom. Okay. Right. Now then, you've got the kiss mark there on the ruler. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Put yeah. that on. And by eye, just make sure that you've got that line. Because it can't, you could go up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay? So bring her down and stitch back up again. It's a beautiful, beautiful pattern, this is. Lovely. Needle down, slide her up. Put your scroll lines on. Yeah. Kiss. And bring it back. So you can fill the whole of the fabric very simply so that you can come and cut off pieces as you wish. Yeah. But you can fill a whole quilt. Because you sometimes you'll, you'll do quilt as you go where you're doing a certain piece of fabric and you want to stitch, make sure everything is stitched on it. Half well, the stock of this new ruler's gone already. Has it really? Yeah. <gasps> I do envy you your first make on it because you will be so pleased that you did this. Yeah. I love that. I love to be able to sit at my sewing desk. I did this. It was me. <laughs> it's beautiful, the design, yeah. It's so simple. Bring it round. Bring the line in. That's the important line. Don't worry about the other lines because that's already stitched on that side. Yeah. See, Hannah's saying what she would love is she'd just do a quilt top in one colour. Yes. Like this. Like, like this yes. one is, or like this one is. And don't have patchwork underneath it. Look at Literally that. just do the shape as of one colour. As a throw. Yeah. You'd do that as a yeah. throw. So you'd have a, 
you wouldn't have the wadding, you'd just have the backing fabric on, and that would be just your counterpane. Oh, you right. Oh, that's an idea. But beautiful. she quite likes just doing it quilting as yeah, well, absolutely. just with that on. Absolutely, beautiful. She wanted, her dad was going to tile her bathroom. Oh, yeah. And she saw tiles like this. Like and this, dad thinks, yes. And he went, no, there's no way I'm tiling your bathroom. <laughs> <coughs> And yes, she was loud squares. But what you could do, Hannah, is you could do a wall hanging in, the, in this with, the, with your Absolutely. lovely fabrics and everything. Just look at that. You see, that looks gorgeous on the I mean, I haven't, I haven't... You haven't what? I haven't traced it. No? And, and, it there. and tracing is notoriously difficult on a sewing machine. Yeah. Because you can't, you don't get the... Yeah. the and it's absolutely regular. And it's the same on the back. And it's the same on the back. Yeah, and if you're just using that. on a border, you just go up and come down, and that's yes. your border done, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Just lovely. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful ruler. Where beautiful. What well, Hannah's saying is like on a William Morris fabric, it looked like a wood block, wouldn't it? On, yes. on top of it. Beautiful. Yes. Yes. Right, don't go any further because I've got some questions we need to ask. Okay. Right. So, <laughs> right, so the low, we put the low shank bundle in to start with. Yes. Right, what do you need to first question? General question is, I have a hovering foot. Can I use these rulers or do I need a jumping foot from you Fiona? Need, you need, if you have purchased rulers before, if you've purchased the Australian version, yeah. that foot will fit these rulers. Right. Okay? Yeah. So, yes, you can. But? But at the hovering foot really is... Better. The, the jumping foot is yeah, better. Yeah. It really is. Because it allows the fabric to go. And you'll notice there's no missed stitches. No. But also, we have it on its own, don't we, today? So you could always, you could always buy just this. You don't need to buy the whole that kit. Will, that will fit the Australian rulers. This will? Yes. Oh, well, OK, Absolutely. then. So if you've already got some other rulers. Yes, that will fit. OK. We'll do the feet opposite. In a minute, we'll do will the feet get on the a better right. Next question. Hi, Shirley. Hello. I have, this is like mastermind, isn't it? I have a Singer Futura 550XL. Can you tell me if it's low shank or high shank, suing Beeston? I thought we'd done that one. I thought we had. Oh, she missed the answer because she went to the doorbell. Oh. <laughs> no, low shank. It's a low shank. Low shank, low shank. <laughs> yeah, that's right, low shank, that one. <laughs> Norma's got a question now. Hello, Norma. I have a brother 560. Which shank is that, please? Norma in Belfast. That's a low shank, isn't it? It is indeed a low yeah. shank. I'm testing you, I've got the answer. I've got, I see. I've got Bruce in my ear, you see, <laughs> so he's going to tell me. Elna 570A, low shank or high shank? <laughs> what, what do you think it is, Shirley? <laughs> I'm not, I'm not full. No, it's a low it's shank. A low it's shank. a low shank, the 570. So that means the 550, 560, and 570 will all be low shank. Yeah. Hi, John, I'm new to quilting and I've got a brother LS14S machine. Is it compatible with the PARS free motion rulers from Claire? Yes. Yes. Low. Low shank. Low shank. You want the low shank yes, foot. And it works lovely on that machine because that's a nice solid machine. Oh, okay. Right, this question. Oh, OK, let's have a look. Hi, guys. Can these shanks foot be used on an industrial machine from Elaine? They can, Elaine, but you need to contact Bruce because he'd have to make you one specially. It's, it's, it's the same... Oh, she knows the answer it's, to this it's one. The, uh, it's, the, it's the same shank as we're using. Yeah. But the angle of the foot is different, and Bruce makes those okay. specifically. OK, so you need to talk to Bruce about that. You need to talk to Bruce, he'll make you one and specially. And we also do... Five millimeter rulers. These are three millimeter for domestic machines. Right. We also do five millimeter rulers, the same patterns for, for the industrial. So I can't use these on industrial. You can, but mm, yeah, it's a okay. Bit, you know. uh, Julie, want to know what the six eighty is? High shank. High shank. High shank, Julie. <laughs> right. High shank. Right. Any more questions? Oh, there's more questions. Oh, there's more questions. Make sure you get the right one. High shank or low shank? Right. Yeah. Is the ruler 9B in high shank? Marjorie, the rulers are all the same. All the, same. the rulers are all the same. Doesn't matter which... They're all three mil. You just need the right foot. Mm -hmm. You just need the right That's foot. Right. 680 is high. Yes. OK. Is that it? OK, how are we on stock on the, on the, on the graduated? <laughs> we'll just double check and then we'll move on to the next one. I just want to make sure we haven't sold out or anything. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, there's only four left. Oh. Four left of graduated now. Can Bruce get a bit of plastic and cut some more in the back room? <laughs> There's only four left of those. And how many in baskets? And the, be the beauty of this, this particular one is if you're doing a border, 
if, and you've got plain fabric, if you run a strip of different fabric underneath between the wadding and the fab top fabric, you can then cut around there and you've got relief. Re uh, uh, reverse. Re reverse applique. Oh. It's beautiful. I bet. Where's your sample of that then? I haven't bought it. Oh, honestly. Another question. <laughs> oh, was it? Sorry, what's another question? Okay, I've brother F. FS. A brother NV 1800Q, which shank do I need? Low. You're a low shank, that one for a collector in sterling. Yes. Brother FS 250, which we sell? Low shank. Low. We know that one. Low. Glynis, low. And what's the next one? Blimey. Uh, <laughs> FS 130Q sheet. Low. See, low. Low. Another one. Uh, Innovis, uh, brother Innovis. High or low, Bruce? Which Innovis? Low, low, Innovis low. One more. Please, can you explain the difference between high shank and low shank, please? Okay. Yeah. Right. Are you ready? Are you ready? Over to Shirley. With whatever foot you have on your machine, put the foot down to its lowest position. Now, this particular machine is a high shank. So, if I put my thumb underneath the screw that holds the foot on, with my thumb upright, east to west. That's a high shank. Right. And John will show you on the singer, with the foot down, he can put his finger, either index or middle, whatever, underneath there, and that's a low shank. Why do they make, you might not know this, but why do they make machines, low shank and high shank? Why can't they make them all the same? Well, originally, when they were made, they were high shank. Right. And, but the, the domestic machine, because the industrials were high shank. Oh, okay. The, in, the just domestic machines were always low, low shank. shank. But, of course, we're having machines Technology. that do so much more now. Yeah, of course. You I know? just didn't understand why they didn't make them all, but it's because they were made like that. That's right. Okay, wait, which ruler next then, Han? Oh, yeah, we'll do the feet separately for people who want the feet. So if you, if you want a low shank, or which one do you put in first, sorry? Low shank first. In the bundle, you get it in the bundle. This is just if you just want the foot on its own. Now, I've seen ruler feet go for like almost £100, right? £24.95. This is if you've got a low shank machine. And it's British made. Made by Bruce. British made. He doesn't sit and make them all, sure. No, he doesn't. He, he assembles them at the moment. Oh. He gets all the parts and yeah. he assembles them because they are set yeah. for your machine. There you go. So that's £24.95 for the low. Oh, nice across the bottom. Thank you for clarifying the ruler size. I ordered mine. Nice to have rulers that do an all over design. Exactly, Marjorie. Great. Doesn't it? Thank you, Marjorie. And then a high shank. Or say it. There you go. High shank there, $24.95. Lovely. Beautiful foot. Right. So now we're going on to. Dewdrop. 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 You, another gorgeous OK, one, this it? is absolutely beautiful. And you've got lots and lots and lots of lines on this. OK. OK. I'll just show you that one there. That's the finished okay. thing there. That's the finished doobry. Just wait for doobry. the camera to come round. There it is. The finished doobry. Right. OK. And again, it's the same on the back. See, I even put the name on the back for you. <laughs> I was very kind. <laughs> yeah. That for you or for me? <laughs> to remind me. <laughs> <laughs> right, so... Right. Again, now this one, I work forwards, okay? Right. So, I'm going to start on the left-hand one and stitch round to what I call the elbow. That's my stop for underneath my machine when it's not working. Okay. okay. Here's, here's the, um, <laughs> there's the dewdrop one done on, on a whole... Oh, she's beautiful. But you can see, you can do a beautiful border. Yeah. And again, reverse applique. You could put... All your, you could sew all of your scraps together in a strip, yeah. put them underneath, and then cut them out as you, you go. go and you get multicolored balloons. Yeah, Ooh, balloons. Beautiful. Even you drop balloons. Even dew okay. Drops, yeah. Okay. Right. Or speech mark. Right. Yeah. So I'm starting at the curl. Yeah. Okay. Foot down and stitch the curl to the elbow. So come all the way around that beautiful curve and down to the elbow. Needle down, slide, bring her round to the curve. Oops, let me get that out of the way. Now then, 
the most important line on here is this line coming out here that you put onto what you've just sewn. Yeah. And another word I want you to remember is snuggle. You're snuggling the ruler up against the foot. Right. And that means that you haven't got a hair's breadth difference so that when you stitch round, that stitching line joins on to what you've already so stitched. So it's not a kiss, that's so a So there's snuggle. no gap. It's a snuggle. Lovely. Needle down, slide, bring her round to the curl and put your line on. Yeah. Snuggle. Snuggle. And bring her round. Kiss. And down. So there's a snuggle at the beginning and, and a, a kiss, kiss in the middle. It's such nice words to Isn't use it? in your yeah. sewing room. Yeah. Bring it round. Snuggle. Well, you don't want him bruising your sewing room nice. kisses and snuggles while you're busy doing this, do you? Really? You say so. Oh, OK. <laughs> Needle down, yeah. slide, bring her round to curl. As with all the rulers, it's very methodical. And we are methodical people. Yeah. I'm methodically untidy. Are you? Yes. Is your house a tip Disgracefully then? so. Oh, is it? Yes. And 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 because we do we did so many shows last year, I didn't have time to do anything. It was in the door. Get ready and out, out the door. Out the door, yeah. So everything, my sewing room. <laughs> you're going to have time to tidy up a little bit then if you're not oh, doing I Glasgow do hope today. So. Yes, yes. I shall be able to get my sewing room organised. Good, when I come to visit. Bring it down, when yeah. When I do the royal visit. Yeah. Did you say there's a question for. What? Yeah, I didn't say nothing. Oh, I thought you said you're not coming. Do you have to, be able to <laughs> drop the feed dogs? Yes, you do. Because you're in charge of where the machine is going to. Some people, though, don't drop their feed dogs. Do if they? you don't drop your feed dogs, if that is your pleasure, put the straight stitch dial to zero. Therefore, there's no feed going, but it's just going up and down. Uh, and with the mat over the top, yeah. you've got no problem. So if you haven't got a machine that has to drop your so feed dogs? It, usually, with those machines, they supply a little plastic... Um, thing. thing to go over. Don't do that because this is your little plastic yeah, thing. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. So you now, put, put it straight stitch to naught. Naught. And yeah. then you've got everything. Now, so that's your border. Isn't that beautiful? Mm. Uh, uh, uh. Now then, if we want to do all over, yeah. we now come along. Now then, the only thing you have to, mar to measure, mark here, is to put that stitching line into the centre of the channel. Right. Because that's where the needle is going to stitch. Right. So, and because we're not using this at the moment, I can put my hands in there to steady everything, OK? Right. So now we're going to come down and we're going to do exactly the same as we did in the first line. Kiss and down to the elbow. Yeah. Slide, snuggle, line on. Yeah. Fingers in and stitch. The fingers in, you're not putting pressure on the ruler, you're stopping it from moving. So therefore, you're going to get a precise pattern. Yeah, snuggle. Snuggle, kiss, kiss. Stop. Slide, needle Curl. down, slide. Line on. Yeah. And come down. Every time you'll get a perfect pattern. Just snuggle, line on, and bring her round. Yeah, yes. Bring her down and in. Oops. Oh. Stop. Needle down. Curl, line on, bring her down, and stitch your last one. So you can go across the top, from the top to the bottom of your quilt. Yeah. Absolutely. It looks like um, you know how people like William Morris and Tilda draw peacock. You know, yes, the peacock yes, feathers going yes. down the back of the peacock. Yes, exactly. You can also, just because, I'm starting at the corner and I'm working my way up. Needle down. Slide her around. And I'm going to, by eye, I'm going to put that into the centre of the channel. Oh! It's a completely every, different pattern. Every ruler, turn it and you'll get a different pattern. Oh, I love that chubby heart. Isn't Look. she gorgeous? <laughs> She's so full of love, that heart is. Oh. I love her. But the same. Same on the back. Yeah. 
That's what we're all worried about, is the back of the fabric. I know, but uh, now, so when you do this, what, what thread do you have? Do you have the same thread in the bobbin as you've got in the Same top? weight. Yeah. Same weight. So the bottom one could be a variegated if you wanted it yes, to be, could it? Yes, If you were doing it on white, because that looked gorgeous yes. in variegated. Well, yes. it looked gorgeous in variegated on the blue as well, wasn't yes, it? Yes, yes. Right. Yeah, here's the finished sample. Absolutely gorgeous. Half the stock of this one's gone. That's the one you're doing in there. What's, what's that one done with? That's the same ruler, oh. only I've just curved it round instead of making a heart. Oh, OK. That's all. I've just so turned it the round. So there you go. The chubby heart, you chubby can do heart. The, the, the dew drops, dew drops, or you've got, like, teardrops on here, single yeah, teardrops. There you, go, there you go. That have been dressed. Yes. That's what you call it, isn't it? Dressed. dressed. <laughs> right, I've got to go back, because there's more. Half the stock of that's gone. Don't do anything else, Shirley. OK. Because... Oh, hang on, you're breaking up. The which one? Low shank bundle coming in. Couple of questions. Remember, in the bundle, you get all of this, right? You get the mat, you get the, the foot. Hang on one second. Right, so you get the, the mat, you get the buttons, you get the foot, you get the, the four rulers and the USB. Lots of people asking what's on the USB, Shirley. It's one and a half hours of me showing you take the foot out of the box, fit it onto the machine, how to fit it, and showing you the, the buttons, yeah. patterns, and then stitching that button pattern Onto the machine. Brilliant. Okay. So it's a full on masterclass, an hour and a half Absolutely. masterclass. Only available in the bundle, remember. Right, I've got the Husqvarna J35 saying an embroidery combi machine. Is it high shank or low shank? Please. Great show, Sue in Beckingham. Low. It's a low shank, that one. That's the one we had, isn't it? We had that one here. Yeah. Hayley uh, West sold that one. Yeah, we've got that one. Low shank, that one is, Sue. Oh, hang on, there's another question. <laughs> That's right. Here you go. Which foot the Juki NX7? Who's that, Adam? Oh, no. Eileen. Eileen. Bruce needs to answer that. Low. Low shank. There low you go. shank. Low shank. What did you say, low? I said Bruce needs to answer that. Oh, no, that. Bruce is there. <laughs> Bruce is shouting. <laughs> uh, Janome M200 QDC. Low shank. Low shank. Yeah, low shank, Fiona. In Essex, yes, it is. You knew already, look. <laughs> 680 is... High shank. High shank. And the 780 is a high shank as well. 780 is a high shank as well. Brilliant. Right. Uh, so hang on then. I've got to do that with the high shank. That's the whole bundle here. Four rulers, ru uh, buttons, USB stick, foot and sli slippy slidey mat. And just a, just a word, you can use the foot free motion without the rulers. And the needle is a, um, the, a quarter inch away so that you can use that if you're doing some free motion. Oh, so can just normal, like Delphine free motion, when yes, it's just meandering yes, and yes, things like that. you can do that. And you've got the foot as a gauge to yeah. next to your stick. Perfect. Oh, of what? Right, you know the graduated that sold out, mm -hmm. right? The graduated which sold out, we've got 20 more. Oh, lovely. Oh, it's on a 10-day extended delivery. Yes. 10-day extended delivery. There's no image on the website yet, but it's this one. It's the graduated one. Oh, I've lost you. You've lost you it. You've lost what you lost. What we lost. Where's it gone? There it is. Isn't there it is. Oh, it's a... No, you're back now. I just was okay. back, didn't I? There you go. So that's this one. So how many more have I got? Right, 20 more, but extended day, a 10-day extended delivery on that one. But there's only 20 more. Has he only got that much plastic in the shop then? <laughs> more, it's yeah. Perspex. Oh, it's Perspex. Perspex. Please. <laughs> 15 99 20 more, but there were loads you missed out before. Loads you missed out. Right, OK, some more questions come in. Right. Right, OK, I have the brother F5. There's so many machines out there, aren't there? 580, says so Shirley in Essex. Hello, Shirley. <laughs> uh, low. It's a low one. Bruce says it's a low one. Uh, I have a Husqvarna Viking 960Q. What shank, please? Uh, low. Low. Uh, that's Marion. Hello, Marion. No, no. I've got Bruce shouting them in the background. I can hear him. Don't worry. <laughs> that's a low. 
The low shank bundle is really, really busy. Just so you know, that's all of this. So you get four rulers, the buttons, the USB stick with the hour and a half of Shirley Wittering on, you get the foot and you get the slippy slidey mat. You can, can turn the volume down and just look at the picture. <laughs> People do that when I'm on all the time. <laughs> And I had to remind me about that. <laughs> it's because you have an expressive... Oh, uh, this one. Sissy's about to sell out again. Oh. Sissy is about to sell out again. Lovely. We haven't got any more of those, so you can't, I can't do that on extended delivery. Oh. Well, we have to, you have to order more my handles. I know. Unfortunately, the people who we got the handles off have gone out of business. Oh, no. Right, this is important. Yeah. The people they get the handles from have gone out of business. Yeah. So you might not get Sissy the Stash Buster again. We'll have to. Um, we've got to. We've got to search and search for a handle. We'll have to search. I have you. Me have you messaged Dave Green? You know Dave Green of the Green Machine. I bet he's got some of those stashed in the back. I bet he has. He's a bit dodgy, isn't is he? Is he dodgy? <laughs> I hadn't met him till last week. And, uh, Are you uh, insulting uh, him already? <laughs> yeah, I, I insulted him on air. Don't you worry. <laughs> Um, and I, lo I loved him. I just thought he was brilliant. I thought he was fantastic. <laughs> right, I'm going to come back now. So, are we now doing Rutter's Riddle? Rutter's Riddle. Right, now, are we allowed to tell a story about Rutter's Riddle? We is can that tell secret? a story about Rutter's Riddle. Because I know you told me, but I didn't know I if it was supposed to. Oh, Let yeah. me show you the finished thing, first of yes. all. Just look at that, ladies. That and middle, gentlemen. That, yeah, folks, that, folks, that centre panel was done with one start and one finish. So, there's only one... Start and finish. You don't have to put everything... And you know how quickly it's done if you follow Shirley on Facebook, because the other day, this was on there with no stitching on it. Black canvas. Black yes. canvas, black canvas. Right, so this is called Rutter's Riddle, Riddle Rutter's. because... Because. Are our, you ready name, for this? our name is Parr, as you know. Yeah, Mr and Mrs, Mrs. Parr. Mrs Mrs Parr. And we found out when Bruce was just into his 50s that he was adopted. Right. Um... Long story, but I'm not going into Yeah, no, don't no, And, and Bruce, is, Bruce has... It's Bruce. Bruce is his family. And, and, and he was surrounded by my family, which was quite a large family. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he never had a face to put his face to. Yeah. Yes? But not many people have got a face like Bruce's. No, no, though, no, no. That's why I picked him out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. and, and within three weeks of him knowing he was adopted... He found his family. Unfortunately, his father had died uh, eight years before. And, um, but he had three half-brothers and a sister. Golden to him because he'd always wanted a sister. Oh. And he now had a sister. So um, he went to find them. Now, I didn't tell you this bit. Oh, yeah. He went to the place that was on his birth certificate that we had to send for. Which was 50 years old. Ish. And he walked up and down the road <gasps> and he walked into the barber's shop and he said, do you know a Rutter family? And this guy walked in off the street and the barber says, no, I don't. Martin, do you know a Rutter family? He said, I'm a Rutter. Oh. And he turned to Bruce and he says, you're Bruce. <gasps> oh. I still get shivers. No, I'm getting shivers. It's nothing to do and with me. And he says, I've got to tell you, Dad's died. He went, oh, OK. Oh. He said, go and call on Uncle Jack. And he says, where's he? He says, oh, that's on my birth certificate. He says, yeah, yeah, go and call on him. He says, is he all, would he be all right? He says, fine. So he goes to the door, knocks on the door, and this little lady comes up and she says, hello, what do you want, Dad? And he says, uh, I've just been speaking to Martin. Ah, oh, come on in. I can see you're a rutter. <gasps> and he walks in and Jack, who was a tall guy, and, I mean, Jack was in his nearly 80s, 90s. And he stood up and he went, you took your time. Oh. And Bruce said, I only found out this three weeks ago. <gasps> he says, oh. And that's where oh. we found out. And all of those children, who are now adults, yeah. knew about Bruce. And there was a place set for him at the Christmas table every year, oh. waiting for him to come. Yes. They're just going to set me yes. off now. Yes. yes. Oh. It's magical. It oh, so, really so this is. Christmas, you're, Bruce, you don't have to cook for Bruce. He's going off to his other family. <laughs> <laughs> he went to our grandson's that last Christmas. Oh. Because I was away, wasn't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, 
So, yeah, th so this is what Rutter's riddle is all about. He, he found the jigsaw that was missing, the puzzle oh. piece that was missing. Oh, it's the fact they set a Christmas to set place from every mm. Christmas. Mm. So were they not allowed, I'll well, get on with this in a minute, but they're not allowed, were they not allowed to go and find him then? He had to go and find them. He should have got in, his in, on in the days, in those days, the, it was a cut-off point. Yes, 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 yes. And Bruce won't mind me saying so. His mother, it was his mother that brought him up, but she took, she adopted him to take the rotter name off of the birth oh, so he wouldn't see. find out. Yeah, yeah. It, it, but that was know. different in those days, yeah, exactly. It was war, nearly wartime, wasn't it? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know. Oh, it was right, so, that's so what's Rotter's this got riddle? to do with that then? Rotter's riddle, play it pieces of... Yeah, but what's that got? It doesn't look like Bruce. <laughs> right, so hang on, it's just, it's just a... So remember, you've got a simple, snuggle. Yeah. You've got a snuggle. Stitch your Lots first curl. Story, really? Needle down. Now then, if we turn, can you see that pattern is coming onto there? Yeah, onto your line. So now it? we're going to stitch another one. Snuggle. Needle down. Snuggle. Turn. And bring her round. Needle down. Now then, I'm going to slide her along, turn, and make sure that's the important bit here because we want that to end up on that point. Yeah. So put that there, stitch her round, needle down, slide, turn, kiss. So it's going to kiss at the end, is it? Snuggle at the start, kiss at the end. Yeah. Needle down, turn. You can go all over the quilt in one movement. Yeah. Now, if I turn there, I've got no point of reference. Oh, no. So bring her to the end and turn until snuggle. Yeah. And that point is meeting. Oh, yeah. So we're coming round. So it's, always do practising before you do your actual That's quilt. why we do the bit. The paint. I've got static electricity oh, is it going the down my back. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> my hair's standing up like yeah. a scarecrow. Bring it round. <laughs> Where am I? Yeah. I'm disturbed. No, there you go. So now, kiss. So long as you snuggle, you will kiss. Yes. Well, it's, a rule. it's not always a promise, that is but it. That, but just look. You can go all over the quilt, just like we did on that one. All over. And another interesting thing, yeah. if we take a one and three quarter inch square of fabric, different fabric, yeah. we can set that in there and do open edge applique. Oh, yeah. So now you can brighten it up. Oh, if yeah, you I, want I, I to. quite like it. See, all these it's rooms you classic, brought today, I it? like them because they're classic. Very and, classic. Yeah. Yes. I understand the bit about on those doing the reverse applique. Yes. And I think that's a brilliant idea. But I, all of them... They're beautiful. Th I mean, this, I adore this one. I love those fat hearts, chubby hearts. And remember, in the Christmas bundle, we've got a smaller version of this that you can put inside there so it turns it into a, a, a proper decoration. Have we got decoration. the Christmas bundle today? No, because no. it's not Christmas. <laughs> It'll be soon. But it'll be on the website people anyway. Write, people one. mentioned earlier during the book show, so yes. doing the Christmas shopping. Yes, yeah? yes, absolutely. That graduated one's gorgeous. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Right, now, rescinded. the graduated one is on extended delivery. I dread to think how many left. <laughs> uh, OK, the single figures of the new 20, right? How lovely. Do you want me to put it down? I'm so pleased. There you go. So that's graduated. That's now on extended delivery, right? But there's hardly any left. The seven, but loads in baskets. Imagine if you were to put your glitter thread on the bobbin, turn the fabric over and do that in glitter. Uh, oh. but, but, but you'd put the bobbin and you'd do it the right, so the right side would, would be, be down, down yes. with the glitter in yes. the bobbin. Because with ruler work, glitter thread doesn't work on the needle because there's too of much fighting. Yes. But if you put it onto the bobbin, away you go. Brilliant. Right, dew drop now. I don't know what we're going to do. Look, we've got ages, but... I've got uh, the teddy bear to do. The dewdrop 
Uh, sing, did you say single figure set? Uh, uh, can I have my old talk back back? This one keeps <laughs> cutting you out, sorry. Um, um, seven of the dewdrop left, that's all. Seven. And you can do the oval, no, the teardrops. You can do that one there. And you can also do the Your chubby heart. hearts on that one. And if you go around in a circle, you've got a, you've got a, um, a water splodge flower. Because you, if you go around in a circle of those, you go water splodge flower. Is that a technical term, water splodge? Yeah, well, you know. What's its real name? I'm very grammatical, you know. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> and how's your gardening? <laughs> I'm just going to to the garden centre. Can I buy four of those water splodge flowers, please? <laughs> Thank you. Sir. But they're so, they're so jolly. Yeah. Because it's such a beautiful curve. Yeah, no idea what they are, but yeah, I'm He's sure got, It's absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous. Right. And then the one we just did here, the riddle, because we only just introduced the riddle, haven't we? There's yes, the riddle. Yes. She's beautiful. She really is. And even if you just want to do a board, I mean, you can do a border of just riddles. Yeah. But you can use the just the single line. Oh, yeah, that's what you've done around the outside here, look. Yeah. Bring it round. Turn her. And just do straight lines of curves. Make sense, John? I oh, know it doesn't. Turn her. So now we can do a nice wiggly line, consistent. It's a small wiggle, so yeah. it's not going to take up an enormous amount of space. Yeah. But you can do that beautiful, consistent curve all the way down. Consistently. And that's what a it's all about. Consistently. You know? Consistently. But that's what it's about, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, quilting. exactly. Right. I'm back over here because I've got more questions, have I? <laughs> Mind that cup, Dad. These bundles. These bundles. Low shank. Oh, excuse me. Very, very popular today. A couple of questions. And we, we, we will, if, uh, if we've got time, we'll show you how these rulers work as well. Yes. Hi, both. I've got a brother, Innovis A150. Is it high or low, Shank, please? Loving the show. Welsh Jane in Kent. Low. Hello, Jane. 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 Low. 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 Oh, we've done NX7 already. Oh, what's the... Ca Carl? I don't remember. Oh, that's that scribe pitch scribe, uh, writing on it, is it? What's that one? Is that low? Low, low, Jeanette. That's a low one. And then this one's low as well, whatever it is. Oh, Toyota. Toyota. I was going to look at some Toyota cars this week. Oh, really? Toyota Quiltmaster. Is it low or high? Low. Low, low, low. That's Barbara. Toyota didn't have Toyota. I made sewing machine. Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm so behind. Right. And this is the low make, bundle. And £99.90. And make lawnmowers. It's what? And Husqvarna make lawnmowers. Oh, I knew that. <laughs> I knew that. I need a new lawnmower. Uh, anyway, uh, £99.92. Way split pay £49.99 or whatever it is. <laughs> um, only difference with the high is a different foot. <laughs> Hannah's got this thing about the 680 today. Every time we put it, she goes, it's good for the 680, John. <laughs> the 680, John, that's good for that one there. Say, remind them about the 680, John. Yeah, £99.90 and 90 pence. So you get four rulers, you get the buttons, you get the foot, you get the slippy mat, and you get an hour and a half of Shirley. Beautiful. Now, did you want to do the foot on, the, on their own as well? Angela here. Dearest Shirley, do you remember me? Oh, Hello, Angela go. there. Come I on, love you. your rulers, Thank and you. I am on my sixth pars bag. <laughs> last year at the NEC. Are you there in March? No. I'll be there as, as on your side of the counter. Yeah. I'll be there on Thursday. Thursday. I think it's Thursday the 17th, is it? Is it the 17th? Something like next Thursday, next Thursday. I'll be there on next Thursday as well, on a microphone. You'll hear me before you see me. Oh, gosh. <laughs> you don't need a microphone for that. Oh, oh very Get out. Yes. <laughs> out. Right, so do you want to do the feet on their own, did you say? No? Bears, bears, bears. bears. Right, so bears. let's do bears standing up, first of all. Standing bears. Standing okay. bears. Okay. Now you get three rulers in here. Yes, you do, and they are in order. Number one does the body. Number two does both sides of the legs and arms. And number three does the underscore yeah. and the inner ear of the teddy bear. Right. So are we ready? Yes, please. We're going to start with number one. So we're going to stitch round. And there's a little mark there. 
can you see that? Let's have a look. We're just coming in yeah. now. There's Where's a little the mark, mark here. Mark? Oh, yeah, like a little arrow, yeah, arrow, chevron, chevron. Shall I chevron, that up yeah, so yeah. that you can see it? Yeah. Where has it gone, Shirley? There, we go. there it is. The, above well, there, Teddy. There's the mark. Above Teddy there's there. There's the mark. Right, okay? Yeah. So, we're going to stitch at the start mark. And again, snuggle. Yeah. And stitch. Round and out to the mark. Stop with the needle down. Now, on the feet, you will notice when you're stitching, that there are three little cutouts. And you stitch until the cutout meets that mark because that's where the needle is. Right. So when you slide it over and put your pattern pieces on, we can now stitch out and do the other side of Teddy. And I went out a little bit there, so I'm just... I'm accommodating my mistake. Okay. All right? Bring her out. So there's our body. Right. I'll take his whirly gig out the way. You would finish it off properly. Yeah. So that's number one. Right. Number two. And we can see the lines. Yeah. Hang on a sec. There you go. Perfect. Yeah, you can see the lines. Looks like a praying see the mantis. Lines. Okay. Yeah. Right. So now we're going to fix that. And I'm, first of all, on these rulers, because there are three rulers, you're going to stop and start. Yeah. Okay? Now, if you're lucky enough to have a machine with a cutter, that's great. If not, just pull it out. And... Yeah. Right, so set it up for doing the ear, and we're going to stop there. Just the ear now. Just the ear. So stitch your first ear. Needle down. Cut, if you've got a cutter. Yeah. Bring her down and stitch. Oh, so not just doing the ear. And then. just give the arm. Right. Cut. Yeah. Bring her down and stitch the leg. So it's left ear, left top arm and left leg. Or left arm and leg, yeah. And now the right inner foot right. leg. Okay. Okay. So you're just going round the body, really. Ear, yes. arm, leg, leg. Yes. Now... We're going to, I'm going to cut those threads to get them out of the way. Because yeah. we don't want them to look untidy, do we, John? No. We don't want them to be tidy. Right, so now... So I say my room is yeah. full of cotton. Bring it round. Turn so you've her turned over. over. You've turned turn her over. over. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Line her up. I'm lining the legs. Yeah. And I'm lining the ear. Yeah. Bring her down. Snuggle. Yeah. Stitch your second ear. Yeah. Cut the thread. Come along. Stitch the right, left arm, whichever way right you're looking arm. at it. <laughs> or left. Oh, it's left. Yeah. Left, isn't it? yeah. Bring it down. Now we're doing the other side of the leg. So bring her round to produce that leg. Yeah. Okay. Cut. Bring her up. And we're going to produce the inside of that leg. Yeah. So bring her round. Right. So now all that's missing arm. is the inner ears and the bottom of the arms. Okay? Yeah, it looks so like that's on dancer, number three. Oh, okay. Just get, you would do this all when you've finished, but yeah. I want you to see the beauty of them. Number three. Yeah. Okay. So bring it up. And we're doing the inner ear. Right. So it's just shy of the outer ear, which gives it the character. Cut. Bring her round mm -hmm. and stitch to the arm that you've already stitched. And on this one, turn. Yeah. And we're going to do exactly the same on the other side. Uh-huh. Inner ear. Inner ear. Cut. Mm -hmm. It seems a bit of a faff, no. but I wouldn't advise somebody to buy this ruler, this set of rulers, if you've never done ruler work before. Oh, okay. I wouldn't, yeah. because it's you've got to you've got to know how to read the ruler. Yeah. I'm only being honest. No, if no, we like that. If you want to buy it, please do, but you don't have to buy it initially. Right. Where are we? 
What are you staring at? Okay. What do you mean staring at? <laughs> right, Joe? So that's, that's, that's the standing. That's the standing, standing, standing telly. Tending. Tending. So that one there is forty four ninety nine. You get three rulers. Uh, for your standing telly, teddy. Then we could do the sitting down teddy bear. Sitting teddy, and again, one, two, three. Really. So, do you know what the sitting down one's more popular than the standing up I one? I love, I love his belly. I really do. Yeah. It's, it's a teddy bear. It's finish one. Finish one's here. Yes, she's a real. Mm. Oh, stop it! I do love teddy bears. It'd be nice if he was made of chocolate. Who'd want to eat a teddy bear? Oh. You can't cuddle it after you've eaten No. Right, so. So you start. Rule of one. Bring it round. Makes absolutely no sense to you whatsoever while you're doing this. Okay. But actually, oh, no. there's the arm. The and that's the foot. Oh, okay. Bring it over. Put your lines on. Just be patient. Put your lines on. I've got my start and I've got that line lined up and I've yeah. got my finish. Lovely. Okay? There is no rush to make a teddy bear. No. Because you want him cuddled and beautiful. And there's his belly. Oh. <laughs> oh. Absolutely gorgeous. That's lovely. Right. Let me just take away his twizzle bits. That's number one. Yeah. Number two. Yeah, you're right, it doesn't look anything like a teddy bear yet. No, it does doesn't, it? does it? But as soon as you put this on, right. bring it round, you can see where everything fits. Yeah. So we're going to do the ear, and again, I'm going to cut. I'm not going to attempt to stitch down the head at the same time, because we've already got the head there. Yeah. So don't, don't worry about that. Bring it round and do your first ear. Cut. Mm -hmm. Bring her down. And now we're going to put that lovely, delicious arm on. Right. Which is just hidden behind the belly. Yeah. Now we can come out and we can do our foot. I just love this teddy bear. Uh, I really do. He's just... Still gorgeous. doesn't look like a teddy, though. Half of him does. Yeah. Turn him over. What am I doing? Oh, no, you want room to three now, do you? Yes. Don't you love Bruce shouting at you again? He, went, well, he does. I know. <sighs> Very often. Right, line take, up your belly. I take no notice. No, exactly. <laughs> How long have you two been together? We've just celebrated 56 years. <gasps> 56 years married? Mm. My word. Mm. Two lifetimes. Two lifetimes. Two lifetimes, yeah. Bring it round. Right, here. Cut. Bring it down. Now then, bring it round to the bottom of the arm and then out to his paw. So I can't work out how he works, he says. I really can't. Oh, look at him. <laughs> He's beautiful. And it says something after doing all these rulers all these years, 10 years. I still get excited about it. Yeah. Right, now then we're going to put his pads on. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Because he's not a teddy bear with eight pads. No. So I line up one. Yeah. We're still on ruler three, though, aren't still we? Still on ruler yeah. three, yes. Bring it round and make the teddy foot. And again, with that one, you could put a different fabric underneath oh, the ears yeah, of the teddy bear. Oh, yeah, of course you could, yeah. Okay. Oh, it's only got on one... F oh, no, it's got on both feet, both feet. Well, he's sitting down, isn't yeah, he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We thought that one Chilly might be boy. facing in a different direction. Chilly well, he'd be disjointed. <laughs> <laughs> Bring it round. And there you go, ladies. I bought the right rulers this time. Yeah. And no Bruce shouting. Last time I didn't, and he did tell me off. Terribly. Did he? It was all my fault. How very dare he. Right, so she's sitting down, t uh, Teddy Bear. You get three rulers for forty-four ninety-nine. Look at that, Tommy. Yeah, all right. I'm going to leave her caressing Tommy. his tongue. <laughs> so I'm coming back here because... Because? Yeah, so this is the bundle here, right? So what you get in the bundle... Have you got the low or the high in at the moment? Low, okay. So you've got the low... So what you get in here is you get your four buttons, which... You're, uh, 
the, on the USB stick, it'll explain that. You've got the USB stick with an hour and a half of Shirley explaining. You've got the ship, slippy mat. You've got the uh, foot. And then you get four rulers. You get a straight one. You get your vines and ropes cables. You get your circles. And you get your hearts. They all come, which we'll show you in a second. £99.90. and pence. Have you got these or do you want me to bring them over? Oh, you've got them. I've got them. Yeah. 99 pounds and 99 pence, right? Uh, we've also got exactly the same with high shank. Exactly the same with high shank. And we'll show you now what those rulers can do. I've oh, got a question. Also, you said there was a lovely one as well for Shirley. Oh, right. Oh, hang on. Question. Uh, John, is... <laughs> <laughs> Is the under 680? I'm not laughing at you. Who's it, Maureen? It's because uh, it's the only one Hannah can remember. John, is the under 680 high or low? I've looked on some websites. The answer varies. Maureen from Derbyshire. It's high, Maureen. It's high because it's the machine I've got and it's the only one it's Hannah the can one remember. I'm doing. It's a it's high one you're shame. doing, yeah. The one. Oh, got an announcement for us. Okay. Both of the... Both these bundles are about to sell out. The beginner bundles. Gosh. I love you. Okay, we're going to try and get some more now, but they will be extended delivery. So how many have I got physically got left of them now? Two of the high shank, one of the low shank. So if you're really quick, check out now. Otherwise, you'll have to go on to extended delivery, which will be 10-day delivery. And also, surely you'll have to make some more of these because they haven't got any of these left, have they? That's the thing that's holding it up, you see. Even I knew that. <laughs> right, so that was that. Yeah, and then I'll go over to Shirley and talk to... You. Oh, here you go. Shirley, I'm there on Thursday. Oh, it's the 13th. How amazing is that? Also, as a customer, uh, you have transformed my life. I've been saying for 74 years from Angela. Thank you, darling. Oh, that's nice. That's so she'll see you on Thursday. You on Thursday. And what was the next question, did you say? Oh, 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 oh. here you go. Uh, morning, John and Shirley. What would be the best rulers for a beginner? These! These in the bundle. But we've got them individually. If you want to buy them individually, we have got them individually as well. Start with the uh, oh, straight yeah, we can line. Run them. What, what? If you're going to buy them individually, start with the straight line. There you go. One. Start with the straight line. And the next one would be the circle. Okay. Because so there's the, the, this one here is your straight line. Yeah. The what? Oh, yeah, yeah, the USB's in the bundle. It's the only way you can get the bundle. Mm. Right, fourteen ninety nine. that ruler. This is the one you want to start with. It, uh, I would buy the, that's the set, the kit, but, yeah. the kit. But if you've already got the foot, then this is your best ruler to start with, your, your straight line ruler. And you don't just do straight lines with it. Look at this. Not Once you're up and running, you'll be able to do this. Absolutely. That's a straight line ruler, that one. So simple. You're just sewing straight lines. Sewing straight lines. It's incredible. It's a, what do you call it? A Zentangle. Zen Who? Zentangle. Zentangle, right? So that's that one. Then what was the second one, did you say, Cheryl? Well, circles. Circles, because which is this circles, one. circles, you can do four sizes of circle. You can do clamshells, the most recognised quilt pattern. You can do vines and leaves and flowers. It's... All for 15 99 All the rulers will do so many different things. Just turn them. Turn them. Turn them. Oh, sorry, Julie. I've left my mug on that table. Sorry. <laughs> well, I left it there so Dan didn't smash it. Now Julie will smash it. You watch. <laughs> right, yo. That's that one. And then next one, what would you say was the third one? I've got um, vines and things or hearts. Well, Either. I'll show you the hearts now. And you hearts. We're doing the hearts mind. now. Okay. So this is hearts. And again, you can set them in different ways so that you can make flowers like this. There's only one of each bundle left. There's only one of each. We, there will be more. We have to write a new code and everything for them. And it's Ian, so it could be next Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs> and that'll be extended delivery. Right. And then we've also got cables and vines. And then I'll come over to Shirley. Right. OK. So we're going to do the heart. And that's a, that's a sample of what you can do with the heart ruler. Right. OK. Did you see all that? Yes, you did. Well done. Now, I'm going to do... Look at me, tidying up as you go. No, I need you in my house. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do, a, do a column range. of hearts. Okay? This, is that what you're doing? Yes, that's what I'm doing. Can you see that? Okay, yep, yeah, lovely. Okay. So, Get on with we're it. starting at the elbow yeah. and we're stitching up to the curve. 
needle down, slide. Keep the ruler square, because at this moment you've not got any lines to match up. No. So keep the ruler square and stitch up. Oh, so you're doing the column of hearts, yes. yes. Needle down yeah. and slide. Yeah. Keep her square and stitch. And if you keep her square, each heart will come out of the centre of the previous heart. Right. Slide her up. I'll do one more. Now we're going to come back down to the way to complete the heart. Yeah. So bring her all the way around and put your line on. Right. That's the important line because that brings that stitching line into the centre. Yeah. Which means that you're going to join up exactly where you should. Needle down and slide. Line on and stitch. Needle down and slide. Line on and stitch. Just be beautiful. Slide. Absolutely gorgeous. What? Yeah. You see Bruce in there. What's he doing? I can't tell you what he's saying. What's he saying? Oh, for God's sake. Now, that's a good border. Yeah. You can do another border. Modest, are you? Good border, that one. You can do another border by stitching the full length of the ruler all nice. the way along from start to finish. Oh, yeah. Needle down. Slide. Right. Now, you've got a space between each heart. But each heart is at a special distance to right. the last heart. Oh, you get the straight line across the bottom. Yes. Oh, lovely. And slide. And you can do this in two different sizes. Remember, yeah. you've got the small heart as well. Lovely. And to finish that line off, you just come along and stitch that one heart. Oh, yeah. Okay? Yeah. And do exactly the I same over there. The same the beginning, yeah. don't you? Now then, I'm going to use the small heart, but that just... Beautiful, Just perfect. Look at the precision of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same on the back. Yeah. Right. What you can do? Let's do the small heart. You can do exactly the same with the small heart, but right. this time I'm going to make a flower. Okay. Which okay. is what? One of these? No. One of those. A dressed lotus. Isn't that beautiful? Beautiful. Mm. So mm. I'm, what I'm go actually going to do is a panzer. Okay. Flower. Are you? So we're stitching round. Needle down, slide around. I'm going to cut that and get her out of the way. Put your line on and stitch. Yeah. Now then, such is the precision that if you turn it north, south, east and west, you can nuzzle yeah. the hearts against each other so that you can produce a four-leaf clover. A shamrock. Precision, you say? Yeah. So that's a shamrock. Finishing. And a four-leaf clover. Now then, if we take the ruler, turn her, and do three staggered lines. Yeah. It's now going to turn into a panzer. And if you do it with the random dyed threads, yeah. you get the most beautiful effects. And if you do it with the glitter thread on the bottom... Even more. Absolutely gorgeous. Well, that could make Christmas rose as well, couldn't it? You could make it into Christmas roses. Yes. I'm, I'm hesitating there because on the... Snowdrop, uh, the snowflake ruler. I've made it so that you can do um, a Tudor rose. Oh, nice! And if you yeah. put a circle in the middle, it's a poppy. And perfect. Beautiful. Yeah, we're not doing Christmas today. No, we're not. But I'm just saying. Yeah. You can just trying to get yourself booked for another show, aren't you? That's what you do. Well, when I do Christmas, John, I can do this, this, and this. Oh, look! That, that all they're all worth their weight in gold. That is worth its weight totally, in half in gold. Totally, totally. Should we do the circle? Uh, I've got to go back there for a minute. But oh, OK. Get ready for the circle, because we've only okay. got two minutes. OK. That'll be a very, very quick circle. OK. Both starter bundles have sold out. <laughs> but I've got them on extended delivery, both of them. But they've got a different code number. Different code numbers before. Hi, Shank. Oh, is it not a different code number? 
Oh, oh, I thought you said Rian was making a new one. Oh. Doesn't matter anyway. This is, yeah, it's a different code, it's different code, right? So now this is the extended delivery one. This is 10 day extended delivery because all the others are sold out. You're having a very busy day, Shirley, today. We have. It's been very good today. It's fantastic, hasn't it? You'll have to come back. It's anyway, look, so you get four rulers, you get your four buttons, you get your... The, the reason it's on a 10-day thing is Shirley's got to re-record re this for all the people who are coming in. And then that and that and that. So you get all of that for £99.90, uh, split pay. Two-way split pay, £49.95. That's your high shank. We've also got low shank on extended delivery. Maybe you get all four of these rulers and you get the buttons and you get the uh, USB stick and you get the foot and you get the slippy thing. Oh, June, June, uh, if you yeah. want to know you, what, what uh, shank you are, we need more than just the make. Like, can't just put Janome or Singer or Elna or whatever. We need, we need the model need number. The model. Need the model number. And you have to be quick, so only got, they're going home in a minute. <laughs> uh, that, did you get your Subway breakfast? Boosted. Yes. Boosted, yeah, yes. boosted. Did he I get his egg and bacon? I had, yes, he did. Uh, what's I your? had breakfast biscuit. Is that all you had? Yes. Is that all you let you have? Um, yeah. Oh, dear. Make, make sure he buys you a lovely lunch on the way home. Anyway, <laughs> that's your uh, low shank, low shank, low shank, low shank. Right. Uh, right, shall we quickly, 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 quickly we've only I'm got minutes, do, so let's do a circle. I'm going to do so. Don't mind if we go a little bit over, because it's only me on my own in the okay. next bit, but there you go. Right, so right. we're going to do a half circle. Yeah. Stop with the needle down and yeah. slide. Yeah. Snuggle and stitch to the line. Yeah. Needle down and slide. Yeah. Snuggle and stitch. The snuggle on this pattern is most important. Right. Because it's a very precise pattern. When you come to the end of the line, stitch to that long line that comes down the middle and stitch to there. Stop with the needle down, slide that line and put it into the dip on the first row. Yeah. And that produces your first clamshell. Needle down and slide. Put the line in the centre and stitch. Needle down and slide. Put the line in the centre and stitch. I'm listening. Needle down, a little bit of fairy dust. Slide, stitch to the line. Perfect clamshells in four different sizes. Now I'm going to come out of there because I know they're going to chase me off in a minute. Now. They are. That's why so, your table's being cleared while you're sitting I there. I know. So now I'm going to make a petal. Yeah. And if I turn the ruler and put a line up there, that turns it into a leaf. Stitch your second leaf, bring it down to the centre and put your line up. Turn, yeah. bring her out and we can now put our vine over the quilt. Yeah. And I'm going to do one flower and then they're going to kick me out, ladies. <laughs> bring it round and I'm going to stitch my second petal. Use the curve, yeah. tuck her behind the first petal. Bring her down in the centre of the channel and you'll re-stitch that line. Bring her round. Make your third petal. Remember you can do this in four different sizes. Yeah. The small um, clamshell is absolutely gorgeous on the front of bags. Now I'm going to do one circle and that's me done for the day. Bring it down and stitch a circle. Lovely. Now, remembering I was rushed, ladies, Oi. but look at that perfect pattern. Gorgeous. Have you got that? There you go. It's perfect. Just coming close up. There you go. On. Right. I'll go back and say bye to Shirley in a minute. Low shank bundles in at the moment. So you get the four rulers, so you get the buttons, you get the USB stick. I've already packed the USB stick away, look. Uh, the, <laughs> the foot and the slippy slidey thing. Uh, Juki TL220QVP. Oh, right. OK, Louise, you need to contact Bruce and Shirley separately about that one because you need a special foot for that one. So don't get, the, don't get either of these. Speak to them directly. Ooh. Let's, oh, don't we fall off the stool? The balloons. <laughs> uh, how can you tell what shank I would need for a butter risk machine? Butter risk. Oh, can you tell shank. me? Can, can low, shank. low shank. Low shank, low shank. She knew that one, butter risk. Uh, that was Patricia. Well done, Patricia, my love. Uh, hi, both. Which shank do I need for the brother? FS 180 QC, please, from June. Low shank. Low shank, low shank. She's joining in now. She's going home, isn't she? 
680 plus, that's a high shank. That's a high shank. Uh, you got the low shank bundle on? Yeah, right. So what you get in the low shank bundle is you get the low shank foot, you get the USB stick, you get the four buttons, you get the slippy slidey thing, and you get the four rulers. Nine times, now it's 10 day extended delivery, this one. Remember that, because all the other ones sold out. <coughs> 10 day extended delivery, right? L then the other one, the low shank. High shank, even high shank. There you go. Exactly the same, just a different foot. Make sure you watch the USB stick before you start, because when you put this on, you need to either move this little bit up or down. You only have to do it the once, and once it fits your machine, it's on. £99.90, two-way split pay. Oh, you can have... Right. Are we done? Oh, no. Mm. Elna yeah. 720, high or low? We think it's... Oh, will be, will be, will be, because it's nine millimetres, will Nine. And the 680 is as well. Uh, so you'll see Shirley at Sewing for Pleasure on Thursday the 13th, but not on a stall. No. She's wandering round. She'll have her entourage carrying <laughs> her bags and everything like that. Do you know when you're in here next? No, no idea. Oh, honestly. It'll be a surprise. It will be. She yes. normally texts me going, I'm on this day, you on. That's what she normally does. <laughs> Anyway, it's lovely to see Andrew you and looking Joe. so well because everyone knows you've had a bit of a tough time, but you're looking brilliant again. And we'll see you on Thursday. Thank you. Show. Bye, folks. Uh, don't you go anywhere, though, because I'm back in a few minutes with uh, X ride backing and some wadding. I won't fit it all in. I'll see you in four. <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Eval Makatamne. I'm a patchwork and quilter. And what do I do the rest of the time? The rest of the time, I actually own and try and manage village fabrics in the town of Wallingford. How did I start my sewing and journey? Well, I've been sewing since as long as I can remember. I started out dressmaking with uh, my mum and my big sisters. And since then, I've tried my hand at most things and have finally ended up with patchwork and quilting. And I think that's probably due to one of Elner Burns' Quilt in a Day books. Let me assure you, you don't make a quilt in a day. But it's been a passion of mine for the last 25 years and I'm still at it, so there's hope for us all. So what do I enjoy sewing? Well, I like to do a bit of most things, to be honest, but my favourite thing is anything to do with my Japanese fabrics. So as you can see, we've moved to a different part of the shop and here we are in another of my favourite corners. And I really enjoy combining the lovely Japanese fabrics with some hand stitching and um, hand quilting. So I've moved to the permanent Christmas room at my shop here and as you hopefully can tell this is quite a large shop here so most of my time is uh, involved in keeping this running successfully so i don't really have a lot of time for claims to fame so what i suppose i could say um is that my claim to fame is actually managing to manage john scott um, I'm sure he'll take that the way it's meant, so um, love you lots, John. My top tip is that children's colouring in books are a really valuable resource whenever you're crafting. You've got nice, clear outlines that can become templates for your applique work, or you can transfer them and use them as quilting patterns. I can't draw, but I can create lots of things using bits and pieces from things like children's colouring in books. Give it a try. Here at Sewing Street, we only charge one P&P throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the combine order button. Remember, standard P&P is £3.95. Charges may differ for outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option for £5.95 on certain items. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Sewing Street app. Head over to your app store now and search Sewing Street and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. 
Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's bestsellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the Schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching on the go with Sewing Street. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to sewing or a seasoned pro, you're sure to learn something new. We're live every day from 8am till 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Did you know at Sewing Street that on various products we offer split pay? That means on certain items, you can spread the cost over two, three, four, or sometimes even five interest-free monthly payments. Just pay the first instalment when you purchase and you're away. So shop your way with Split Pay. Before I start, before I start, I've got a couple of messages. April says, the brother F420 Innovus. Low or high, Hannah? Low, right? And then Ellen says, uh, Atelier 4. High, 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 high. High, high, high. Right, OK. Uh, and Layla says, thank goodness. Hooray for adoption. So glad my mum adopted me. Ah. And then she went, now she's stuck with me forever. But that's it. <laughs> right, so where am I starting? The Debbie Shaw book. Now, earlier, James was in from uh, Search Press, lovely James, who everyone kept calling him Jason for some reason, but he looks like a Jason, though, doesn't he? Anyway, Debbie Shaw, 10 years ago, did her first half-yard book. This is her 10th year anniversary edition. It's got new projects in it. It's all updated, gorgeous. Should be twelve ninety nine. This has got 30% off at £9.09. pence. So many of these sold. James got us another 100 but of that 100, 48 not checked out, 22 in baskets. So there's, 20, there's 26 really left. 26 left of those. Yeah, we, we showed you how many projects, didn't we? Because we went turned over the page like this. And there they, there they all are. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. Hannah just said that to me. We well, see it says 16 there, doesn't it? You think, oh, it's a page 16, though. 26 projects in there, all half-yard heaven, easy sewing projects using leftover pieces of fabric. Now, it only published on the 1st of March, right? 1st of March. It's only the 7th of March today, and already, for today, we've taken off 30%. Now, also, remember, if you buy any of these books today, your names will go in a virtual hat, and James will send you... 10 other books completely for free, not including the one you've paid for. So whatever you've bought, you'll get those and you'll pay for those. In addition to that, he'll put in for one person, 10 extra books. And if you win, do let us know. Because last time I was asking him going, you didn't say you. And he said, I have sent them, I have sent them. And we just didn't know. Long River, Long River, how much is that? 12.83, 12.83. That's a funny old price, isn't it? Not good. It doesn't even say discount. Oh, it's gone. Anyway, nine pounds and nine pence. There it is. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Lovely. You love your Debbie Shaw books. She has a lot of books. What is it? Nine thousand million hundred copies. Eight hundred thousand books she sold so far. I know she was on Rainbow. She was Zippy's girlfriend. Was she in Coronation Street? Didn't she play get Ken Barlow's girlfriend in Coronation Street as well? Oh, 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 oh.
That wasn't that Coronation Street? Okay. Anyway, nine pounds and nine pence. Do you remember a Mensa? And she used to look after peacocks. You know an awful lot about Debbie Shaw. Nine pounds and nine pence. <coughs> <coughs> she, oh, she does collect, I knew that. She, kept, she collects cow creamers, which is milk jugs shaped as cows. To you and me. Anyway. Oh, it's sold out again. Once you're all checked out, that's it, gone. So if you've got it in your basket, check out, check out, check out, check out, check out. Beautiful. Now, we also had a deal. During, we had other deals. Well, I'll go back and look at them. But this was a fantastic deal. Well, no, no, because we're not going to do them now, are we? See, this one was so popular. This is where you choose two books for £15. Right, over 300 people have taken advantage of this offer. Now, you can buy them all individually if you wanted to. But why would you when you can choose any two of these for £15? But on the whole, they're 12 99 each. Now, when you click on it, it looks like it's just a beginner's guide to crochet. But you see the box here? They're all of them there. So what you need to do is you need to click on the books and it goes down there on the drop down and you click on the two that you want for your £15. So shall I just tell you, these are brand new. These were only launched in January and they are Search Press's fastest selling books ever. I know that we were on, oh, hang on. Is it limited or gone? Oh, yeah, yeah, limited there, limited there. That one's now limited. And the other one that was limited was um, the Sarah Payne Quilt School was limited earlier, wasn't it? Oh, there it is. Maybe those are the two favourites. For uh, Who knows? But anyway, those two are both limited. But you can choose any of these. Right, now there's 200 people in baskets with this, of this deal. Now remember, at midnight you'll be chucked out of the basket. Or if someone else checks out before you do, you don't get it. Ooh. So this here is your beginner's guide to knitting. Easy techniques and eight fun projects. Should be £12.99. But you're getting it really for £7.50, aren't you, if you buy two books, when you buy two books. Bunting, blankets... Beautiful. Hang on. Is that was that basket weave? Hang on. Look. Baby blanket. Doesn't say what the actual knitting is, does it? Anyway. It's beautiful though, isn't it? Oh, Hannah came in wearing one of those this morning. A oh, hooker headband, yeah. Keeping her hair. Keeping her hair in check. Ribbed beanie hat there. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, Dan. Dan, Dan, look. We could all knit you a hat, Dan. Was it, was it the pink or the orange? Oh, I don't know where it's gone now. Anyway, beanie hat in there. Beautiful. You can have mitten match. He doesn't need those, though. So that's your beginner's guide to knitting. There's also a beginner's guide to crochet. Very, very... Oh, look. Right, now, single figures of this one now. And believe me, when I say we had loads, we had loads. Oh, there's another beanie, a crocheted beanie. I don't think he'd like that one. Pom-pom off. That makes it a non be. No, it's a pom-pom. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, very, very popular. <coughs> Beautiful. Then we've got pull thread embroidery. Now, look, this one's meant to be £17.99. You're only paying £15 for two, right? That's a brilliant deal. Pull thread embroidery there. There's so many people got these in their baskets. And more people joining now. You need to check out. Oh, you got to pick two. What do you say? You can pick four or you can pick six. Thinking multiples of two. Yeah, no, no, because they're, they're, they're um, battery ones. No, they are. That's a battery one there. That one there, do you see the bulb? Beautiful. Anyway, so that's that one. There's also Girl with a Sewing Machine, Jennifer Taylor. We've also got Wire Jewellery. 
Now, it might not be you that wants this, but that should be twelve ninety nine on its own there. Gifting for jewellery maker. This is really popular. Debbie Shaw and her daughter, Kimberly Hind. 20 stylish sewing projects from pre-loved clothes and homewares. She's even put a picture of what they're from. Look, there's husband's... Oh, five pairs of jeans. Five pairs of jeans. Well, that's what we were saying earlier. Only your jeans. Then that's your old... Um, oh, is there a picture of it? Oh, no, she hasn't put a picture of that one. Um, there's Debbie's old jacket. One pillowcase, one shirt. Tea towels. Right, this one Hannah likes. But look, we've seen Debbie in that dress. We've seen her, haven't we? She wears a jacket, a little jacket with it normally. She's like a little um, leather jacket with, it, with that one, bomber jacket. Um, look, what's that one made out of? Oh, there you go, child sweatshirt. So it's brilliant, isn't it? Then Sarah Payne, lovely Sarah Payne. Uh, her quilt school, new ways to start patchwork and quilting. You see, now that one sells for twelve ninety nine as well. You're getting two books for fifteen pounds. Gorgeous. There's right. I knew she did. I'm not going to show you because you'll just photocopy it. She does in here charts for like flying geese, and she does charts for square triangles and things like that. Not rude. It wasn't rude. I didn't want you to photocopy it, screenshot it, and then. Felted animal knits. 20 keep forever friends to knit. Hang on. Oh, no. Knit, felt and love. So it's knitting and felting in there. Debbie was in Brookside as Barry Grant's girlfriend. That's what you're thinking of, Hannah. Oh, it's not. Crossroads. Is she that old? Now, it's funny, I didn't see her in the Nolly story. Did you watch the Nolly story? I didn't see Debbie Shaw in it, did you? No. I've no, never been an extra. Apart from when I've been working on films, they go, oh, we need some fat bloke sitting in the corner. Oh, John, go and just sit over there. <laughs> I don't think I've ever done any close-ups, no. No. 12 I have to think about that one. I don't think so. Oh, no, that was a proper acting job, that one. Full roll, that one was. I couldn't do it because the girl got COVID, didn't she? Anyway, twelve ninety nine. Right, you choose. You choose which two you want for fifteen pounds. Beautiful. Oh, sorry, my cup's in the shot there. Sorry. I don't want Dan to smash it. That's all. Is he? Is he angry? Right, now, if you don't check out, you miss out. Don't blimp, don't come crying to me. Do not come crying to me if you miss out. I tried to tell you, there's over 200 people with this deal in their basket. John, I cannot find the Quilt School book on the web. Please, can you put the graphics on screen? June, right, it's in the bundle. What you do, right, is you go to the website. The bundle has got the crochet book as the front page. Then you click on book, right? Then what you do is, there it is, Sarah Plains Quilt School, you click on that. Then you click on the other one that you want. Add to, our, sorry, add to basket. Then go back and choose the other one that you want. Say the beginner's, oh, beginner's guide to knitting. Add to basket. You go to the basket. To we can't do that because she's not, she's not logged in. Uh, you go to check out and it knocks them both down to £15. There you go. Anyway, tw add £12.90. Well, then... then the RRP says twelve ninety nine, but some of them aren't, right? This fourteen ninety nine, that one. That's twelve ninety nine. That's twelve ninety nine. That's fourteen ninety nine. That's seventeen ninety nine. That one's twelve ninety nine, and they're twelve ninety nine. But you're getting two for fifteen pounds, for goodness' sakes. Thank you, Dan. The people are going to miss out. If you don't check out, you're going to miss out. That's all I'm saying. Oh, William Morris, X-ray back in Larkspur. Do you want those, Tanner? Thank you. Oh! Uh, 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 four colours. One, two, three. I'll do this one first. Do this one first. Yeah, yeah, I think you might have done. Right, here we go. This is gorgeous. I've not seen this one before. Extra wide backing. Victorian Albert Museum, make and believe. 
That's a different pattern. That's not Larkspur. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay. That's beautiful. And that will go with so many of the William Morris quilts that we do. Ha that's nice on its own. That's just nice on its own, like cushions and bedding and things like that. The cushion. Oh, she was in Emmerdale, Peak Practice and Heartbeat. But no, Hannah still thinks she was in Crossroads. Beautiful. She must have been a child in Crossroads, though, must she? Oh, here's Becky with her blonde hair. Not. She said to me, oh, I've made on blonde next week. I've made on blonde. She's natural blonde. She came in yesterday and she went, look, look, look. It's exactly the same. No, it's been lightened. It's black still. Still black. Yeah. Right, here we go. She should put her curling tongs on it today. Right, this is gorgeous. What code is this? I imagine it's natural, but I can't. Let me see if I can find the code. There you go. QRVT35. Yeah. Beautiful. Larkspur in natural. 12.99 for half a metre. If she was in peak practice, she was in with Simon Shepherd. He was peak practice, wasn't he? Heartbeat was the boy off uh, EastEnders. Every loser wins. Who was that? Da, 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 da. No, no, no. He, that, no, that wasn't he singing Heartbeat. He had to pop. When he was in EastEnders, he had a tune at number one. Every loser wins. That one. I think he was called Nick something. Got to move on. Oh, oh, oh. No, the whole table is set up. For a hobby maker, and it's got all Julie's cards, all perched like that. And I threw fabric at Dan, and it went over the top of Dan. And I was like, uh oh, it's fine. White. Larkspur in white. It, it's, it's, I'd say it was ivory more than white myself. 12 99 William Morris VA Larkspur, white X ray backing, 108 inches, 12 99 It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful cotton, this. I'm not going to throw that one. Then I've got another William Morris, but it's Willow in the black. Oh, that's nice. Uh, Hayley bought these. Yeah. Uh, no, no, no. She didn't buy it to take home. She bought them for the show. Willow Bow in black. Thank you, John. Got my two books. June, you're more than welcome, my love. You're more than welcome. Okay, lovely. Yeah, rainbow stripes. Di diagonal, these, yeah. Digital. Diagonal. Diagonal. Oh, ooh, nice. 108 inches wide. Oh, Julie's back. Shh, 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 shh. He knocked them over, not me. Look at her face. Uh, 12.99. Twelve pounds and ninety-nine pence. We've got to get off, haven't we? In a minute. What time do I have to do the menu? Hannah wants to stay all afternoon. Well, you can do. Cat won't mind. Is Cat producing this afternoon? Who was she showing round earlier? Anyway, look, tumbling blocks. Thirteen ninety-nine. That's lovely. Isn't it? See, that make a lovely dress. That would as well. 108 inches right. I have no idea why she's singing that song. 13.99. No. Go home and have a good long sleep before tomorrow. And then I've got this rainbow one. Psychedelia. Daddy Adam or Handsome Adam? Daddy Adam, oh. This is Pop Dot, this one. Pop Dot Ombre. Nick Berry. Nick Berry, there you go. Every loser wins. Thank you, Layla. Right, shall we have a look at tomorrow's menu? We've got to go. Hobby Maker are ready to start. Tomorrow, we've got the new fabric collections at 8 o'clock. New-ish, that should say. Uh, then Catherine Wright's in it now. Catherine Wright's brand new dress pattern. The easy and elegant. Uh, with Catherine Wright. With, now, I've got to tell you that Jess has bought amazing fabric. She's over the moon with the fabric she's bought for that hour. She, there's lots of them, 
that she's over the moon with the fabric that I have. Then at 10 o'clock, we've got sewing room tools. Then at 11 o'clock, we've got sewing perfect little bags and totes book with Catherine Wright. 12 o'clock, overlockers. We will see you tomorrow at 8 o'clock. Julie Peplow's got, what are you making? Carnation crafts. Carnation, carnation or coronation? Carnation. carnation crafts coming straight up after break. Do not miss it. Try and see Becky's black blonde hair if you must. Uh, and I'll see you tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. <laughs> Keep up to date with what's on Sewing Street as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. Head on over to www.sewingstreet.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, 